have white jerseys this year and they've started the tournament with them on, uh, which is pretty sweet. Um, they're actually a lot nicer than the green ones, which begs the question, why don't they wear the green ones more often? Um, so uh, this is the first game. Uh, games in this tournament in the group stage are 15 minutes. And... So, um, sorry about that, I was just getting a little tutorial on some of the, the, the equipment we've got here, make sure I get it right um, for you guys. And we're getting a wave here, oh you can't see it because of the, where the camera's positioned, but we're getting a wave from Lawson Glassby as a goaltender for the Sheffield Bears F for this tournament. This of course is uh, the tournament also known um, as Bearapalooza, uh, as there are three bear teams in this tournament, a bear E, F, and G. Um, so it's a pity there wasn't a B, or it would be the B, B, F, G. Uh, but the uh, the Bears F are currently on the ice. And uh, later on we'll see the G in this group. Um, ain't nothing but a G thing. And then we'll see the uh, the E's later on who are in the other group. Uh, and Nottingham have an F team, and that's their team there. They also have an E team in this tournament who are also in the other group. So, um, yeah, there's a lot going on here. We've got... Yeah, we're good, I think. <laughs> yeah. yeah, so we're ready to go, guys. We're getting uh, Horner uh, calling for the puck drop. Um, now, I have to start the clock here, so that's something for me to remember. So here we go, guys. The putt, first putt drop in Nationals 2023. Two of the uh, Bears, uh, sorry, two of the oldest sons in the BIJ, and then we're off. Nice little pass by James there. Burnham can't pick it up. Now, I may get names wrong as this, uh, at the start of this tournament. I don't have the rosters in front of me, but I, I gradually learn them and get sorted out. Oh, and that's oh, a chance for Sheffield here. Oh, oh he went the, the long way around. Perhaps took himself out of scoring position there if he just went straight ahead. But wanted to show off his edges, which is fair enough. He'll have been working hard on that all year. Um, but didn't quite get himself into scoring position by doing so. And Sheffield have another chance. Puck in the zone on the hash marks. Broken up by Burnham, who then hits the boards. He's gone into the danger zone, Burnham. He's... Uh, puck still in there, good zone presence by Sheffield, unorthodox style. Uh, not enough of kind of you could throw a net over them right now. They've spread out a little bit now. Puck passed over, good break up. Puck comes in, that's the first shot on goal for Nottingham against Nottingham. Sorry. Chance, oh it's a goal on the second shot, number 62 for Sheffield with a goal. Uh, that's 1-0 to Sheffield F. Oh, and another goal's went in. Sorry, we were just checking uh, with the new tech that uh, I had put the goal in right. So um, that was a home goal again uh, from number 66 
from number three. And it scores 2 0. And that's his, another save there for uh, the Nottingham goaltender. But knocked away. It's out of the zone now. Nottingham got quite a good defensive shape, but still very narrow. Puck just uh, playing a territorial game here. Here's it's a chance for Nottingham. Oh, beats one, falls over. Can't beat the ice though. Ice is always going to be there. Oh, break it up. Oh, double team, but it doesn't quite work out for them. And here's Bears number seven. Plays it forward. Scorer of that second goal, De Clot. Across it goes. Chance. Shot. Oh, ho, ho, ho. it's good if he was going for a field goal, but not good if he's going for a shot on net. In the danger zone now, and the ref, the ref getting himself almost involved there. Back to the point. Jones. Oh, oh it's still in the zone. Sheffield good at holding the zone in this game. It's four minutes down. Good save there by the Nottingham goaltender. Still not been a shot and goal from Nottingham on Sheffield, but Nottingham goalie has now faced five shots in this game. Letting two, oh, and, let, and there you go, six. That's number 62 again, his second goal of this one. 62 unassisted again. Uh, Clearly going to be one of the, the stars for this Nottingham, uh, sorry, Sheffield F team. Shot 60 nil in favour of uh, Sheffield at the moment. 162, another chance. Putting the body up from D there to break the play up. Up the wall, it's broken up. Kept in, James. Lawson Glasby comes out, makes a play along the ball. Wild. Fires up, 62 again. He's got to be thinking about that trick. I know that you're thinking about your team winning, but he's got to be thinking about it. Here's 14 coming through the middle of the zone. 14 shoots. Oh, big save. Covers it up. And that's Archie Wild there with a shot. 7 to nil on shot so far. Corner of the wall. Jones keeps it in. That is Jones, right? Yeah. Um, battle there. Not I'm looking to maybe get some time of relief out their zone. Oh, nice, nice break up there. Not I'm got the chance now. Ah, oh, broke up again. Hayward Sears takes a swing at it, misses it, gets it the second time. And they got the rosters in front of me, so it should get a little bit better. Puck on, nice little one two in the zone there. Oh, and that <laughs> was offside by a good bit there for Nottingham. Their first real zone entry chance. Um, the player was a good. Good three foot offside. Twenty eight viewers so far early in the morning. Clearly a lot of people didn't have a lot to do this morning. Good good for you.
Um, I've lost the rosters again because I need Nick's password. Um, puck comes up the wall. James can't quite pick it up. James now. Oh, that's not where you want to dump it, but it's worked out for him as everyone misses it. Not enough if they can, looking to get on the end of this, but Sheffield are holding on. A good little play out the, out the zone there. Flips it off the wall. Back to Jones. That's off the wall. Wild picks it up now. Wild. Makes a pass up the middle. Number 62. Oh! Ho, ho, ho. And the arms don't go up from the officials. <laughs> Maybe they forgot where they are this morning, but that looked like a penalty to me. Oh, and Wild keeps it in. Wild again in the corner with Jones. Jones going one-handed in the in the corner there. Good save there by Dando. A little bit low in her crease, but um, makes the stop. Shots now 8 to 0 in favour of Sheffield. So we down nice. Oh, oh. A wipe out there. Harewood Sues tries to clear the zone. James does well keeping it in, but there's there's no one there to follow up on that. And Sheffield will come out the zone. Nice little touch. Oh, and that's a terrific finish from number 66. His assist should be from number seven. From seven, yeah? 66 from 7. I'll make sure she gets an assist. Could play along the wall. Nice little battle. Here comes number 62. Is this is James Mountfield. Number 62. You've got to be good when you're wearing pretty much Nottingham socks and a bold blue helmet in, a Sheff in Sheffield gear. So, you know, you've got to be half decent, I think, or you, you'd be ostracised by the rest of the, the club, which is a pretty big club to be ostracised by. And how many times did I use... Oh, there we go, first shot on Glassby, and he makes a save. Shot's now 9-1 to one in favour of... in favour of the, the Bears. Oh, chance here for Nottingham, maybe. Oh, oh. Oh, Baines can't get it off. Good D from Herwood Sues again. Oh, sniper in the stands there as one of the Bears goes crashing down. Puck fired in the middle, unfortunately. That's cleared the zone. Here's Mountfield again. Mountfield. Chopping carrots. Mountfield. Oh, and there's the hat trick. I'd throw my hat, but it costs like 40 quid at a gig, so I'm not, I'm not going to. Um, and the score now five to nil. Oh, the clock, the clock. Oh, and that's that's Miles White. Good defensive break up there in front. Chance. Good save. Oh, and the secondary effort's in. 66 gets the goal again. 66, 72, 44 there on the goal. So that's uh, 66. And the clock, which I'm sure I'm butchering. 
Glad Hill uh, and 44 Beth Martin. James picks it up. Here it comes. Wild. Oh, everyone gets on side just in time for Wild. Wild trying to do his best Bobby Orr impression. Oh, and the chance in front goes begging for Mountfield. We're coming up for two minutes left in this game. Ison's waved. There is everybody stopped skating. Good call by the officials. Keep this game going. Shots at the moment 12-1 in favour of Sheffield. Oh, a nice little corner move. She Sheffield's number 80, Ashton, carries it out. Ashton, could he go all the way? Oh, he makes the move. Oh, and it's saved. Dando anticipated he was going to go short side. Up poked away there. Up the wall, Ashton keeps it in. Ashton steps in, Ashton again. Desperate get on the score sheet here is Ashton. Shot. Oh, another good save from Dando there. Well, she's definitely had her money's worth this after uh, this morning. In the first game, 14 shots. Stop now. Um, And puck back to the point. Chance for Zach Jones. Oh, he can't get it through. Puck hit up. Oh, give him another chance. Why don't you? Here's Zach Jones. Jones shoots. Oh, and it goes wide. Puck kept in by Hayward Sues, who's been a very solid back there in this game. It's like the ice is tilted a little bit here for Nottingham. They're struggling to get out of the zone. Mountfield keeps it in. Mountfield the hat-trick hero. Not sure if he'll get a tweet on that one, but still, good for him. Oh, oh, oh that was, uh, yeah. The boards, the, and you think the ice always wins, the boards definitely always win. And they played it into their own zone, didn't they? Ah, well. Um, Jones is, I don't know if he's went to congratulate the goalie on a job well done. <laughs> Puck just came to him there, and that finishes six 0 to the uh, the Bears F team. So uh, yeah, this, don't worry guys, we've not uh, been asleep. The, um, we're just, the score bug is not showing the, the shots on goal at this stage. Um, but the next game up, we've got the Leeds Griffin C against ain't nothing but a G thing, the uh, Bears G. I don't know how many times I can say that before it comes really uncool. Um, probably the twice that I've done it. <laughs> so here we go, let's see. So we've got Nick here, um, I don't know if Nick's going to jump on in a minute for a couple of seconds. No, he's not. <laughs> so here we go, Leeds versus Sheffield. Oh, and Leeds are off to the races. 
Sheffield try to clear the zone. That puck's dumped down the ice. Number 44 for Leeds going back. Philip. We'll call him. We'll call him Philip. Is, uh, what you call blowing a tyre in the trade. Right, back up there, that's what the equipment's for. I mean, it's not anticipated that people wearing all that equipment will blow their tyres all the time, but that is what it's for. Battle along the wall. Bears G come away with it. That's really bad geometry there. But the puck eventually gets cleared. And here's Ryan, he had the first sort of break in real action in this game. Off the wall, Shepard picks it up, knocks it, Churik, shot, oh and that goes wide. The, the goalie for Sheffield, I can confirm, is a monster, um, compared to the other goalies I'm used to seeing in Nationals. Speaking of monsters, here's the Butcher, oh first save for the Butcher of Nationals. Could I, how could I not talk about Rory the Butcher straight away off the bat here? Good battle in the middle of the ice. Sheffield get it in deep. We got Ryan going back for it. Ryan. Oh, can't get that pass through. Kept in by Davies. Davies did well, but it still gets cleared by uh, Ellis. Tasha Murphy. That was almost offside, I think. That's up the wall. Murphy. Tries to put it in the middle. There's no one there. No one home for that, that shot. There's only 1-0 to nil in shots so far. Not as many shots in this game. Here's Davies. in the zone again for Sheffield Drury seasoned national campaign I can't quite get that out out oh can't get the shot off Senate Senate takes a shot from there you have to get up pretty early in the morning to beat Rory Butcher at Nationals and it is pretty early in the morning for a Saturday I guess so well done to everyone who's here Doig puts in the zone Woofenden. Doig, nice stick left. Oh, but Sheffield win it back. Singari. Oh, and Doig's got a half break. Half break. Cover from D. Shot. Oh, it goes wide. She's got another chance. It's not Doig, it's Ellis. My bad. Ellis tries to find the, the high slot. Can't get it. James Ryan misses everyone. James Ryan puts the body on him. I'm not entirely sure either of them meant that. Sangari tries to get it out. Puck goes into the corner. Owen will chase back for it. Murphy for checking. Maybe you need to take a little shade out of Ellis's book there with a the stick lift. Oh, at least Corral it again. Back to the point, Ryan shoots from way out. First shot on goal against the Bears. It's one all on shot so far, despite quite a lot of action. Drury, she'll hold the zone. 
That was a little on the hands for my liking. Oh, and Ryan misses it. And that'll count as a shot on the butcher, because if he hadn't have been there, it would have went in. But if it had have went in, I think you'd have been sent home. Or at least been given a strongly worded note. And Sheffield pick it up now. Uh, game's got a little bit of shades of... Oh, and that'll be offside. The game there for just a moment had that sort of shades of, like, you've been playing a scrimmage uh, six on six for 20 minutes and you're just wanting a wee bit of a breather. So still one all in shots. In the group as itself, I know it's only been one game down, but the Bears F are definitely in the driving seat with a 6-0 victory. Back across, Shepard. Shepard, nice hands. Oh, knocked away though beautifully by, uh, is that Westerland? Can't actually see. Yes, it is Westerland. I forgot that Sheffield still have this kind of this stupid set of jerseys that have zeros in front of single numbers um, there for a moment. So I thought it said 82 and it's in fact 02. Oh, great save from Rory the Butcher there. Shot's now 3 1 in favour of Sheffield. Oh, and there's a chance! There's a chance! Shot! Oh, big save by Key. Tries to get it out of the wall. Woofenden can't get it quite out. Ryan keeps it in. Oh, and if that had been picked up, that would have been a great scoring opportunity. Ryan picks up, fires it across. Sangari's over there. Davies keeps it in, though. No. Little pass behind the back of the stick there. I'm not entirely sure if he'd done that consciously or subconsciously. Oh, and Doig almost finds another player. Griffin's now entered the zone. Great, great break up there. Flipped in the wall. Puck out. Burks. Burks. Davies is going after it now. He's got looks for the pass in the middle, but Leeds have that well broken up. And here's Ellis. Ellis carrying. He's got one to beat. Maybe too far out of the way to get a shot off. Blocked in front. Ryan keeps it in. Oh, Ryan does well, but secondary defensive effort. And Leeds... Needn't to remember the offside rule is applicable to them. When they come out. Here comes Davies. Davies beats Ellis. Davies. Hands. Shepard. Nice pass to Murphy. Murphy. Oh, Murphy can't quite get it through. Will be now. Will be rims it round. Owen, Ryan keeps it in, will be, oh that's out of the zone, Just six minutes left to play in this one, still no score in, shots 3-1 in favour of Leeds, uh, in favour of Sheffield, despite the zone time Leeds just can't seem to generate shots on goal. Oh <laughs> Leeds cleared the zone for Sheffield there. Puck goes across. Shepard's going after it. Wilby's there. Wilby fires up the wall. Sangari. Sangari flips it forward. Sangari knocks it in the. A lot of one two. It's like these two have played together for years, even though they're on opposing teams. Shepard. Shepard, nice little battle there from the Leeds player. Drury's going to cross. She's got Davies following. Both miss the puck and it falls to Owen. Drury comes in. The Butcher with the save. That's the fourth save for the Butcher. 
Whoa, here's Davies. Shot, oh, weird angle shot, oh, rebound, it's a goal! Number 32 of Leeds there. Thirty-two from thirty there on the scoring. With five minutes left, Leeds shot, shot count now four three in favour of Sheffield, but uh, Leeds are find themselves one nil up on the board. And a nice rebound goal. That was Natasha Murphy there from. Uh, I'm going to see Maxim Smurek. Apologies if I got that wrong at home. But in the first battle of Yorkshire, it will be the first of many over these next few weekends, it is Leeds that are in the in the driving seat. Doig. Doig. Oh, nice break-up. Nice defensive cover there. Ryan keeps it in. Knocked out. That could be icing, but I think there's a chance Sheffield could win the race here. Oh, good hustle from James Ryan there to make sure that icing call gets called. Sheffield now can't change. And that'll give Leeds a bit of an advantage with some fresh players on the ice. Very short bench for this Leeds team. Only, only nine skaters in total. Um, from the Leeds C, they normally have quite a lot of players across the three teams in Nationals. Uh, the Bears, they have... Over two lines, whereas their their um, their F team earlier only had nine. So a lot of teams working with short benches this this uh, this weekend so far. Murphy flips it into the middle. That's a lovely breakout play. That's how you'd like to see it drawn up. Here's Smurnik. Smurnik shot. Oh, big save by Key. And we'll get the face off in the Sheffield end. But dropped. Will be. Well, he was in the danger zone there, but it's he's managed to keep his foot in. Here's Doig. Oh, and Drury goes right past Drury there and out the zone. Sangari goes back. Sangari. Looks ahead, flips it straight down the middle of the ice. Shall we stop it with Shepard? Oh, Shepard almost picked up. Senate dumps it in. Sheffield might want to have a little bit more urgency with their forecheck here because they've, they've got to get another. They've got to get a goal to tie this up. Shepard. Shepard, nice hands. Goes to Doig. Doig flips it forward. Ellis after it. She's got two with her. If she can get the puck before Owen, no, Owen manages to clear. Goes past everyone there. Will be now. Coming up for the last minute of the game. Owen, everyone sort of stopped and looked at it apart from Sangari and Owen. Sangari rims it round. No one there for Sheffield or Leeds. Shepherd, it's out by Leeds. Pup put back in by Senate. Flipped up the middle. Shepherd, nice cross ice. Doesn't quite get through. That's a good save. Oh, it's in. It's in. I have no idea how that got in. Sheffield were at risk of uh, of um, conceding a penalty shot anyway. And it's number 18, who is Francesca Shepherd for number 30.
Sheffield, oh, they shouldn't have been so cute. They had a chance, they've got to put those shots to the net. The shot count now in favour of Leeds, as it's 6-4 on shots. Leads 2-0 to the good, even though I didn't put it on the score, scoreboard. Um, just the nine seconds left, Sheffield really need to get one right off the draw here. That's not going to do it. As time ticks away. Puck flicked out, and that's it, it's all over but the crying. So um, we'll move on to the next game, which is the uh, multi-shaded Newcastle Wildcats B take on Imperial. So uh, I'm not sure you can actually pick it up from the camera, so it's not quite as bad, but um, Newcastle got, had to change shirt supplier due to the university, and it honestly looks like uh, some child's been left to play with an editor. It's not on, it's... Uh, So we're just about to face off in this game. Um, so this is Newcastle B on the, in the Navy um, and Imperial in the white. Imperial step in. Ivan um, Shalashillin. Well, I was going to say there's a chance, but that's that's actually the wrong team. Hello, Nick. Hello. Hi. Uh, Rob was asking after you. He was saying, when are we getting Nick on comms? You can you can tell how long it's been that I put the headset on the wrong way around. Yeah, you put the headset on the wrong way around. You're also standing opposite side from where you normally do, but then... Yeah, but that's because we've entrusted you with extra buttons this year. Yeah. I don't tell anyone, but I think we might have played 10 seconds or so with, uh, with the clock not running. Um... um Oh, well, Nick's gone again. Here's Imperial now, stepping into the zone. Oh, you is disappointed in the offside. I've never seen anyone so disappointed in an offside before. Now, speaking of snoring, just uh, on a side where they're changing line, um, uh, our new players rep, Alex, had to sleep in my room last night because um, he, didn't, he didn't tell us in time what he needed. So uh, he seems quite fresh, considering. So well done. Puck not forward. Um, we're joined by Joseph in the booth, uh, and his uh, son. That was a big collision there. Oh, Jean is, is down. Here's Stephen Kent. Short, great save by Yip. Huang goes round behind her own net. She's got Kent ahead of her. Oh, good defend, a good forecheck there by Newcastle. Don't find anyone um, on the forecheck. Kent picks it up. Now, actually, Kent's jersey is a different colour from everyone else's because it's a kind of off yellow colour, um, which uh, may be a sign of him being carty. Um, so, you know. <laughs> Make it that what you will. 
think Kent's been around longer than I Sheffield, to be fair. Campbell can't get it out. Oh, it's not passed. A chance the other way. Victor Cam is in there. And these unusual guys have got his first name and then like the initial of his second name in there. Dobby, the house elf, fires it out. Puck across. Well picked up by Dobby on the on the point. All kept in. And Pino doing everything to hold his own there, but in the end, Newcastle just managed to get it out. And that is icing. Yes, it's icing. At this level, they're not going to know which side to face off. They can pick what side the face off is. So, referee, bless him, uh, whilst trying, um, <laughs> it's not going to get anywhere. Um, fired out. Shala Schillen keeps it in. It comes back out though. Here's Doby. Doby back after it. Make it. Gets his head up. He's looking ahead. Tries to make a long pass off direction. But that might have worked out anyway. Seath. And Seath holds on the puck. Good, good puck possession. And Seath, nice stick handling. Shot. Oh, and it's a goal on Yip. That's 14 unassisted there on the goal. Uh, just ignore the score bug up there. It's 1 0 to Imperial after a nice individual goal from Aaron Seath. Oh, nice use of the 3D blue line there. Nice hands by Kent. Shots currently 2 0 in favour of Imperial and they're 1 0 to the good on the scoreboard. Nice play to get out of the zone. Huang. Huang puts it in the middle. We've got Eva, Eva Harrison, a well Kent face on here. Donald Clegg, I presume, is Harry Clegg's father, brother, some kind of relation, I'm sure. You're going to have to stay pretty long to see Harry later on. Face off here. Newcastle a little bit slow on the change. It's Victor Cam. Victor Cam steps in. Can't believe he's luck. Oh, he tries to make the pass. It's with his teammate's feet there. Imperial definitely have more of the. Oh, good save by Yip. Makes the, the old save percentage look a little bit more respectable at 66%. Jang, 
Zhang on the puck. I think she's got a number 20. Who, who, who is that? No, number 10, my bad. Okay, that is Luca. Zhang again. Zhang back, picks up the puck. Turns, nice little turn. Oh, nice pass through the middle. Teammate can't quite hold on to it. Can't quite keep his edge either. Goes down. Halfway through this one, 50 minute group games this year, but there have been groups of six. Oh, that puck's all the way through. Dolby, though, picks it up. Chance for Imperial. Dobby takes it through, it's knocked out. Friedman is going to win that race against Luca. Luca needs to move his feet. If he moves his feet, he's got a chance. Puck out. Oh, it's through everyone. No one on the blue line to hold it. And that's offside. And Impedo going another way here, Shala Shillin. Ah, oh, here's my flat white, thank you. Shala Shillin almost crashes into the boards. <laughs> Campbell, Campbell. Go ahead in. Shot count still 3 0 in favour of Imperial, but they're one zip up on the scoreboard as well. Puck comes out in front, chance, oh! Oh no, he almost kicked in his own net. And that's cleared down the ice. And it'll go for ice in. To be fair, Dave and Rob, I do apologise, but you were on the stream before I was, so <laughs> hence I didn't give you a low. Uh, so sorry about that. Kept in by Imperial. Shara, oh, Shala Schillen just misses wide. Oh, puck straight out. That's not where you wanted to put that. Newcastle might have done enough now. To make sure he goes over the blue. That's the first thing they've got to do. Oh, nice little move. Campbell. Campbell goes down. Oh, it's the first penalty of the weekend. I think it's going to number five from Imperial. Number five, two minutes for Hooken. And for the first time in Nationals history, I have entered a penalty on the clock. So there we go, everyone. That, is, that has been a long time as a servant to the BIG avoiding that task. I'm just going to check that my, my that, our, that our minion got that. Did you, did you get the penalty? Five, two minutes for hooking. Yeah, yeah, she seems like she did. Chance! Oh, that will count as a save. So that's the first shot and goal for, for Newcastle. Kent, oh, he dumps it down nice. Yep. Yip was not paying attention there, and I, I, I'm glad that went wide for her sake. So that could have been a bit embarrassing. Steps in. And puck comes out. Halfway through this penalty kill for Imperial. First team to receive a penalty of the weekend. It's Kent. Tries to get it out. Um, but for some reason, the refs haven't noticed, actually, the refs haven't noticed it's five on five here.
Yeah, well, there's all kinds of shenanigans going on here. I, I don't know if people from Sheffield have eight fingers, but that's... Uh, or in Manchester, sorry. The bigger problem is when it becomes six on five. Yeah. Yeah, it could, it's going to become six on five shortly, folks. And I have no idea how, th how this gets resolved. Unfortunately, it's a rest control. It's not ours. Um, but, uh, yeah. Oh, they've got six on now. Unbelievable scenes. It's a call too many men. <laughs> Saved by Jay Jip. You've got to hope for Newcastle's sake they don't concede here. You've got to hope for the rest's sake they don't concede here. I think there's seven on now. What's going on? Oh, there's apparently been called. Offside, Aysen being called. Hopefully, hopefully now they get back to five. But that is... Oh, dear. <laughs> I've never come across that situation where for so long it was five on five. Um, fair play to Imperial for getting away with it. Um, you know, jeez. I take it there's no, uh, there's no degree in, in mathematics in there. An Imperial a College, University College, what's it? Whatever it is. But that's our first uh, proper shambles of the of the weekend. Um, we got through it. No one, no, nobody died, so that's the main thing. Um, Victor Cam knocks it out. Newcastle go down. Oh, 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 crunch! And here comes, here comes, roll, roll, shoots. Oh, ho, 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 and Richard Kelly there with a the save. It's a shot count now, three to two, eh, four to two, sorry, in favour of Imperial. Newcastle at least generating some offence now. Friedman, nice stick work there, defensively. Oh, and Victor Cam, he comes in looking like he was hungry but missed it. And there's a chance now, going the other way for Newcastle. Oh, and he'll cover it up. Thirty-five seconds left in this one. Shot count now four to three. What comes out in front? Seath. Seath has a chance, it's a breakaway, it's three on all. Yeah, oh, he <laughs> squandered it. He's off the Imperial Christmas card list after that one. Three on all, what a squandering. Maybe he's the new butcher. Oh dear. Yeah, if I were you, I'd shake your head and probably just go home uh, after that. Seath, that was absolutely dreadful. <laughs> Oh dear. That's like one of these ones where as a coach you're not even mad. Just the wry humour in it makes you feel feel better. So we're going into the next um the next game is gonna be Leeds, who seem to be doing some running repairs on their jerseys as to what jersey they're putting on, against Nottingham. Bizarrely, are actually all in the right jersey to begin with. So, there we go. So it's Mavs, this is Mavs S. So the new way, we're, the new format of this tournament um, is that we're going to go twice through the groups because um, otherwise you're going to play 15 minutes and then be doing nothing for ages. I mean, you're still going to be doing nothing for ages after your second game. But the idea is just to kind of try and, you know, give uh, a little bit more freedom in the changing rooms, that sort of thing. So these two teams, they both won their, uh, their first game. Oh, 
and that was an own shot. Oh, it's a goal for Leeds! It's a goal for Leeds Doig, number 20. 20 from 42. It's 20 from 42, that's uh, Ailey Doig from Ali Drury. There to start the game. Oh, and after winning, comfortably the first, oh, good save by Dando. Three shots she's had on her so far. Unlucky with that rebound one. Here's Ellis. Here's Ryan. Ryan steps it. Oh, good defensive break up there from, I'm not entirely sure who that is from away over here. Yeah, sorry, I apologise. Not in a match, in fact, lost their first game to, to Sheffield um, F. Shot! Good save by Dando again. Oh, and another good save. 5-0 in shot so far. Dando's doing well so far. Flicks that one away out of danger for a brief moment. Her defence are not helping her by trying to put pucks to the high slot for the other team. It helps. Uh, the, the forwards help when they shoot that badly, though, so that helps. So that is, uh, as I say, five to nil in shots already, and we've barely played two minutes. Hayes falls over after doing a little spinorama on his own. Smirnik, oh, shoots wide again. It's like someone's taking the batteries out of his PlayStation, PlayStation controller there, isn't it? Just, just not on target at all. Binks misses it. Hayes seems to have a problem there along the wall, gets a round one. Binks, he, he kind of stumbles a bit, steps Eel, another save by Dando, 6-0 in shot so far, in favour of Leeds. Weird. There's so many minions up here today. I mean, normally we're all on our we're all on our lonesome. But this is this is nice. Nottingham trying to do their best to keep the zone. Oh, there's a chance here for for our old man George R if he gets it. Binks, Binks. Oh, and Ryan's there. James. Oh, he can't hold on to it. And here's Drury. Drury going the other way. Drury's got a head up. Oh, she had a head up, she had a lovely cross-ice pass chance. Goes in after it deep. Broken up by Hayes, he crashes into the wall. Hayes flicks it, oh, chance again. Sangari. Oh! With every bounce in front of the Nottingham goal, you're worried. They're deer putting the pucks into all kinds of crazy places. And it's, it's really giving Dando a bit of a headache. Oh, it's front. Oh, lovely defensive play in the end there. Drury can't get a hold of it. Drury seems to have moved up front in this game. But all the way through. For some reason, there's an Imperial player on the Leeds bench. I don't know whether she's forgotten that she's like meant to do something else or... Puck out. That'll do. Play it into the middle. Oh, Ryan's got it now. Ryan. One, two. Chance. Oh, great save again. Eight zip in the shots, but only one zip on the scoreboard for the um, uh, Leeds Griffins. Just so happened it was the second shot of the game that went in, but Dando's now standing on her head to keep this, uh, this game close. 
It's out. Burnham, oh, almost. Almost a high stick penalty there. Completely accidental. Trying to go for a stick with missed it there. Shepard. Shepard fires it across. Oh, no. Oh, 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 oh no. Oh, it's not quite, it's not quite full Springer, but it's pretty bad for <laughs> Smirik. Doy, eh, not Doy, Ellis winding up. Ellis fires up the wall. Puck goes out in the middle, Smirik now. He's just going to keep, keep banging away and hopefully get one of those ones on target. Comes out. Burnham is chasing Ryan down, but Ryan's got a hold of it. He rims it round. James can't get there. Beats everyone apart from Smirik. He's got to skate onto it. Oh, Smirik, nice hands. Chance. Good save by Dando. All the pressure on the Nottingham, Nottingham goalie. She's coming up big here. Drury, oh, can't get, quite get there. Puck comes round here's Ryan. Ryan tries to fire it off, fires it in the middle. That's chipped away by James. Sangari goes round behind. Turns. Oh, 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 oh. oh, chance in front for Nottingham here. Oh, no, he mishandled it. Oh, oh, and that is a massive wipeout in the middle of the ice. And now Drury is two on one, three on one. Drury shoots. Oh. Not quite as bad as a three on Omis net, but that's pretty close. And that hits the outside of the cage. Front, Doig tips it. Good save again. So shots, shot count now 10 0 in favour of Leeds. We're barely halfway through this game. And after an early quick goal from Leeds. Oh, I almost jinxed it. It's 11 0 on shots now, but after a quick goal from Leeds, they seem to be struggling to find the target or the net. That was. That actually has worked, but it's probably not what you wanted to do. Especially when you handle it three times before you actually fire it there. Here's Ellis. Ellis chips it in. Shepard after it. Eel, or L, is going in the corner. That's out. Oh, good battle there in front. Binks can't quite get it out. Ellis puts it back in. Fired out. Here's James. James is after it. Here's Singari. Singari, you going all the way? You want to pass it up someone's rear end because they're not going to see it coming. But Sangari goes into the zone himself. He's picked up the puck. He's got two Leeds players in front. Good defensive effort to knock that one just away from the Leeds sticks. Oh, and then it's uh, some, some version of Skittles there as everybody tumbles down. Then <laughs> James does a butterfly. There's two Nottingham players next to each other. Shot. Oh, that goes wide. Puck at the other side. Good save by Dando. Oh, and that misses just wide there at the post. Shot count now 12 to nil in favour of Leeds. Mavs players changed hand. Skating with a right uh, right handed stick. He's changed it to left. Back it goes. Singari knocks it round. Calm from Leeds. Oh, here's James Ryan. James Ryan again. Ryan stops. Oh, big. Hayes gets his body in the way. Good block at that time. Here's Smurnik. Oh, Smurnik, nice hands. Oh, that puck goes out in front. Knocked away, Ryan picks it up. Ryan flips it. Good 
Saved by Tando again. Oh, and there, there's another one. Score now 2 0. Shots 14 0 in favour of Leeds. That one just skips wide. Just under four minutes to go. Ryan back. Ryan stops, turns, flips it off the wall. Back it goes. Beans. Oh, he takes the puck away from the player advancing. And now they're all offside. Yep, that was offside. There we go, I got the bug back. Two-nil is the score as they line up in the, the neutral zone. After the offside pass. He picks up. James Owen. Oh, Drury picks up. Drury now. Drury steps in. Drury. Good save by Dando again. Faring a lot better than in the first game. Or perhaps not warmed up enough. 15, 15 nil in shots. 2 nil on the scoreboard for Leeds. Not them yet to generate a shot on the butcher, which statistically is um, means it's very difficult to score if you don't shoot any pucks. Puck fired in. James tries to pick up. Not them get out of the zone. A little bit of urgency here from Nottingham's needed if they're going to come back in this one. Not in the corner. Ells after it. Puck in front. Smin oh, Sminick tries to get a hold of that one. Sminick, nice hands. Sminick, cross ice it goes. Murphy. Murphy. Nottingham have done well collapsing here. They're taking away a lot of options, but somehow it still almost gets through. Drury keeps it in. Scott Smirnick inside. Drury. Goes short side. Saved by Dando. Just under a minute to play. That's 16 nil in shots now. Interesting lineup from Nottingham here. They've got people in the circle, which I'm not entirely sure is legal. The refs are just dropped it anyway. Baines goes round behind for it. Battle behind the wall. Good win by Baines there for, for Nottingham. Oh, and that puck's cleared. Ryan's back for it. Slows up, so no icing call. Ryan off the wall. And icing is called. Twenty seven seconds left. This will be Nottingham's first proper, I suppose, chance in the zone because most of the other times it's just been flicking a puck in. Oh, 
And that's out the zone again, and Nottingham will go offside once again. 19 seconds left. Shot counts. Nottingham still not generated a shot in this game. Smirik, Smirik, nice hands. The chance to maybe kill this completely. Good save. 17 nil in shots now. Good save by Dando. But then Smirik. Good save again by Dando. 80 nil in shots. And that's it all, folks. And as, a, as you can see, the next game is Bears G against Newcastle B. Um, I'm not sure. There is a nice cut now, so... We'll take a brief break from commentary and talking nonsense, and we'll be back with you uh, after that. Um, so that was uh, the referees are actually checking how their performance was, and I thought that was pretty good, apart from the whole uh, Imperial having five on for the complete two minutes of their penalty. Um, so yeah, I'll join you back again, guys, in a minute um, or two, um, and we'll. Uh, We'll chat some hockey, but as I say, next up uh, is it does, it's not not an MF versus Leeds. Um, it is in fact a uh, Sheffield uh, G versus Newcastle B.
So we're back everyone, it's Sheffield G against Newcastle B now. Um, I'm being delivered fruit here. Like, like feeding it, time at the zoo. Like right, feeding time at the zoo. I'm not actually, to be honest, I had quite a, a reasonable breakfast so I didn't actually need anything. Here's Nick back. Hi Nick. Hello. And we are off. Oh, that's the first shot on goal from Newcastle. Those uh, pads of the Sheffield goalie are very white. Yeah, yeah. That that either means they're very new or he's really not very good at getting his pads in the way of anything. Uh, but I think this guy is a normally a player, uh, Mr. Key. Yes. Matthew Key. Yep. Um, so he maybe has a secret, you never know. To victory. Better get the right rosters up here, although I sh I'm starting to learn them already. And a lot of these teams have the right names on their jerseys. A nice break up there. That ice is a bit wet. Yeah. And down the other, it's a territorial game here. This is going to be the first shot and goal on Yep, though if you hadn't have saved that. Oh, ooh, I might have been giving her a warning as a referee there. I think that could have been cleared. <laughs> I'm more in uh, the... Emphasis on driving the net for the Sheffield player. Yeah, yeah. As he harpooned themselves into the boat. So we're we're up at 41 um, viewers uh, this morning. It's pretty good going, I think, for Saturday. So Nick, this is your baby this year. Have you enjoyed being in charge? Um, yeah, we're getting there. We're getting there, getting there, getting there. I'm going to say it on air this time, Rambo. Um, there is um, there is something about the Newcastle white jerseys that offends me more than the colour clash of the blues. Mm, I don't yeah. know why, it just really doesn't... The difference between them. Uh, to be honest with you, the, these new design, these ones with the new supplier are just, are just frankly horrible. And the puck's down nice, and I think that'll be icing. There we are, that's icing. So I just need to press that. Just went off, just like... Back, up, back in. So shot count at the moment is one all. Both shots had really no chance of going in. Oh, the referees! Oh, they've called it. They've called it. Seems somewhat unfair to call a too many player penalty in this situation, but. Bit of confusion has to. Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh dear! <laughs> oh my! I don't think the camera caught that. Caught that. <laughs> we just about had to report to Essie an injury there as the as the player went to the penalty box. Oh dear! Uh, good morning to Drew Meyer, who's checking in. Um, Eva saying 75 for Newcastle scared me how much he's choking on his stick. Surely that's a different problem. Um, what, ha what happened down here, remember? <laughs> so the player, they got called too many players penalty. Um, referee, <laughs> the player went to skate over 
So we're opening the door, he trashed into the, the bit that wasn't the door. Um, and I don't know if the camera guy picked up because he wasn't expecting it to happen, so... Uh, <laughs> you have to be alive, Rambo. Yeah. And if you are here live, put it on many devices as well. Extra yeah. viewers. Yeah. Well, if you are here live and you're not watching already... Here we go, Newcastle the other way. Oh, that was a bit of a slash from Woofing in there. And we've got Joseph here, um, Tandy. Go another way. Oh, nice break up there. Westerland. Oh. Sheffield are miles offside. They've done, oh, they've, they've beaten temptation for going straight for that puck, which is good for them. They got back on side there. Puck passed ahead. Picked up by Newcastle. Kind of puts themselves under pressure there. Campbell now picks up. Campbell, nice little deft move. Campbell. Campbell shoots! Oh, save. great save by Key. He's now made three saves so far in this game. W was that a Key save? That was a Key save, yep. Have you done that one? I've not done that one, no. Oh. It's not as much as when we had, it's not as good fun as when we had Tree, though. I still think Tree was the, was the best name for goalies. <laughs> you, you got some good fruit from that. Yeah, I did. I mean, it depends how far we can extend Key, you know. Like, Key's got a good engine. No, that's that's too far, you know. Yeah, you lost me on that one. Well, because well, you've got Key the car, you know. Uh, it's, um, it's too far, yeah, it's too no, far. No, no. It's Close too, it. too early for that. Locks the door, that's fine. And when he's playing out next week, he could open the door. So, oh, that hits the side of the net, or, or the post, one of the two. Will be. Or oh, won't he? <laughs> Goes behind. Oh, no one picks up for for Sheffield there. Has has the danger zone claimed any victims so far? Not really, no, actually, incidentally. To be honest, the penalty box almost claimed a bigger victim than the danger zone earlier on. So um Puck out. Oh here's a chance if Newcastle can end it. They've waved ice in though, so there will be an ice in cold. Break up, put oh! <laughs> well played by that stick. <laughs> Whose stick is that? Uh, it's one of the Bears players' sticks. Oh, played it back in the zone, the Bears. There's been a lot of, um, how can I put it, friendly fire in this game so far. Uh, where people have put the puck back into their own zone and things. In fact, Nottingham even put the puck on their own net uh, in the last game. Oh, swing and a miss from Newcastle. Puck comes up the middle. Chance the other way. Couple of couple of bodies. Oh, nice little pass. Luca, Luca. Oh, what a save from Key. Key now with four big saves. Oh, and a swing and a miss there. Russell. Russell flicks it out. Steps Mulrooney. Mulrooney shoots. Oh, that just floats by the, the, the near side post. Chance. Oh, and somehow Key saved that. Chance. Oh, oh. another great save. Those pads are going to get dirty at this rate. Yeah. I don't know, the last one hit his posterior, Nick, so maybe trying to keep them as clean as possible. Oh, oh that, that's not a shot and go. But 6 0 on shot, so, eh, 6 1, sorry, on shot so far for uh, for, for Newcastle. Oh, and, and was that a save or was that? I, I think, think that. Yeah, a save, 7 1. Puck fired round. Newcastle keep it in. 
Westerman almost uh, done himself an injury there. Can't keep it in this time. That Sison's on and Ison will be called. The pair sneaked on a little change there. Um, but they've had to unsneak that change because the refs noticed. I bet they didn't notice the five players on earlier on, Nick. You know, they noticed that change. <laughs> didn't notice the five on five power play. Mm -hmm. so. Don't worry, Rambo I had some really constructive feedback about that. From the referees. Oh. What was the constructive feedback? Or you're not allowed to say? Correct. <laughs> Back down the ice now, and here comes the Wildcats beat. There's no one at that side throwing net on their Ollie's support players at the opposite side of the ice. Makes a very good cross-ice pass. But unfortunately, all four of the players over there didn't pick it up. 25's having to do a lot on his own here. Is that Butrin? Is that how do you how do you pronounce that? Puck in the corner, battle, Johnson wins it. There's another save. Eight one in shot so far. What are you thinking to these uh, short games? I, I quite like it actually, it means that teams have got to come out firing. Um, also means that the, the knockouts can be slightly longer, mm -hmm. uh, which I think is, is more important, obviously. Less chance of a penalty shootout after our little over-under discussion last night. Yeah, well, I put the over-under on the, on, the, on the Instagram stories. I think I've done it right. I don't know if I've had any votes yet. Um, you said nine, Nick. Mm -hmm. That's half of the games over the course of the weekend uh, going to the penalty shootout. Obviously, as you, as you mentioned earlier, Rambo, this is now my baby. It must have been, obviously, must have impressed guys last year with how I conducted the coin toss. Yeah. Yeah, well, it's been... Well, there's only three minutes left to go in this game. Newcastle well ahead in the shot count. Oh, 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 oh. I, That was actually impressive you managed to get that to the middle of the ice from, from there. I don't think I could have bent, I could bend that way. Campbell, Campbell. Backhand shot, oh, good save by Key again. It's a nice backhand shot, you don't see much of that in uh, tier three non-checking. No, no, no. You often no. see the turn the stick the wrong way round. Yeah, yeah. And, well, we've already I, had that this morning. We've had that. That this, we had that this morning. I had a stick pass around the back this morning as well, uh, which was quite impressive at the speed that we're going. What, Mac five? Yeah. Puck knocked in. Bears now pick it up, they fire it right down the ice. Well, that's, it's waved, uh, I think because Robinson maybe stopped moving his feet. Oh, down they go, Robinson. Wall, put back, and that's knocked out. Just reaches the blue line and no more. Bear still offside. It's a little. T I don't know about you, but sometimes at this level, it's a little bit like you know the old rugby ki like kick battle. Yes. Um, they just territory. Kind of you know, like twat it either. Oh, it's oh, a goal! What a goal there! 16. 16 on the goal. I'm not sure who got the assist there. Might have been 12. I think it might have been Campbell. <laughs> 16 from 55, we were both wrong. Um, 16 from 55 on the goal there. Sorry, the clock has stopped for a second while I catch up. And we're back. The shot count had to catch up to Sheffield at some point. 11-1 in shots. Oh, oh, shot. oh, 
shot right on. Puck back up the wall, Edwards now. Just feathers it in the middle, that almost goes all the way through. Looks like time's going to run out for the Bears. Some constructive criticism from... <laughs> We're sorry if you heard any potty mouth on the live stream there. Phil? Phil? Uh -huh. Is you? Oh, here we go. Ooh. Ooh. He's... Yeah. <laughs> Rambo just likes drama. One second to go. Uh, shot count 12-1 now in favour of the Bears. I keep saying these things and I, ho I hear nothing from the far end confirming that the shot counts... Uh, yeah, I'm getting a nod now. Forgets he can speak back to yeah, us. Yeah, she's forgot about the talk back button. Yeah. Why is Dave called you Chief Tosser? That's not very nice. That, oh, coin. Right, press complete, Dave, uh, Nick. I like when we do this together and we end up talking. Whoa! Oh, 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 we got the shot count as well. Very excited about that. Yeah, the other scorebook's still underneath it, but that's fine. So do I don't press next? Um, I think so. Yeah, press, 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 press next. No, you, you do, they told me that. Yeah, uh, and it's correct. Um, <coughs> press start game. Uh, Wait a minute. That's went away. Yeah, there we go. So we got the shot count up there um, for that game, 12 to 1. Nice, nice little victory for Newcastle B, who got to be, you've got to find something up their morale after having possibly the worst jerseys in the tournament so far. Yes. Um, but we've not seen Birmingham yet, so we'll see whatever abomination they've got this year. <laughs> Now, I've got my finger ready on puck drop too. Until later on, you have to just keep checking that. Yep. I mean, we to, when I get that stuff, we're updated. Now we're off here, Nick. So, uh, what, what was the score for the um, for the Kents in their first? Uh, not the this Kents. is Imperial. Yeah. But I suppose they Kent. they've got Stephen Kent. Uh, he was a well kent face, decent Kent, if you will. What was uh, um, what was Imperial's score in the? Area? It was, uh, I think it was one nil, if I remember correctly. You see, they could have made it two 0 They had a three and zero, uh, ah. <laughs> and ah, and they missed the net and cleared the zone for the other team. <laughs> so defensive player of the weekend. It was the worst three and zero I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> and correct me if I'm wrong. This is the Sheffield team that opened a kind of will pass. Um, this is the Sheffield team, so this is like sort of two of the front runners in this group. You is, uh, is the, uh, she's always a handy player. M remember last year though, I think had a pink helmet. Yes. Uh, so I didn't quite pick her out straight away this year because of the with the black helmet when she came on. Then she got the puck, and then I realised who she was. <laughs> so, so it was me rather than you. What do you mean? Oh. Right. I get it, I get it now. Ha ha ha. What's the policy then take my shoes off up here if I'm going to stand all day? Depends what team you spawn. Because <laughs> I've got a really itchy toe as well. Have you so got socks on? Yeah, I've got socks yeah, on. Yeah, I suppose we could allow it. Yeah. I, I wouldn't take my shoes off and, and take my socks off, goodness. I'm not an animal. Mm. Well, I mean, I've done worse. Certainly have. How yeah. many? How many? There's about... Uh, yeah, well, they let that one away, and I think, oh, this guy's checking his helmet as he skates on. Dolby, the house elf here. <laughs> he's going around behind, he goes through the danger zone. Cuts through the danger zone. He's like off, Tom he's Cruise off. cuts through the danger zone. Here's Mountfield. Oh, and Kent. Kent I'll tell you what, though. Kent hasn't got, they've got, they've got jer different jersey design. Kent's just got a really horrible, ugly one that's uh, that's needing a wash. Yeah, he's needing to get, um, Kent's, um, Maybe needing to get some bold or something. Is, this, is bold still a washing detergent? I don't know. Nice. 
Nice block by Mountfield. Out comes Doby, he'll pick it up. Doby. Oh, nice hands by Doby there. Nice little deft touch on the puck there just to get himself enough space on that wall. Unfortunately, his teammate couldn't quite pick it up. Doby again! Doby! Oh, blocked by Zach Jones. Shot! Save! Glaspie with double saves there. 2-0 the shot count now in favour of Imperial. I sort of got I sort of got permission to take my shoes off and I'm doing it because it's really uncomfortable. And ah, that's better. Oh, sorry, I'm making old man noises now. Like old man that's taking his shoes off noises. I apologise for that down the live stream. And here we go, chance for Sheffield the other way. Here's the claw. Someone's going to have to come up and spell that phonetically for me. Shot across. Oh, what a diving save from the staff member. I'm trying to look at this team's... Uh, these teams have never played. We've never had the Sheffield F play the Imperial B before. Um, that could be a sort of a false um, narrative, though, because um, famously last year, Imperial entered their C team in no B team, um, which, I mean, you know, suggests that either uh, they um, were trying something or uh, they uh, don't know the alphabet. Well, that's a bad angle. Here's Wild. Wild back to Mountfield. Mountfield. Hat trick in the first game. Looking to make things happen out here for the Bears F team. Mountfield knocks it back round. The, the, clock, the clock fires across. Oh, can't get that in. And Mountfield knocks it back in. Kelly just stops it and holds it there. Fired round. It's a goal, and it's Mountfield again. 62, I'm not sure if there's an assist on it because it bounced about all over the place. Oh, 72 got the goal, apparently. So it's 72 from 62 uh, there. 72, Sophie Gledhill. Got the goal, obviously, on the rebound of Mountfield shot. It looked like it was Mountfield too caught the rebound but anyway shot count now is 4-2 in favour of Sheffield so kind of going with the run of form in the last few minutes but Imperial gets own presence oh can't find the can't find the seam for the pass there pucks away can't keep it in Nteka, is it Nteka? No, number three is... Oh, it is, it's Minteka. 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 Of course, one of these, uh, one of these folk with the zero three instead of, like, a normal number. Um, other way for Imperial. Nice hands to beat Jones. Steps in. Oh, nice pass. Chance. Great goal tending from Lawson Glassby there. Keeps the lead for Sheffield at the moment, but there's still loads of chances. <laughs> Stephen Kent could have got on to the end of that, but decided he wasn't prepared to skate two feet. Now he's got it, though. Oh, and he's lost it again. Kent fires it out. Here's you. You stops, turns. Going to turn the other way. Turn back again. You, nice hat. Oh, and can't get the shot off. Falls down at the last hurdle. A lot of individual efforts for Imperial. Not a great deal of team play. Shot! Chance! Oh, and Kent scores 34 from 7. I don't know if there's a second assist on that, but it's definitely 34 from 7. 34 from 7. No second assist. The rest confirmed. Shot count now 5-4 in favour of Imperial. It swings backwards and forwards this game.
Whitefield shoots. Oh, nice glove saved by Kelly. Sheffield now take the lead in the short count, six to five. One all on the scoreboard. Mountfield. Nice, nice move by Kelly. Wild. Oh, cross ice can't find Gledhill. Knocked out. Ashton. He falls. Chance now for Imperial. They'll definitely beat the ice in here. Wild is over. Oh, Wild picks up nicely. Nice and calm from him. Steps up, has a look ahead. There's a chance for Doby. Doby back with he's got Mountfield up behind him. Mountfield is trying to angle him away. Leaves Doby with that one option. Nice pass though to find to find his, his teammate ahead. Just get themselves on side there. Wild. Cross. Ashton. Gleto was looking another direction. She might have gone the end of that. Kind of a weird change for Sheffield there. Wild's lost the puck and he's. Chance for the shot, shot. Ooh, good save from Glassby. Six all in shots now. I think the next game might be Sheffield again, is it? Sheffield E next. That sound better. Uh, sorry, I'm speaking to. We've got. Um, I've got Bethany down. Oh, chance! Ivan Shalalin, shot. Good save again by Glassby. Oh, 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 bold, punchy move by Glassby, clearing the puck like that. Oh, oh, confusion on the blue line gives a chance to Sheffield. Still a chance. A bit of a hook there. Oh, oh, and Imperial almost played it. Almost friendly fire there from Imperial. That was very good geometry from that angle. And here we go. Victor Cam plays it in the middle. Can't get the on rushing uh, play, uh, support player. She's, now Zhang's got it. Shalalin. Oh, can't find anyone. Puck fired behind. Shalalin's got it. He's picked up. Steps out. Fires it across. Victor Cam saved by Glassby. 8-6 in shots now in favour of Imperial. Just that, I'll hang this over here or something. Battle, nice win there. Kent, ooh, misses the net. Puck in front, another chance. Ooh, and... Imperial don't even generate a shot on that little bit of play. Puck keeps going wide. Knocked forward. Gledhill after it and Yu's there. Yu. Yu gets the head up. Goes past one. Oh, nice read by Wild. He stops that and breaks that down. Wild keeps it in. Got the pass in front. Oh, it goes into the skates of Martin. But Mountfield now picks up. Mountfield, the danger man. Can't find Gledhill. Chang knocks it out. Here's you. Yeah, he's got two to beat. They're in a kind of weird angle. She's just burnt past. Look, skating into the space. Here's Kent. No, Kent and good puck support from uh, Stephen Kent. Kent in front. Oh, you tries to flick it towards the net. Can't quite get it off. Shot. Oh, that hits the outside of the cage. Yes, it is Lawson Glassby that is in net. And um, for those asking for Sheffield. And here's Mountfield now. On Russian D, great back check there to break that play up. But Mountfield, good puck strength. Tries to stuff it. Doesn't quite get the shot off. And Pedro have everyone really low, so they've got no one to break out to. Nice little delay though in their own zone, very confident. K 
Kent steps in. Kent, Stephen Kent shoots. Oh, he rings it off the bar. The ref's saying that hit a helmet. I'm not sure that it did, but... It, it definitely hit the bar, but whether it hit the mask first, I don't know. Just under two to play in this one. Very tight game. Nice little change of stick. And truck across shot. Oh, good save there by Wallace. What were we thinking to the uh, stand-up style of the uh, Imperial goalie? I, I, see, well, I think you should bring it back. This is your 20-second warning, Rambo. Oh, sorry, yeah. Give me more responsibilities. I don't, I don't know how that happened. Well, oh, I've done it too early now. <laughs> you, said, you said that you wanted to commentate on every single game this weekend, and we had a discussion and decided what could make it more interesting, because you've done that before. It's not a challenge anymore. What could we do to make it more interesting? Yeah. And have, having me do this is, is making it more interesting, is it? Yes, and taking away the chair. Well, to be fair, the chair I quite like. I'm the quite enjoying not having the chair. The chair will not be returning. Yeah, that's fine. Dolby. Do oh, Dolby. That students were out of bed for that offside. That's not that's not Dolby though. It says that. Who's the guy that says that? Don't know how how well do you know your your, your Harry Potter references? Anyway, enough of Harry Potter. You know about um, Finch. Is that what his name is? Yeah. The caretaker. Um, yeah. Is there a possibility of two of the three Sheffield teams playing each other? It's not a possibility. It's going to happen. It is happening. Because Sheffield F and Sheffield G are in the same group. So they will play each other. Is it tomorrow that Berapalooza is? Or is it later today? Later today, I believe. It's later today, 12.09. 12.09. For if everything runs smooth. For the Bears training session. Yeah. More bears than you can fit in one place. I'm but really wanting the G's to win. I'm being honest, because it'll be funny. Um, here's Wild. Wild. Oh, uses old knock it forward. Hope for the best move. Dobby knocks it forward again. Ooh, oh, oh, a chance for Ivan Shalalan. I have no idea if I'm pronouncing that right, but I'm sticking by my, my attempt. You're doing it with conviction. Yeah. See, that's not, that's not the danger zone. He just fell over. Oh! oh. So, one all the game finishes. A nice a draw uh, in this one. Um, so, uh, it was 8-7. Sorry, I didn't keep you up to date at the end. So, we're having another one-way conversation. As is, BI, as is BIHA tradition. We're just waiting um, so we can tick complete game as well. Oh, we're not getting the stats for that game, clearly. Um, <laughs> too late now. Just leave it. <laughs> uh, so it was 8-7 in shots. One all was the score. Um, we've got uh, Sheffield E now against Manchester Metro C. Uh, yeah, Nicky uh, Richardson wearing the, uh, the old uh, fluorescent socks. Now, I'm not sure... Last year, these got passed around. Um, I basically, as I think it was like if you made a mistake, you wore them. But I think that was for the A team. I don't know if Nicky just keeps them for the for the the C team or not. Um, so don't uh, don't adjust your color settings. Those socks are fluorescent. Um, So let's see who's in the rosters for these teams. Uh, I don't know that actually. Does that one? No, no. Let's just just let's let's, let's not break anything else. Um, so this is a this is a big bench for the Manchester C squad. Um, I'm not going to sit and count it all, but it's pretty big.
So, um, I think we will get started in a moment. This is the first uh, game in Group B, or Group 2. Sorry, we don't do A and B, it's, it's Group 1 and 2. Um, so, it's the first game in this one. So we get Bears E versus Manchester C, and then we've got Nottingham, Northumbria King C versus Nottingham Mavericks E. Um, following on from that. So here we go, Manchester Metro C against Sheffield Bears E. This should be a classic. And I remember to start the clock this time as well, which helps matters. Save from Young. Puck knocked out. Wren. Fires in the middle. Nice little play there from 65. Fox. Nice break up, nice defensive play. Oh, Jacob steps in. It's not Jacob's, that is Harmon, who's wearing J Bethany Jacob's shirt. He was in the gorilla position right now. That's two shots so far by the Bears E on Manchester C. Uh, definitely his own presence dominance right now is from the, the Bears E team. in front fired across kept in nice little race Stone wins the race oh then falls which gives a chance to sh for Sheffield Puck dumped down nice and that could be icing to be fair there's no one from uh, Manchester in the vicinity and that will be icing One of the players thinking he can go for a change, but then is swiftly told no. Puck chipped out. Picked up by Fox. Fox fires it forward. Main. Main steps in over the zone, tries to get across. Richardson can't stop it. Oh, and that goes wide. Shot count still 2 0. Nice def. Oh, it sneaked in. I thought this defensive play was enough, but Main scores. <laughs> 19 from 65 there, so that was Main from Fox. It opens the scoring. Shot count 3 0 in favour of uh, Sheffield as well. One knocks it down. Grob misses it. Grob tries to fire up the middle of the ice. Green. Green. People in their in the arena this morning. Interestingly, here's Valerie Beaton. Benton, sorry. 
Wong battling along the wall. A little bit of a shove, swales. He'll knock it forward. Drop. Gets by one. Can't get quite across. Nice defensive effort from Green. Now, Green should be fine if he remembers offside rule this time. Here he goes, and he goes in the zone. Got one in the middle. Tries to make the pass and thread the needle. Good defensive stop from Manchester. Need to generate some offense though. Sheffield will be happy for them to break it up like that all day as long as they, uh, they don't get down the ice the other way. Grob. Grob now has it. He's going to skate out the zone. Beats one. Green breaks it up. Benton. Nice move by Benton. Beadman. Beadman. Nice hands. He's got Fields with him. Beadman. Oh, he maybe should have put that one on the target. Sometimes it's okay to just shoot the puck. Butterfield. Well, now, now it's coming out. No, it's kept in. It's outside of the cage. Not back round. Here's Beadman. Puck out. Reset. Here's. He's looking for Harmon. We can't find it. Oh, nice breaking. Break up. Here's Harmon now. Passes it forward. Beadman. Beadman. Oh, oh, nice defensive stop there from. Who is that? That's a double oval. Butterfield. Breaking up. Your chance for Manchester on the break. Oh, nice back check by Fox. Now Fox is going to carry. Fox knocks it past one. Fox has got double oval there. Takes a shot. And that goes miles wide. Shot on target. Rob, Rob Young will cover that one up. Shot count 4-0 in favour of the Bears. Forty-five listening uh, viewers this morning. Thank you to all of you. Pop back to the point. Kept in. Richardson tries to fire it. Then praise to the hockey gods. Not out. That's going to just go out. There's a chance here for Manchester. What speed to the zone? Chance shot. Oh, and that's the first save that the, the Sheffield goalies had to make. That was great speed there from the 70, number 79. Hodkinson. Puck off the wall. Kept him by Harlan. Harlan shoots. Oh, Benton almost there. Has just wanted to keep her stick still and let that hit it. And now we go again. Here's Hodkinson. This time the captain of the Bears, it's, that's uh, actually count as a shot and goal for the Bears, but uh, it wasn't a great shot. Grob picks it up. Grob turns. So we've broken up by Beadman. Nice play by Beadman. Takes a shot on target. That one was going wide, so that's not actually a shot and goal. Gurwapa. Beadman. Oh, and that's a little, a nice little push save there from Young. Manchester now at least generated some offence with just under half the game to go. Nice defensive play. A bit of a flump in the middle of the ice there. One, one move there. Fox steps in. Fox, snapshot, great block. Wilson after it, but Wong will get there first. Wong knocks it back into the zone. Double oval. And we have, I think that's icing. Clock ticks down here.
So Metros have a chance here. If they can win the draw, they can maybe generate something, maybe a shot. Bears goal, he's not really been tested in this one. Kept in. Grob does well to keep it in. No one from the, Ma the Metro Stars can get on the end of it. Now they hand. Shot. No, oh, good block there. Defensive play by Main. He, he scored a first goal for them. Now, me all oh, and they're offside. Go. Cool. Here's Harmon. Harmon steps in. Nice hands. Harmon. Lovely little sidestep there. Oh, nice little cuts, like sort of number 44 unassisted. Harmon there, wearing a Bethany Jacobs jersey. So 2 0 is now the score. And, and to be fair, Sheffield for. A lot of the offer uh, for, for their 2 0 win. They're not really that dominant so far. It's just more that they seem to get the puck to the net a lot better. Here's a chance. Oh, Beedman definitely wants that one back. Benton, that's blocked. Richardson battling for it. Richardson wins the puck. So I'm going to put it up the wall. Still in the zone. Well kept in. Shot. Oh, blocked away by Richardson. Benton, Benton knocks it back, Fields, can't get a hold of it. Double oval, up to Wren, Wren. Oh, it takes too long trying to decide there how they're getting out. And here's a chance. Shot, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> that change up almost fooled the goalie. Shot count, now still 5-3, well 5-3 <laughs> sorry to the Bears. Not a lot in the shot count, to be fair, but just uh, nice finishes from the Bears. That's kept. Oh, no, now it Wong. He's got four back checkers on him. He shoots. Ro Young covers that up. Good job by Young to, uh, to hold on to that. Away. Nice poke check. Here's Harmon. Harmon scored that second goal, that insurance marker. Oh, that'll count as a shot and goal. <laughs> I'm not sure anyone had any party knew anything about that shot and goal, but that'll do. Now a change of line for the Metros. Gurwapa comes in. Shot count 5 4 in favour of the Bears now. Stick handling. And puck off the wall. Chance here for Fields. Fields is going to win it, but he's got Gurwapa all over him. Nice play by Gurwapa. Nice defensive back check there. Gurwapa fires it up the wall. That's come out. It's waved because it was touched. So Sheffield have got to come out their own zone with it. She seemed to be able to do quite easily here. Not a lot of forecheck there. Double Oval will go back for it. Double Oval picks it up. Rims it. Well, that's kept in. Not passed. Gurwapa. He's got field, he's got three to beat though. And he's right on the wall. Can't get that puck across. Now he's got it back though. Gurwapa shoots. Oh! Weird bounces there. Didn't know where that was going from our angle. Double Oval's got it. But Fields is after it. Will Sheffield win this race? Uh, no is the answer, but they are in good position here. So we, clock ticks down towards the last one minute. Gurwapa, he wins a puck. It's a long shift for Manchester as well. 
Lost stick handling here. Got to take the shot. Just puts it on net. Sheffield goalie covers it up. Shot count now six all. You're really taken to this clock business. I'm getting I'm getting the hang of it now, I have to say. I have to say. I need a tea server though. Like what are these extra minions doing? Can you think you could do cups of tea? Mm -hmm. yeah. Wait, which one? Any of them. You pick. Max. Uh, just milk in mine. Cup of tea, please. Yeah. I'm I'm losing my voice over here, so. Uh, main. He thinks I'm joking, by the way. Tea, please. Oh, double save. Oh, double save there. Shot eight, six, eight. Ooh. Stop. I'll give it a, a one potato countdown before I start it again, okay? Um, sorry, I was getting my tea order in there. Get the, getting the important things right. Eight, six of shots, Nick, in favour of the Bears. It's not actually that big a differential considering it's 2 0 in a short game like this. But they just had a couple of nice finishes. So here we go. One potato. There we go, we'll start the clock again. Nick's coming in and out here. Here's Wong. Wong off the wall. Puck down. Double oval is. Oh, that's went away. Is that a double? That is double oval, or have I got that wrong? Chancel on the wall. Oh, fired in the middle. You don't want to put it there. Just as well. Broken up beautifully by Grob. Save the day. Clock counts down. Manchester can't get out their zone. And they've went for a change, Manchester. No one's went back on. It's five and four. Oh, and the buzzer perhaps saves them from a 3-0. Three um, so that was a that was a decent game. Um There we go, we've got the game summary up here. We've not got the game summary up anymore. What happened there? <laughs> Everybody pause your live stream. Now. Yay! There we go. There we go. Uh, I've got to say Nick down there, so... Well, actually, you heard that, so that's fine. Do not adjust your sets. It is 15 minutes. I'm not sure why the score bug says five. Let's see. Uh, C. Okay. So this is Northumbria C. Um, in the red. Uh, and if you're from Northumbria C, you like your steak tendy. Because uh, this, this guy in gold, Patrick, unbelievable. Uh, in goals for a guy who's not played that long uh, he if you score against them keep the puck uh, quite frankly not got a great book on uh, not on me I'm afraid I uh, don't know a lot about them I haven't had any personal experience with them but uh, lots of good players Bramley 39 he's normally a goalie Before there's any accusations thrown around, my roster was correct. I don't know if you see there, it says it's a five minute game, it's not right. <laughs> uh, I'm not sure, entirely sure what's going on. I'm hoping when I press start that it will fix itself because the, the thing links up with the scoreboard as far as I understand. Um, be fine. But it, it, it just use it for the score, we'll try and keep you up to date with the time anyway. So, uh, thank you. big welcome to the 57 people watching right now. Guessing they all saw my social media blitz. Yeah, there's a lot of people there from. Uh, you think there'll be a lot of people watching back in Northumbria? No, they're all here. 
Well, I wasn't sure you had Wi-Fi there. That's why I asked. So. Oh, no. <laughs> Dial up internet. They'll, they'll hear this message in about five hours. <laughs> So uh, just for all you uh, uh, can see, number 21 that uh, we can see from just in front of us is mental. Um, <laughs> in terms of like just Ross skating, never giving up on a play. Bite your arms off. Yeah, put her, put her body in front of any shot. Uh, mental. <laughs> oh, that's a nice move. Patrick's with a save. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Call them Patrick's, it's just Patrick's, right? Yep. Yeah, okay. Patrick Wah. Puck kept in there. Chance, oh, great save again by Patrick. That's two shots already on him. Yeah. I can't believe I just explained that the clock thing is showing five minutes, but it's 15, and someone's already asked me why is it say they've only got five minutes for the game. <laughs> no, there's 15 minutes. This is extreme sudden death. Yeah. I mean, with the size of the, the King's roster, I'm not entirely sure in five minutes. All Everybody's going to get nice. a shift. Yeah. Oran tries to get the shot off. How do we say Patrick's last name? Or can I just call him Patrick all weekend? Patrick. Yeah. Chance. Tries to stuff it, poke check by Patrick. Wheatley. Ah, see, it helps when you've got Nick with you when Northumbria are playing. Henry Wheatley. Well, Henry Wheatley, oh, we're getting, we're getting both names here. And out come the Mavs. So the, you've got to say that Mavs at the moment have had more zone time. There's a, there's a third shot on Patrick, but that's probably one of the easier saves he'll make this weekend. Yep, that's your tail, killing someone. Yep, I told you, <laughs> as advertised. The body is just a vessel to, to this one. Yes. <laughs> to carry out one's will. <laughs> well, we're going all the way for the offside here. The ref's, the ref's running a tight ship now um, with a deliberate offside. I like this ref over here. I'm not sure who that is. What, what, what ref have we got? No, I'll find it in a minute. Just skates almost like you're watching a video game ref. Oh, blocked! Okay, you could just let Patrick save that. It's fine. Oh, good save by Patrick. He's got, he's got that one. Oh, oh, dear. Josh Monaco down on his pants. He paid good money for those skates, he should probably use them, Rambo. <laughs> Are they Fisher skates by any chance? No. Because oh. <laughs> if they were, he wouldn't have fallen over. And he, well, he probably wouldn't have paid that much money for them either, because they're quite uh, reasonable, Fisher skates. This is not an ad. <laughs> <laughs> but if you want any skates, who, give us a, ping us a message. Here we go. It's Christy. Brace it. Josh Monaco. Oh! That's a great defensive play. Is that, what's this guy? Is this guy full name Cross Banks? I like that. Oh no, it's Cross Baha. Biwa. Yeah. The Cross BYJ. Icing. Icing. So this this should be a chance maybe for the Kings to generate a shot. We've not done so yet. Is uh, we announced that Icing is brought to us by Roberto Del Granto? Uh, no, he's not paid this year. So oh, right. he's, he's, he, well, he needs to re-up on his... We've uh, lost our sponsorship on that front. Eva says that is Tom Barrett. Yes, I, I think it is Tom Barrett. Yes, it says Barrett on the back of his jersey. Ah, here we are. Thank you. Look at this. I, lo I love this service we're getting here. Thank you, Max. Um, here we go. Good poke, Jack. You have to say, is it not refreshing seeing the Mavs play white and yes. having nice jerseys? Because remember those ones with like the Times New Roman numbers. Yeah, and the and the like the logo somewhere around here. Yeah. The BYJ one, not the not the the laughing cow. Yeah. And, and they're actually nicer than the green ones, in my yes, opinion. Yes, yeah, I, I, you know what, I completely agree. Yeah, here's Baia. Shot. Oh, good save. Oh, double save by Patrick again. It's now 6-0 in shots to Nottingham, but as I said to you, as I said, as the wise man said in the power rankings, do not sleep on this goalie. Good defensive stop there. Ok, 
Fingers crossed, Bahia. That's not how you pronounce it, Bahia. Oh dear, I'm sorry if anyone is his friend or family and I'm butchering his name. I'm trying. There's some good work. Oh, from chance! Oh, the Kings have went to sleep! And Patrick bails them out! Oh dear there. Somebody needs to tell those de send those dear telegram, Nick. <laughs> They've got to keep skating. Yeah. I'm liking this tactic here. Yep. Un unorthodox. <laughs> nope. <laughs> what a shame. <laughs> They've just given up the ref. Close. Just dropped it anyway. I think that was the definition of close enough. Yeah. That's, that's next she just, um, you know, like um, in certain things where you preload like something. She was just yeah. preloading going to the point. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Here's Wiltshire. That's off the side of the cage. Hammer away. Oh, 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 don't do that. Don't do that. 7-0. 7-0 on shots. Sorry, it's 0-0 on... I'll tell you what. There is some dedicated point marking going on over there. Yeah, good for you. Probably know each other. Got each other numbers. Well, that's, exchange that, recipes. That, 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 that's, that's what I told them that they need to do. Yeah. If they, the, the, My, my uh, philosophy on coaching beginners for marking point men is you need to come off and tell me their favourite colour. <laughs> that's good. As, as everyone can see, the clock is reset now, so we have eight minutes left. I think it's just a case that it's the one had nudged behind the scorebook. Yeah, yeah. Look, that's wide. It's a bit of a shooting gallery for the, the Mavs E right now. Um, did you charge Patrick extra for being here since he's getting more for his money uh, than everyone else? Oh, I thought that was going to be a big steam roulette there, but it didn't quite work out that way. Here's Wiltshire, he knocks it over. Bramwell goes after it. This is the other thing. Mavs jerseys, most of the names, accurate. Bramwell shoots. Oh, he tried the short sider. Didn't Big quite work. He was already celebrating. I, I, I'm not entirely sure if he was celebrating or dancing, but he... You know that there is a... The one main fan is tuning into the live stream. <laughs> so you've got a, a picture there of Nick's dog, uh, Apollo. Oh, great save again by Patrick. So that one kind of just released at a point you didn't think it was coming from, and he just he stayed big. And another good save from him. That's nine saves he's had so far. The Kings have kind of collapsed on D apart from that one dedicated point, <laughs> point <laughs> over the far side. Here's Wiltshire. Wiltshire shoots. Oh, and that sticks to Patrick and they'll be thankful for the stop. They got a line change, the Kings. I'm just trying to work out. I'm sure, you know, when we paid our Nationals entry fee, we did pay to use both halves of the ice. Yeah. I'm not sure if we did. No. We'll, we'll, get, we'll get a check on that and come back to you. It's like... Um, Here's Henry Wheatley. It's kind of like Easter Road in uh, Edinburgh. It was built on a slope. <laughs> it feels like... Yes. Or Whitley Bay, actually, <laughs> to be fair. Oh, out the zone for the Kings. Now they've got a chance. It's a 2 and all. It's a 2 and all. Wheatley. Wheatley steps in. Wheatley. Oh, no. Mercy. Nick's going mad. The puck's <sighs> lost. The puck is lost to us. I don't even Where's know where it went. <laughs> that was harder to miss the net. <laughs> I don't know how you managed to do Could that. Could not hit water if he fell oh, out of the boat. Oh, goodness. Do not trust that guy with your pancakes, mate. It's going on the roof. Like, that was not good. <laughs> oh, chance again. Oh, the first shot and goal for the Kings. Comes from number three, Nichols. Nichols and Dimes. I was thinking something along those lines actually when I said that name. Oh, and here's a chance from Felber. Felber. Good back check from Wheatley. Wheatley takes out Patrick. <laughs> Felber. 
more exciting stuff here. <laughs> hey, I did. I never said we weren't going to be entertaining. So, so this is this is <laughs> carnage. <laughs> we're not getting that. We're getting quite quiet live stream chatters actually. See, the thing is, BIG memes won't want to comment if they're watching the live stream on the YouTube because they might not have their mm -hmm. own BIG memes account, so they'll need to go and do that on YouTube. Good back check again by Wheatley. Wonder what their thoughts are so far in the tournament. There's a chance if Nichols probably the end of her shift here. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, wait, I was icing. I, thought, <laughs> <laughs> I didn't hear the whistle. I thought, I thought he just left it. Um, So just under five to go now. Now we're down below five minutes. Um, now the game begins. We've had the warm up. Here's Wiltshire. Nichols. Of course the Kings couldn't change it. I was thinking why didn't they change, but of course it's icing. But now they could change. They, they, they could possibly change now. Oh, 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 one of them was trying to get into the... I'm not sure. Oh no, they've decided not to. These are quite heroically length shifts from the Kings here. Shot, all blocked. Felber, oh, it's white. I, I, I'm, I'm really impressed with how we seem to be. I think Patrick's probably going to have a hard enough job without us trying to tip shots for him. Yeah, I, I, I'm admiring the, the commitment to try and block, but um, some of it is uh, is actually ill advised. Ooh, that was cheeky. Yeah. I'm going to put it out there if uh, I think there we go that's the 11th save for Patrick so far um, I'm going to put it out there though I think if perhaps Patrick wasn't in goal I think we would have seen a couple of goals from Felbert and, uh, mm -hmm. and uh, Wiltshire by now I think they, they're going to be dangerous for Nottingham over this weekend this is quite a pedestrian change That reminded that change reminded me of the Edinburgh Capitals in their Elite League days. Great, great, great <laughs> piece of defensive work there by Captain yeah. Darren Burgess. Capitals now, of course, an SNL team and uh, much better changing. So, <laughs> not not about making the playoffs, though. Yeah, unfortunately, the uh, they kind of choked in the play uh, that from. But going to Kilmarnock, I don't know if you've ever been to Kilmarnock. Um, once described by our Swedish player as um, being a place that no one would want to live because it's so depressing. So wow, um, that that coming from a Swede as well. I've been to Stockholm. It's very nice, very expensive though. Well, like Sweden or Scotland? Sweden. I got confused when you described it as very nice. Two minutes, less than two to go. Oh, here we go. Here's a chance for the Mavs. Steps in. Steps in. Everyone's went to sleep. Oh, what a poke check! Where did that come from? And then Patrick's with the 12th save of the, the afternoon for himself. Oh, it's all in front. What's going on here? Oh, we'll be a bit early there just to stop the clock. Hey, I haven't seen you move that quick in a long time. Yeah. So we're uh, just ticking down to the last minute here. Kings change. Finally get to see... Uh, oh, ah, great! I called him out in the in the power rankings, and then he goes and does that. Thanks, Sanderson. You're making me look like a fool. Will the Kings get one chance? Oh, oh! For the greatest burglary in the world, <laughs> it would be a burglary here. The shot count currently twelve to one, um, in favour of the uh, good good attempted hip check by uh, Josh Monaco. Oh, that went out. I'm sure that went out. So oh. called it. Oh, she called it. Oh, clock. Oh, right. Two two potatoes this time. I'm afraid. I was too excited. I didn't realise she called it offside there. That's <laughs> one potato, two potato. There we go. Monaco. Oh, Monaco. 
anyone's got any good monocle references they want to me to try and shoe in, then please do so. Here's Wiltshire. Oh, offside. Fell over the blue line. Yeah. The blue line can be as 3D as you like, but if you're going to fly three foot past it, then... Uh, I think that one was more 3D. It's probably about a couple of inches higher than everywhere else, Judge, on that trip. <laughs> so um, we're at ice, ca ice car after this one, Nick, aren't we? Uh, yes. I would like to think so. The ice is pretty chopped up now. Still quite not entered the Whitley Bay standard. Sanderson knocks it forward. A chance for Wheatley against... Might want to get on Rowan with this. Baya. If he goes to the net. Four seconds left. Chance. Chance! Oh, unbelievable save! Right on the just of the death. Oh, 12-2, the final shot count. 0-0, the final score. I thought they'd played the perfect, perfect away game. <laughs> we can press complete now, Nick. We can press, I think we can press game. Oh, we've got the game summary. Let's just leave that up. Let the ice cut take place. Um, and we'll be back shortly. Um, oh, that was an exciting game. I quite enjoyed that. And uh, Patrick lived up to Billing. I'm not sure about Sanderson, but you know. <laughs> you were pretty much Bon Jovi on that one. Yeah, 50-50, halfway. Um, the uh, the Mavs are uh, looking very, very, very good though um, in their mm -hmm. game. Um, and, it, and again, teams deciding to not only sit in there through the ice cut, but in the wrong box. Well, they're doing one each. They've saved the Kings a hassle. Look at that. What a, what a night. Let, let it never be said. A bad word about the Nottingham Mavericks. What a bunch of nice guys and girls. <laughs> Normally, bunch of is not followed by nice guys when you describe the Mavericks, but, you know, fair enough. And my shoes are firmly on. Yeah, yeah. Um, I mean, I'll need to get this ch charger business sorted out.
So after a brief moment there where I thought we weren't going to get the uh, we weren't going to get <laughs> the score bug up, we have. Again, it says five minutes. I can only apologise um, for that. Yeah, it's 15, don't worry. So just uh, when the first five counts down, it'll jump back to be nine or whatever. So, you know, you're fine. So this is the uh, Birmingham Lions D, against UEA B. Oh, Helen Harrison says, let's go abs, obviously into a muscular physique or she's misspelled Avs one of the two I think the, I think a B and a, and a, a V are quite close to each other on the keyboard You're going to create mayhem like last year? No. Oh, thank you. Sorry, I was speaking to young Joseph there. All right, I'm still doing this clock thing, so. one. Oh, well those are those are vibrant pink gloves there from number 43 of the Az Smith. Smith knocks it away. I've just realised that the abs thing is because it's the abs B. Oh, a couple of, oh, a couple of two of them having a wee conflab uh, over at this point here. Oh, and Soderberg goes down. The chance. Webb lifts his stick before he gets it on, oh, and then he falls, he wipes out completely. But flipped over. That's bigger bench than normal. The Navs B are normally quite short bench, but definitely got a few more bodies on that bench than normal. Uh, the lines, just two lines. I don't know if you caught that, the player just falling over in the middle of the ice there for the Avs. Puck is away. Oliver Amy's will stop that. He's normally plays for the Avs. Green stops it. Chance to go the other way now. Then Oaks will go after that. Puck knocked behind. Amy's can't quite get a hold of it. Stops and goes the other way. Ahead, right through everyone. Chance now. 
There's a half break for the for the Avs. Oh, and Oaks. Not entirely sure what was going on there, what went through his mind. The Avs are miles offside. A lot of yelling from each bench, trying to get instructions on nice. Avs B put that in the corner. Now picked up by Birmingham. He's went one hand. Oh, oh, hey, there we go. Double calamity there. Lions D, knock it down nice. Good play. Chu knocks it forward. Foskett is after it. And then. Correct. We are still nil nil on shots. Taking a long time to set this this ice and face off up. Oh, he's turned his stick over for oh, and it went. It worked. Oh, won the draw there. The flipped over stick. Uh, Molly Foskett there. A bit of ingenuity. Knocked in, kept in, still kept in, here we go. Poke checked, another poke check, but Birmingham still kind of have the puck. Smith goes in the corner. Oh, he falls. Jade Doody had it, now it's around behind, tries to stuff it, falls. Avs knocks it out the zone. And the Lions have to regroup. For Shaw. For Shaw, nice pass. Oh, the Lions D are miles offside there, though. A good six to eight foot offside. Still nil nil in shots. Um, the early exchanges in this game. To say ten minutes, just over ten minutes left. Oh, that's kept in at the blue line. Not back in. Chipped out. Chance now for Matt Avs. It's a two on all. It's a two on all. There's two back checkers for shot and goal, perhaps. Oh, it's a goal for, Ma eh, for the Avs Beads, number 18. I think that's Wandsworth. Morgan Longworth there with the goal. 18 unassisted on the goal. And the Avs are off to the best possible start with a... 1-0 lead with the first shot on goal. It's a good shooting percentage. Birmingham to take a chance. Play broken up. Still no shots. The chance now for a shot. Shot. Is the shot going to come? It is. It's saved. It's one all in shots now. That took an awful long time to get that shot off. But Amy's had spread himself across the, the ice there. So hey, we'd have to go upstairs to get it. A lot of pressure on the on the shot as well. Rim back round behind. Out the zone. Chu fires it up the middle. Puck is in. Lions have got a lot of zone pressure. They've just not really gotten many shots off. Another chance. That counts as a shot on Amy, so it's 2 1 shots now. Oh, down goes another Birmingham player, but Birmingham again getting in the zone. Here's Garner. Gur, sorry. Gur. Flipped away by Amy's. Back in. Gur. Takes a shot. Good save by Amy's, nice and low.
Steps in, shot, shot. Oh, another chance. Just can't quite react it quick enough. Oh, Birmingham sort of gave up half on the play and then recovered just in the nick of time to stop, stop a, a breakaway chance. Pimperton there, battling two. Lions D's. Puck knocked in the middle. Steps in, shoots. Good save again by Amy's. Birmingham definitely with more zone time. And now going the other way are the Avs, and that's a lovely little pass from Longworth. Oh, and he flipped it wide, hit it to him, won a soft pass across. You'd like to think that they would have buried the chance there. Here's Longworth again, Longworth, it's all broken up. Played back in by Friedman. Wall. It's knocked off the wall. Oaks stops it. Two Avs players there. They actually hold the zone themselves. Birmingham knock it in deep towards the net. Amy stops it for Longworth. Longworth, the scorer, the only goal so far. Looking to go from deep. Knocks it forward, he absolutely creams a, a Lions player as he comes out of the zone there. Bailey puts it past one. P up the wall. Foskett picks it up. Foskett surveys her options. Nice little dummy there, I'm not sure if she meant it, but it worked well. And there's, a, there's another person knocked to the ice in Foskett there. In the middle ice, number 33 just comes against her. Oh, uh, Birmingham are offside. They're offside, the rest giving them every opportunity. But it's offside and then a collision along the wall. Oh, he's taken all the way for deliberate. I guess he did shout enough. Just coming in for the last sort of five minutes or so. Oh, good save for the Birmingham goalie. That's his first save of the match, despite being one down. Shot from the point. Oh, great save again. And then a follow-up poke check. Shot count now 4-3 to the Lions, although it is the Avalanche that are uh, in the lead on the board in terms of actual goals scored. Chance now. It's Gurr. Gurr. Shot! Oh! Oh! oh, oh. oh and Smith just wipes out his own goalie and the net in the back check there. Thought Gar was going to get that. I'm getting a lot on the chat here. I charged my phone momentarily. Paula Longworth watching in her watching her son today. Uh, saying well done to him for his first goal. The Lions flipping the putt. It flipped his hands there. Seems quite a common tactic. Chance there, good save by Amy's. So now the Lions line up. Wrong hash mark there for number 30. 
We've seen worse today. Lions, if they can just get one of those chances buried, you'd like to think that they're good for at least a draw in this game. They've had plenty of chance, like plenty of opportunities coming down there. Just either hitting the target or um, some big saves from Amy's. Oh, what a play! What a giving up the body, but now it's a it's a two two on all. Two on all. Great back check from 33. Shot. Oh, and that goes wide. That back check though, that hustle. Maybe he just saw the, out the corner of his eye. Saw the back checker and then puts that puck wide. All three Sheffield teams have played so far. 88 people um, tuning in right now at this hour of the day on a Saturday. Good for you guys. Stick handling out the zone. Chance again for Birmingham. The Smith. It's on him, 33, oh, the man with the back check in a half earlier on, 33, maybe deserves a goal after all that. And the puck will just come out of the zone, so Birmingham will have to clear. The Lions will need to make sure they get it in. It's coming for the last two minutes. Score still 1-0. Oh, and they can't get a hold of it. It's a chance now, though. Oh, good backhand. And a secondary shot. Oh, oh, two unbelievable saves. And then he just flipped that one just over the bar. Oh, great back check there. And that's covered up. Shot total, eight on, eight on the halves now from Birmingham. Still five on the, on the Birmingham Lions, but, oh. You feel that's a chance went a big in there for the, the Lions to come back into this, but enough time, plenty of time. <laughs> Foskett went down there and then got a puck towards her face for good measure. Uh, luckily, we're in a cage and it uh, actually didn't hurt her, so it's all good. Three on one here. Three on one from the Lions. They've lost control of it though. Oh, and now Longworth going the other way. Do it for Paula. Shot. Oh, he's done it for Paula indeed. Number 18, Longworth unassisted again. Eighteen, no assist there for the Avs B. So that's the sixth shot on, on Birmingham. And unfortunately for them, the second goal, despite all their efforts in front, not sure, they've not got anything to show for it. I think they're ruining that triple chance. Yeah, it just, just floated over the net, and oh, that's miles offside. Um, I think number 33 for, uh, for Birmingham, though, pretty, uh, pretty dangerous. And great back check earlier on to prevent a scoring chance too. Again, one thing you can always say about Birmingham is full commitment. Yeah. Here he is, 33. Oh, 33, the, man, the aforementioned number 33, who I've, I've, I've went and let this go away. I can't remember, I've not looked at his name yet. Um, but I will have to. Uh, what are you making of these? These are lovely. That is a, a shade of pink I've never seen, uh, I think, on a hockey rink. That's uh, like pink with extra pink. Yeah, so th there we go. That's 2-0 uh, the final score there. Um, even though Rambo didn't put the, the, the score up until now. Um, shot count. Uh, shot count there was 8 on eight on the halves and 6 on the, on the lines. Um... So now we've got Manchester... Oh, I better reset the clock, yeah? There we go. I'm getting the hang of this now. Uh, so Man's, Manchester C... I was always saying Manchester United there, but then... <laughs> that would be doing Manchester a disservice because uh, the, even the Metros aren't as terrible as Man United, so... Um,
So I'm going to welcome in Max Springer. Don't worry, you've not missed him. Uh, he'll miss you. Uh, here we go. Hi, Max. You are right, Robert. How are we doing? Good, good. So you're coming on for this uh, Manchester game, are we? Yeah, go uh, for it. Bring a bit of inside knowledge. Yeah. Um, so, I mean, is this a team that uh, kind of missing Ezekiel a little bit this year, I think? Well, that's the thing. It's, it's like, what this team's got to do now is they've got to find someone to step up and basically take his place and score the goals in the team. There's definitely there's players in there that could do it. Grubb's got a good ability on the puck. Um, Harvey, number 16, has got a really good ability. The one to look out, what I, what I look out for is Ben Hodgkinson as well. He's the one that, number 79, he will just crash the net and yeah. might have no concern for his own safety whatsoever. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm not, it doesn't sit well with me you've let him put a nickname on the back of his jersey, I'm going to be honest. That, that, got, that got by me, I wouldn't have allowed it either. Uh, I, I'm a traditionalist, I'm not a, <laughs> not a fan of random names in the back. I mean, how are you supposed to market them? Like, you know, I suppose people want Hodgie jerseys now. That's what you watch next year. Everyone, next year, everyone will be wearing it. Of course, big steps for Manchester this year, right? Entering their own women's team as well. Yeah, women's team making the debut next week. I'm very excited about that. It's, um, something we wanted to get off the ground for a while, obviously. We had a lot of girls playing for playing for Leeds last year. Yep. Yeah. yeah, we had a lot playing for Leeds last year. Well, you could tell you could tell Nikki was playing for Leeds because you could see her socks before you saw the rest of the team. Yeah. Um, be quite a few. You've got, uh, what what do you make of her gloves? Of her gloves? Oh, I've never actually noticed them. They, this, <laughs> the attention kind of goes to the socks, you know? Um, when you got it. But yeah, yeah it's, it's good to see growth, uh, growth of the women's tournament next week. Um, I better remember to start the clock because I've been, been getting better progressively throughout the day. <laughs> uh, starting the clock. And there we go. So this is interesting because uh, obviously when I done it with Nick, Nick's got the inside knowledge of uh, the Kings. Um, so it's a different perspective now. We can uh, we can talk about the trains uh, instead. Do you guys call each other the trains, or are you just you always go metros? There, there's 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 a lot of train. There's a lot more train references now when I first than from when I first joined. Yeah, isn't the metro a tram though technically? Yeah. Oh, uh, well, Grob's I lost his, lost a glove. And he's just. <laughs> I uh, could have probably skated with that, to yeah. be fair. Uh, maybe he didn't like the feel of the shaft in his bare hand. He's definitely, yeah. <laughs> oh, here we go. Here we go. Ren in front of the goal. Oh, saved by Patrick. First shot of the game. You got This is this is the. You got to. He's the problem solver for the Kings, uh, Patrick. Uh, I don't know if you saw the first game. Kings out shot twelve to one, uh, and. Uh, but we said it right. When a, when a game's fifteen minutes, if you've got a goal, he's having a good game. You can snatch, you can easily snatch a result in a fifteen no. minute game. Like, yeah, new format this year, just because uh, well, time constraints, frankly, and no entries. Uh, you do you get a little bit longer in the in the knockouts, which I think is more important, to be fair. Yeah, I'd rather have longer games yeah. than knockouts. And there's uh, the good thing is everyone's going to be playing for something on the Sunday, right? So, um, you know, this, this one splits into three, right? The, the, yeah, these two split into three, which obviously gives. So you've got the uh, the plate, the quake, and the um, the bowl. Is the quake a rugby thing? No, quake is a Scottish thing. Right. Um, I got to name I got to name one of them. So uh, traditionally, the plate's always been first. Um, but quake is like a Scottish drinking dish. And uh, some some oh, where we go chance for Hodgkinson. Oh, that's just wide. I think they, the Kings are relying on hitting on the break here um, a lot of the time. We've got a little bit of hand net here, steady, steady defender. It's my favourite name in, in the in nationals. Double obble. <laughs> it's just awesome. Get, get, it's so much fun to see. Here Here's Gurwapa. Gurwapa. Let's go for the wraparound. Oh, oh it's on the line! Oh! Oh! I'm not sure I can say this, but in Scotland that would be described as a ball here away from going in. Um, oh, I did say it, sorry. Um, <laughs> that's, that was so close. Um, That's what's wrong, isn't it? Yeah, it's 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 so score remains. Score remains uh, nil nil. Can't get much closer than that. No, no. Uh, here's Sanderson. And they're completely offside. Well, they, they they did, it didn't matter because uh, Gurwapa decided that they weren't getting a chance. 
Pass it. Oh, no, she's wide. Good battle. It comes to Grob. Now, am I right in thinking you're not actually playing? Oh, Grob. Grob steps in. Grob shoots. Oh, he floats oh. one over the bar. Shots currently 2 0 in favour of the, the Metros. And I think that is the closest we've seen anyone uh, to scoring on uh, on Patrick this weekend. I don't think he even knew it was there until about three skaters were going for it. No, no, it's just it probably just as well his skaters didn't get there because I could have seen that being poked into his own net for his sake anyway. I know you would have preferred it. Really, but. <laughs> oh, Drop! Oh, Drop's going for a roughing pen. Oh no, holding. Okay, okay. Let's see if I can do this right. Penalty. Uh, what's number C26? Uh, 26, yeah. So 26 2 for Holden. In case you all think I'm mad and I keep saying penalties back like the, the, the numbers, it's also to help um, our assistant at the end there. She's doing a great job actually. She's been there for like most of the morning. So uh, everyone say well done, Beth, on the, uh, on the stream. Well done, Beth. Here comes Harvey, short handed. He's got Taylor in the middle. Oh, good save. Oh, the puck's like the loose, the puck's loose. And uh, eventually yeah. gets there. That's a good play, short-handed. Yeah, well, the, the Metro's very much taking that mantra that the uh, a penalty against you is just a chance for a short-handed goal. Uh, so nothing there, that would, uh, nothing there would suggest that this is a power play at the moment. So Puck fired up, it's oh, kept in. Co Short. Coach Chapel takes the special teams very seriously, so he'll, he'll be happy to see that. How many hours am I in? Uh, that'll be three hours and 20 seconds. Oh, chance, chance. Oh, that could have been a hooking penalty and double obble there. In fact, that was more of a hooking penalty than the holding penalty that was actually called. Chance. Oh, good D from Mickey. Richardson. Oh, holding the shape well. Doing all the oh, right no, things. no, no, the Kings, the Kings. You've got to get that blue line there. Oh, dear. Harvey's putting the pressure on. Is this guy? Is this guy's last name actually Stone? Yes. Yeah. Oh, oh. Oh, that was a bad time to blow a tyre. Stone tries to deke. Oh, what oh. a save! Unbelievable save from Patrick. Oh, gets the, gets the paddle down. Rolls them out of trouble there. Here we got attention to now, no. Chance. Oh, that's right, that's wide. Kings, oh, shot and goal. Shot on target. Oh, digging away. Oh! Oh, still there! Oh. oh, double shot as well at the King's end. Shots now five to two. Shots five to two. I'm, I'm, I'm convinced there might have been, might have been some skullduggery there. Uh, there are definitely some shenanigans in the crease. Uh, in, the, in the crease there from the metros, um, but <laughs> they got away with it, and uh, and the, the score remains nil nil. So five to two on the shots so far. Kings getting a wee bit more offence in this one. That's full strength, Metros. Yep. That was a decent kill, though, because oh, they got, they got some chances themselves. Bounce off the ref right into the slot. <laughs> well played by Lolo. But great across. Double wobbles now, got it. Rain. Oh yeah, we've got two nicknames on Jersey's then, because Ren's got, well, it's Ren, Ren's nickname is on the back of AJZ ah, as well. Damn, I just assumed that he was, like, related to Kylo. But it had to be Ren so. Ted. Which might be my favourite, like, Metro's jersey combination. Rob is asking if I'm in the gorilla position. Indeed, I am kind of not. I'm doing the clock. Oh, offside. Smashes his stick on the ice in frustration. Yeah, there's been a lot of frustrated people at offsides this this weekend. Mm, I've noticed that way. You'd be less frustrated if you learned the rule and didn't go offside all the time. But um, do we have a shot count? We do. It is. It's currently five on the Kings and two on the on the Metros. Um, Oh, 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 now here's a chance. Oh, still on it. All still. Right, well, and there we go. That's now six on the on the Kings and two on the Metros. 
I mean, I think there was only two shots down there. Maybe in about eight. But there was definitely some tomfoolery going on down there as well. There was a few digs. Yeah. Richardson can't get it in. Can they can keep it in? Oh, not, not quite. Far. Oh man, nails are bright. It's when they come over here, eh? Yeah, the gloves. Yeah, it looks like a whole like like a Skittles packet on her hand. Then she had that, and then she's got this Jurassic Park bright green and red jersey. It just goes completely with everything. And it's like the most horrific kit you've ever seen. Yeah. Here goes Grub. Oh, good oh, save. Oh, that's a logo. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I feel good as the Kings uh, there when the goalie looks behind him after he makes the <laughs> save. Uh, shot count now seven to two in favour of the Metros. Metros definitely the, uh, the the side with more offence in this game. Just need maybe maybe one more person in front of the net, get one of these rebounds, just get a dirty goal. I think that's how that, I think that's how we're going to score here. But they're doing all the right things. They play well, play well last game as well. At Sheffield here, a tough opponent. Ooh, so. ho, ho, ho. You don't want to tip it towards your goal either. There's Wren. That's really ruined it for me now. I thought Wren was going to be like, you know, like I could get some Star Wars references in. Yeah, oh, that's a good save. 8 2 uh, on the shot count. There's Wren again. Puck fired in Put front. Of oh, nice play. Nice break up. Puck out it goes. Out. Oh, that's a a tactically astute smack smack away there, but uh, didn't really go to anyone. Wilson, is that Wilson Dixon? It is. Oh, that is a guy we decided sounded like a country band. He was like a countryman, yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Just like you know, he loves that nickname. What country band? Yeah. But number ten is Warren Betts. That doesn't even sound right with red on the back. Yeah. Two and all here. Stone and Hodgkinson. Stone! Oh! Doesn't find Hodgkinson! Oh my word! Johnny Wilkinson did it over the top of the bar. <laughs> Unbelievable! Three in the crease after that from Hodgkinson. <coughs> dear oh dear. Oh. I mean, it wasn't an empty net, but still. Jeez. That's not the rule. <laughs> That's not the rule. No, if it's three in the crease, it's outside, yeah. Was it? it out, oh no no, he's three in the crease. He called it for. She hit the plexi. Ah. Uh, yeah. yeah. Too many refs up here. <laughs> I'm not There's a ref a anymore. I'm not a ref anymore. I got tired of being shouted at as a linesman for the referee's mistake, so I <laughs> gave up. Right, grab. Oh, it's got space. Got space to yep. skate. Oh, the right down the middle of the D here. Patrick with a save. No one in for the rebound, though. Oh, and it almost gets flipped back out. Well kept by Tyler. That is Charlotte. Good, good effort to keep that in the zone there. Yeah, I'm not sure this goal is going to be beaten one on one. I think you do need a rebound or a two on one. A two yeah, on yeah one absolutely. Oh, that was wide. Sanjay. Nice move. Here we go, this is what we're talking about. It's an odd, odd man. Shot. Oh, that goes wide. Patrick kind of falls down there. He's turned away all 10 of the shots he's faced so far. Still 10 2 in the, sh in the shooting. Apart from that little scramble, which looked like it might come up Kings, there's been nothing from the Kings offensively. Another chance. Oh, good save again. Oh, Hodgkinson in his feet though. He's got the chance again. There's no Another one pressuring. 12 2 in shots now. Another one. Oh, 13 2. Oh, he won that one back. What a shame. I think that's. Is that number seven, Gurwapa, that put that in? Please, so uh, it had to give eventually. It's like, a, what was I saying before about you need a rebound or just a, di a dirty goal in front of the net? Number seven there uh, with the goal, unassisted. Unassisted. 
happened. Oh. <laughs> now some running repairs from the Kings here. Maybe the player, uh, when, you, when you down a goal, maybe the player should just go off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's what I was like. Go I mean, off, get another player on. You, 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 you got, you've, you, you've got time. 13-2 on the shots, though. They need to generate a shot. Um, you don't get as much um, running clock shenanigans in lower tiers. Oh, yeah, thanks. Getting bossed around here by Bethany. <laughs> and Keeping us in check. Yeah. <laughs> well, it's just as well. I would forget to put, the, put it on the clock. That's flipped out. It's number 69. It's hilarious. Wilson. Good whopper. Good whopper. Great oh, save. Great save. Great save by Patrick there. Stayed with it. And another good save. I mean, the fact it's 1 0 is pretty outrageous and a big credit to the goaltender here. Oh, massive credit to yeah. the goalie here. He's, played, he's had a really good game. 15 2 on shots indeed. I forget I forget that um, nobody can hear Bethany when she asked me to clarify the shot count. Thirty-five seconds now. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Chance! Chance! They've now got the chance! Is he gonna get the shot off? Oh! He overskated it! But it's at least 15 3 now. Generated another shot! Oh, Big save by Rob. Save. Rob Rob Young. Finally gets has to make some saves and do some work in this game. 69. Oh, Wait, can't keep it in. Oh, there we go. And that you have to think was the last roll of the dice for the Kings. Oh, a swing and a miss. Swing and a miss. <laughs> Another swing and a miss. And that will be all she wrote. Final score: one nil. Shot count: 15-4 in favour of the Metros. So you have to say they're good for the win. Yep, solid game for Metros all around, positioning well. Didn't give, didn't barely gave up, barely gave up any chance to Northumbria. Probably could have, probably could have been three or four, but Northumbria goalie having a really good game there. So, yeah, there we go. So we're going to the next game. Is that the first penalty of the, of the morning so far? No, or? no, there has been uh, two others, uh, too many. Of course. Um, and oh, I need to reset the clock. That helps. And. Uh, so that's yes, yeah, back to nil nil. Forget the five minutes, folks. As we said before, I feel like I'm a salesman. <laughs> Forget the five minutes. The ten minutes is yours. That was an awful English accent, wasn't it? That that could have been. That's not the worst I've ever heard. To be fair, kind of considered slightly offensive. I, I um, won't. I won't do a Scottish one. Yeah. So I don't know. What, I don't know what part of England that accent was from. I presume London. Certainly wasn't Yorkshire. With a hint of, with a hint of Watford, maybe. Watford. She, she, well, she, I just, sorry, I was just relaying messages here and I was, could you ask this, but there's not Chinese whispers we're doing here. So out comes the Nottingham uh, Mavericks uh, E against the Birmingham Lions D. Alex is a, like he's a firm believer in the horn. <laughs> oh, nice! We shared a room last night. Can confirm it, that. Like if it was a big red button, he'd be, he'd be pressing it all the time. There we go. So here we go. Just got to let everyone know. I have to say, I have to say, I did say earlier that the Newcastle were winning. The uh, the worst jerseys in the competition so far. Barley, award. But it's it's but, the bad look. But, but the, the Birmingham jerseys are an abomination. The white ones. They. Oh, I'm sorry. Sorry to Birmingham people. I do like Birmingham. What is going on? Why is the goalie not on? Has he lost his helmet? Nothing worse than when you lose your helmet. This is what I don't get. Like like look, the wingers on this line have both got nice white jerseys, and then there's a cream one in the middle. I think Birmingham might be cruising for a delayed game penalty here. How do you forget your helmet? Hmm? 
Oh, dear. And now he's... Nah, you got to get, get him out of here. Sorry. In your own time, Birmingham. Oh, uh, well, Trick, v, uh, trick is only, it's only started today. You just missed the first three and a half hours. See how they keep looking down? It feels like they've been here about eight hours, but it's only three, three and a half. They've got two number 39s not again. Uh, yeah, the... <laughs> no, no, no. Oh. Have they? Oh, dear. That, that must be a typographical error. Bramley, ooh, and Tinkler, Tinkler now picks up, that's a fun name to say, Tinkler, I like that. I feel like there's a joke there somewhere, but... Well, he's probably got full of nervous energy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Tad Stewart, oh! And the oh, <laughs> players run into the crossbar. That's a chance! Oh, 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 oh scenes, absolute scenes here. It's all happening in that crease today. I don't think either team's actually generated the shot yet. Just lots of stuff going on in the crease. Interestingly, Trigg, our Nottingham, uh, our Norway fan, um, will be interested to know that I'm going to Oslo for a weekend in Ooh. September. Never been to Norway before. I've heard it's very expensive. Oh, wait a minute, it's, uh, it's now five on four because not enough have chosen to go with four players only. Playing out the zone. On him. Oran. Oran. On the net. In the danger zone. He's wanting to do his lap there. That's the day. Birmingham actually with an unusually high bench number for them. I was going to say they've got a full change. Well, here they go, they've yeah, got a chance. Chance. Shot flipped. Oh, good oh. save. Well, that almost fooled the goalie there. Oh, and that's cleared. Now, if Birmingham oh, can race back. Contact. Oh, there's a penalty coming. In. I think I think there's a penalty coming. Icing. They called it icing, so I thought, no, it was the icing they had his hand up for. Yeah. Um, I wasn't sure because there was a kind of collision after. Um, oh, I saw, yeah, I saw the contact and the arm going up. And you just kind of assume at that point. Yeah. This is why in two-man systems in Scotland they don't do delayed penalties. For that reason. Now, in Canada, yeah. what they do is the refs have one arm, one arm striped with the orange and one arm not. So if it's offside, you put your normal arm up. I, told you that. <laughs> I saw it. I saw it in Canada as well. Yeah. You definitely forget which arm though, you think. I think you should have two half ref jerseys and stuff as well. You know, like one of these uh, Britain's Got Talent people. <laughs> yeah. Helbert! Oh, Helbert. Goalie very aggressive in his crease there. <laughs> oh, it's still there, still chance. Oh, and it goes up. Oh, up and over. And hits the net. A new biscuit is required. Got it. Ah, one in the pocket there. Puck in the pocket is worth two in the bush. Where are we? Face off, one by Nottingham. Birmingham now. Races down nice. Oh, dangles. Oh, there's a chance here for Birmingham. Oh, he oh. shoots it right at the goalie's logo. Right in the cow. Yeah. Ah. Oh. You've got to remember that when he's shooting there, that's not a dartboard and you're throwing darts at the, the Mavs logo. You've got, to, you've got to shoot for the space. Let's be honest, we've all thought about that, right? Being like a cow-faced uh, Oh, we went with more of that. What did you see our, our laughing cow sign we had for them last year? Yeah. Yeah. I can't unsee it now, though. Every time I see a Mavs jersey. 
Puck picked up by Birmingham. Oh, nice poke check there. Sonny's got to the net. And now we come the other way, flipped off the wall. Painful. Yeah, they look at. I think, I think number I, 47 is actually Winson. I, um, I think they're okay. They're, they're going for the change. They're going for the change. Off their own power, so. Yeah. That was definitely a rib rattler, that one. Here comes. Cross Bahi, huh? Rowan, I think for sure. He's got the puck around the back. And there we go, puck's out. Oh, that was a good stick there. Another chance. Good save. I think the Birmingham goalie just gave him a bit of a sh shove for good measure as well. I think he had a few words afterwards. Yeah. Shot count currently 2 all. Burnham. Dumps it in deep. Picked up. Oh, behind the net. It's a very physical game. It has been quite physical, actually. I'm not sure if that's clumsiness or, or by design. Oh, straight to the Birmingham player in the slot. Oh, oh, oh. that's another hit. <laughs> Welcome to Tier 1, everyone. What was it? Remember, it's... Uh, it's non-checking, not non-contact. Well, that's yeah. We always, that's what we always say. I know, but I think a glove up near the face is probably counted as more than just uh, a, a little coming together. Uh, the, look, it's the, play, the refs are letting him play. Yeah, it is the playoffs after all. Isn't it? Isn't it? Dumped in the corner. That's a... Well, well, well picked up there. We just needed to get that one away quicker. Here's Oran. Carries. One hand on the stick. Good back check there. Wiltshire. It's a bold statement wearing the half visor at this level. Oh, I can't. It makes me cringe. I've, I've, cause I've, lost the I've lost the tooth in it. Yeah. Especially when a lot of them go like Mask of Zorro style with a stick. Um, oh, Danger Zone. Oh, I'm not sure that was a Danger Zone. Or, or that, oh, but, <laughs> that definitely was a Danger was. Zone, yeah. <laughs> 77 viewers so far. Kelo. Two Finland stickers on his helmet. Just in case you, just in case you didn't see on his back. Yeah, he is. Uh, Good flow. Oh, here we go. Here's a chance, Wiltshire. Big speed. Oh, uh, and there we go. Alexander Dawes did well there not to fall over. Have we got, have we got a check count? Well, I don't know. The check, the check count's way higher than the <laughs> shot count. Anyway, here's Tinkler. Tinkler! Oh, oh, he rattles the post! Oh, they can't hit the target. Birmingham just dump it down the ice. That's an icing. An icing for Birmingham. I like the way number 43, when he dumped it, just sort of stopped skating. I'll well, just conserve my energy now. I've no have ice that. <laughs> They're playing for the draw. So six minutes to go. Still plenty of time. Here comes Helber, who I said earlier might be dangerous in this this uh, tournament. 
Tinkler, his line mate, has been pretty dangerous. Well, my, my, I was saying my money's on Tinkler. Pass out. Dawes. Dawes. Oh, he's kind of lost it. Oh, oh. Not an ambi turner as Dawes uh, from the looks of things. Oh, oh. Flipped out. Kept in. Oh, that's a nice play. Chance. Dawes now. Dawes. Oh, maybe wanted to take that shot straight away. Again, very physical in front of the net. Yep. It's been a um, fairly physical affair. Again, zone presence, no shots. It's not... Because Still only Tinkler. had five shots in total in this game. We've had about 18 checks. Here comes Tinkler now. He's Tinkler, got, shot! Got, Bramley in oh, the middle. Great back check from Dawes. Bramley. Oh, oh and he's got it. Tinkler with the assist there. Bramley from Tinkler. Should be. I think. Oran, Oran. So shot count now is four to two for. Uh, sorry, it's, it's three all. Sorry, I got mixed up who should, who was winning the shot count there. But uh, I think Birmingham, Birmingham have had some have had some good zone entries though. So I think they get a chance so if they stay on side. I mean, you, you um, I mean. <laughs> You don't do that! No. Oh no! It's a chance for a breakaway chat from Wiltshire! Oh! oh he the puck behind. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Head games from the goalie! That could be a tripping penalty on the goalie. I believe it is going to be. Oh, I didn't think the goalie touched him. I'm not entirely sure. Oh, it was because the net came off. Oh no, uh, he has called the penalty. So. Uh, Okay, so there's no penalty by, so it's still five on five. Yeah, I thought there was a penalty there because he kind of came out and just. So it came out. It's like a no arms tackle there. Referee, you know? according to referee's corner, the attacking player took off the net from its. Um, well, that 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 did happen, but I thought it was because the goalie tripped him. But never mind. Oh, punted. Oh, oh forty-seven. Desperation by it works. Oh, Oren. Oh, oh good it's a goal! 27, I think that will be unassisted. 27 unassisted for the goal. 2-0 the score now. You probably think that's put it to bed for Birmingham. Yeah. Shot count just 4-3 in favour of the Mavs, so 4 on Birmingham's goal. Bizarrely, not a lot of shots actually on target. Here's Kilo. Kilo. Oh, and that's wide. It, that was my case in point there. I just said not a lot on target, and then he uh, done that. Here we go, the ball play. All right, goalie's got options. That was not one of the, oh. that was not one of the options. <laughs> just under two to go. One poke checked. Hellbear. Hellbear. Oh! Tripped oh, over the red line. That's gone wide. That's waved. Mavs coming the other way. 
Here's Dawes. Dawes tries to flip it in. Ramel gets it. Oh, that goes all the way. Well, he's going to have a chance if he, can, if he can win the race for the putt. Oh, he's weaved it. Oh, dear. That was not the place to just leave that. Like You've got a glove for that goalie. Eh? That's out of the zone here. <laughs> There's collision behind the play. Birmingham trying to... Birmingham player trying to split the D, can't quite manage it. A casual kick from the Maffei line there, could have, gone and, could have gone very differently. There we go, Mav's coming up the left now. That's Tinkler. Oren. Put it out in front. Comes back. Oh, it's a goal! Oh, through the five ball. Number 27 again. Oh. Right, we, we've got a four. Yeah, 27 unassisted. 27 unassisted. We've got a four potato count on this one. Two, three, four. It didn't make any difference, no one realised, so... 3-0. Uh, 3-0, shot count 5-3 five, five, in favour of the Mavs. So the last game of the, the the pass before, I think it's before the ice cut off, I would think so. Bears E versus Avalanche B. Massive shout out to you and Webb of the UEA. Go on, son. <laughs> so face off, 15 minutes. Friedman. I mean, both teams have wins this morning uh, already. Yep, some good skaters on this on this Bears E team. Played well against us earlier. I think that was offside. Oh, right off the melon. The first shot and goal there. I think it would have dipped just under the bar, so we'll credit him with a shot. That's right, yeah. After the ice cut, of course, we've got Bear Palooza. Oh, we, we've been having it. It's been a, what, what is it, Bear Classico? I bear believe. Classico, that's quite good. I like that. The two Bears teams, Bear G versus Bear F. Up next. Right now, the Bears um, E team will be looking to pick up the victory against Az B. Oh, nice defensive play. Puck comes out. Nice poke check away. Here comes Austin. Oh, Oh! Oh! What a finish in the second shot. Yep. James Harmon there. I've not had a ref come over to tell us what the actual... Who scored it? I know it was 44. 
44 unassisted is uh, the official score from the ref. And that's hit away by Smith. Those, those are... Yeah. Oh, he I caught it, but it was going wide. Let's be honest. He's a showman. Current shot count, two on Avs, none on Bears. I'm not giving him that one. He's not getting this just because he caught it beside the net. Beatman, Beatman. Oh, that skipped on him there. I don't think he knew about that one. Can the Avs answer is the question. Not with that, they can't, and they've given Maine a chance. Maine shoots, poked away by Amy's. Another chance for Maine. Another good save by Amy's. He's definitely got an unorthodox style, Amy's, and got. He has played for a long time. He's, he's played longer than me. Chance in front. Oh, oh that's not what you want to give it away. Well played out of the zone. Oh, here we go. Longworth. Bear still holding on to it. Saved by Amy's. Well saved. I'm not, he was lucky there. That's six six shots on Amy's to none on the Bears. Benning. Yeah. Oh, good D from Longworth. Again, it's another aggressive goal looking out of his crease. Chance in front. Well, they hit it out of danger. I'm not sure that was their intended target, but they've done well. <coughs> oh, that was a big sneeze. Sainsbury. To Benton. Other, other stores are available. Mm. Ah, for students, uh, Sainsbury's doesn't exist, right? Oh, I, I, no, I, I've, got, I've got beef with Sainsbury because it was my local as a student. you got beef with Sainsbury? You never get chicken or lamb, though? No? Nah. Mm. Oh, ice. Ooh, ooh. Colin Ison on that one. On the line change. So maybe a chance here for get a, get a shot away for the, the, the Avs. Well, they've, they've got a line change here, so they're getting their better players out. Yep. I don't see Longworth. No, I don't. I think uh, it's not his shift at the moment, so he comes out in front. Flicked forward. That's that misses, and Harmon's got it now. Harmon, down nice. Chu. Put in front by Benton. Now Harmon. Harmon. Skates around. Oh, oh just possessed by Friedman. Friedman, one and all. Friedman. Oh, shoots straight at the goalie. But that takes a lot of concentration there from the goaltender, Luke Nelson, to make sure that you, uh, after facing no shots for most of the game so far, first shot and goal is a first save. So that's good. Beatman. Beatman rims it round. Fox. Fox is going to win that. Nice little reverse by Fox. He's got Main with him. Oh, good, good recovery from Longworth. Bears have it. Turn in the corner. Green shoots. Oh. Amy saves it. Shot in front, comes back, shot, ooh, that's wide. That's in front, chance, good save. That's eight shots so far on Amy's, just the one on Sheffield. Hmm? 
sneaked through. I thought, thought he was going to stand on his head again. Yeah. Fired around the, the wall. Benton, oh, Benton, I'm not entirely sure why she turned away from that. If she was called off, then fair enough, but... Sainsbury doesn't pick it up. Chu tries to get it out. Fields manages to hold the zone. Big Harlan can't quite get it. And I just can't get, I can't actually, I know that you were talking about Nicky's gloves, but I can't get over these pink gloves. Oh yeah, I don't think I've ever seen gloves that colour. No. Here he goes, pink. nice win. Pink and white. It's, a, it's, a, it's not like a kind of dark pink, I think, is what the... It's not a, it's not a hot pink, is it? It's like a, what, what would you call it? Oh, well said by any Bridesmaid pink? Yeah, we'll go with that. We'll go mm. bridesmaid pink. Shot's now 9-1 in favour of Sheffield. Friedman, oh, we can't quite get out there. Fox, Fox steps in. Fox tries to fool, the, fool Amy's. Amy's having a solid game in goal here. Yeah, you'll be disappointed with that first goal, but. I think he's settled into it after that. There's a few guys in this U18 that can score, they just need to get a, get a chance from somewhere. Yeah. but they're dealing well with the Bears' pressure. Fox, they probably would want that shot back again. Biedman, Biedman should have maybe just released that straight away. Fox, <laughs> Amy's does just enough to put Fox down. Fox is saying that was a trip. I'm, I'm, I'm not sure it was, it was a poke check and I think he just went down. Chance in front. Fox, oh, fool. It is where it is. Oh, double save there. Saved by the whistle there, definitely. Yeah. It's under six to go. Shot count 12 1 now in favour of the Bears. Puck just goes out just over the blue line. That by Smith. Smith gets it out of the zone, not back in by Fields. Smith rims it. Oh, oh offside is called. I'm not sure if that's going to be an all the way job or not. What have we got in the chat just now? I try to keep my phone charged but equally like engage in the chat. Shot from Fox. Oh, and that goes wide. Oh, oh. Ref on hand there. Good save again by Amy's. According to Scott McNichol, um, his leggings are also pink. Like his, his base layer leggings. Yeah. I'll look to win this. Get it to, uh, to not Jacobs. It's hard, isn't it? It's Harmon, yeah. Wearing a Jacobs jersey. Well, Avs chant started. The Avs have got quite a lot of support here, despite their A team, I think, playing next week. Um, which is which is nice to see. Here's Fox. Fox looks in front for the pass. Can't quite get it there. Here's Fox again. Shot. Good Big goal by Amy's. Current shot count 14 to 1. Farewell to Trigg, who's, uh, who's off doing things. I don't know what he's doing, but he's off. <laughs> it's 
Someone said no one's played longer than the Max Springer. No, there's that guy from um, Kent. Yeah, old school. Vince Miller. Big block there from Longworth. Oh, chance again for Benton. Good save again by Amy's. Keeping them in it. Oh, one handed though. <laughs> oh, it's blocked. Oh, it's kept in. Oh, Green can't get past Benton. Benton playing some D a little bit there for, uh, for the Avs. Green. Harmon. Harmon scored the first and only goal of this game. Shot. That's blocked. Fields can't get it through. Back to Green. Green flips it over. Amy's will get credited another save. 16 1 in shots now. <laughs> really, really tilted ice here in this uh, this last um, last game before the ice cut. Before we get the. Uh, what do you call it? The Bear Classical. Bear Cla we're, we're going with Bear Classical, I think. I think we just get suggestions in the chat for it, though. If, anyone, if anyone's got a good name for the Bears Derby. Oh, big save again. Oh, don't flip it that way. Oh, actually, that was maybe the right way to flip it in the end. But it looked like you... It looked, it, it it looked like he was taking it. Yeah, it looked like he was taking a shot and he's on net. 17-1 on shots. Flipped out. Oh, big, big face stop there by Smith to keep that from going in the high slot. I'm not sure whether they, what, if the Avs coach has anything up their sleeve to maybe try and... Uh, Tilt, tilt the favour, get some scoring chances. Only takes one shot at the moment. He's uh, keeping you in it. Number 90, you've got good speed. Yeah, Friedman. Good work in the corner there, really good work. I'm not sure how I feel about the Avs jerseys that don't have the, the like the, you know, the, the border around the, uh, the names. Like some of them do and some of them don't. Yeah. Because because ours are quite similar. We have we have like um, no borders. Here we go. Good D, good stop. There's Fox. Fox knocks it past the fields. Fields and Fox are there. Saved by Amy's. 18-1 in shots. 18-1. Oh, clock. Oh. At about. Yeah, okay, we've got a four potato count before the shot. The clock will get started. One, two, three, four. No. I didn't do the potatoes, sorry. I must be deliberate with the second. So no one noticed. It's fine. Here Fields. The one's going to in front, but now you yay. Ooh. Oh, there we go. There's a chance. Longworth now. Can he, can he create magic like he did earlier? Twice he's done it today. UEA player the trying their best to crawl <laughs> back onside. Case Longworth does get it. He's got to maybe think about going here. Makes a pass. The Bears double team him, get, keep it in the zone. Now it's that. Oh, the rest say no. Green. green. Chance. Amy's save. It's two. 20 to 1 in some shots. 20 to 1. Score only 1 0. Given the Kings goal is in competition in this yeah, game. Yeah, no, absolutely. Great game played so far. And that is all she wrote. Yeah, there we go. So, hold on. Um, so I will uh, be back um, in a few minutes uh, to, to bring you the next game. Um, we've got the ice cut now, so it'll probably be about 10 minutes or so. Uh, so don't go changing, go and get yourself a cup of tea, uh, plenty of time, and we'll be back. Thank you very much.
Hello everyone, welcome back. Do not adjust uh, your dial. I'm going to be joined by Dom. What's your saying? Bingham. Don Bingham from uh, the uh, Northumbria. I was going to say Flames there. God, that shows mage. Uh, Kings, um, who's going to help commentate on this uh, Bear Fest, Bear Classical, Bear Palooza, Bear Necessities, whatever you want to call it, uh, El Chefico, and all the rest of it. The battle of the worst part of Yorkshire, whatever you want to call it, really. Um, <laughs> I, got, I got some. So here we go. Here, here's Dom. Hello, Dom. Hi. Thanks for having me. No, that's alright. Uh, it's going to be a hard-fought game. Sheffield always strong teams. I'm going to go with Bear Classico. You're going to go with the Bears for I the think, win. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. If I was a betting man. I mean, the F's have picked up victories this morning. Uh, the F's are in. Black, G's are in white. Um, interesting, sort of, you know. Uh, we got Alex here. He's he's a, he's got a itchy trigger finger when it comes to that buzzer. I tell you. So um, for any of you that don't know, lunch is down the stairs. So. Yeah. Here we go. Face off on my bears F. Oh yeah, thanks, Alex. No, wait, no, I just leave it. I've got it now. I've got it now. Chop. Shot. Ooh. So uh, it's interesting seeing two Bears teams play each other, but I don't think it's the first time it's happened at Nationals, uh, to be fair. I'm pretty sure there was a year before where it was Bears women versus Bears F or G or something, uh, when the, the women's team were in the, the uh, this Nationals as opposed to the women's. Oh, shot wide. Could we see two Bears teams in a final together? We could do. The E's look OK, I have yeah. to say. So if it's possible the E's and the F's could end up playing each other. Uh, semi or final stage, which would be interesting. I mean, no, maybe nobody would watch, but it would be interesting. Um, and first ice into the game, no shots so far. I tell you what, that Bethany Jacobs is a trooper. She's been on this on the gorilla position since uh, since eight eight thirty this morning. Not moved since. I'm not even sure she's had a glass of water or anything. She had a cookie, I know that much, but. Puck goes wide. So, Dot. You got a TikTok bottle. What is that? Oh, there we go. First save of the match. From Key. Hands. Nice hands. It's Mountfield. He's been the danger man all morning for the, the, the Bears uh, F team. Stands out in the blue helmet. Yeah. I was saying, if you're going to wear Mavs coloured socks in a blue helmet, you've got to play well for uh, Sheffield, right? Otherwise, you'd be ostracised. Oh! Ooh. Oh, there we go. Two, sh two shots on, the, on the, the, the Bears G so far. Referee kind of found himself in a difficult spot there. Mateka. Chance here. Oh. Well, here we go. Here we break go. the other way. Yeah. Let's see if the G Speed. can do anything. Wheels. Oh. oh. He jinxed it. <laughs> Had to be that guy. Yeah. That was a proper full on topic there as well. So, because you're playing later on yourself today? Uh, yes. Yep. Half past six, I think. Half past six, your first game? Is the first game, yes. Yeah. Oxford Vikings. Oh, that'll be a tough match Ooh, yeah. to start off with. Yeah, what, what, what an interesting draw. Vikings B, of course. Yes. Yeah. 
What do you think of your C's performance so far today? Doing well. Doing well. Disappointing to lose to, uh, I think it was Manchester in the second game. But yeah. um, hey, they are showing passion. And I think that uh, the first win is just, just around the corner. I think they played the two toughest teams they're going oh, to play yeah. so far. Yeah. So. Mateka, pass it across, Ashton. And that's out of the zone. Bit of a stalemate so far. The Fs have two more shots than the Gs. But that's about all we can see. Chance here. Clock. Chance shot. Oh, oh! Finds the top of the net. Snipe. Oh. Great finish. 66 from 40 on the goal there. That's uh, Jacob Vassell picks up his first point in the weekend. So Bears F take the lead. 1 0. And shoots. Oh. 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 I think the Bears, interestingly, have been kind of true to form um, in, in picking their sides here. A lot of maybe folk maybe thinking there's merit in, in totally balancing the abilities of all three teams. But I think probably from what we've seen, each team has been a slight step above the other. Doesn't mean the G's have got no chance, though. No love loss between the teams. No. Um, shots currently, though, 3-0 in favour of the, uh, the F, so three on the G team. None on the F goalkeeper so far. Glassby, in fact, quite quite casually, quite far out his net. And we might, oh, we might want to think about getting back in, but good D from here with Suze. Out of the zone now. Bears G step in, Owen steps in. I'm fairly sure that was offside. Looked it. But then, because, I mean, I know that there's one's white, one's black, but because the jerseys are all very similar still, I think the rest didn't quite pick up on that. Here we go. Oh, and here's uh, Mountfield off to the races. Will be. Oh. oh, Will be crashes out. Takes the puck with his hand, though. Stops Mountfield getting a good attack. Mountfield's not. In Really, really quite intense in this game. Zach Jones. Oh, tipped. Oh, oh and Key does well. Keep that aside to turn that aside. Had to be aware there. Burks. Chance here. Oh. Well, there's a chance if Owen can get out there. Oh, oh and Glassby doesn't get that puck away. Owen does well to pinch. And then he falls down. Westerlin knocks it back in. Owen. Owen picks up. Ch oh, poke checked away. Owen. Owen now shot. Oh, and that's... Whispers. Just... Not quite there. Westerlin, oh, the clock. Ding. The teams themselves have to do a little double take here as well. And Make sure they go into the right bench. Yeah, you go to the right bench. You've got like the passing to right players. Just under eight left now. Still only one nil. Shot count still four nil in favour of the uh, the F's. It was wild. And approached. Oh, that's gonna hurt. That's given up the body. Jones. Kill your Smoked. training partner. Smoked wild. Gladhill can't get it in. Roof and then will be after it. Oh, that kicks off the wall. Not back by Barker. Oh, they've got to be alive to these things. Glasby acting as a sweeper. He's still not had a shot and goal. He's had the puck a few times, but he's not had a shot and goal yet. The claw. Oh! Oh, and that collision. Bears everywhere. Put bear pile on in the middle of the ice. Here's Mountfield. Mountfield. 
clock. Oh, that looked like it was off the puck and, and unnecessary. Mountfield's thinking about a big one-time clapper there, but puck not oh. past him, and the clock misses it altogether. Here's Ashton. Back to Mountfield. Mountfield shoots. Good save by Key. Can Bears G withhold this pressure? 5 0 in shots so far. Oh, and it's broken up. Mountfield. That's flicked in. Glassby again touching Gotta be the puck. Oh, he's put himself under a little bit of pressure there. Oh, and none of the none of the Bears' uh, Gs were really paying attention when that puck was picked up in the corner. And that almost was a breakaway chance for Mountfield. Bears G looking a little rattled when they, they get the puck, not confident enough to hold on to it. And it's, oh, big save from Glasby. Glasby. That would have been a turn up for the books in their first shot and goal. 5 1 so far. Mountfield. Not entirely sure what he was trying to achieve there. Talk us through that, Dom. Do you think he was, what he was trying to achieve there? Was he going for goal or was he passing? That, that Only a, he will know. It becomes a problem when, when you're asking that question, doesn't it? Only um, he will know. Oh, there's a hooking penalty coming against the G's. Five minutes to go and uh, Bears G not out of this. A minute. It's on black. It's on black. Chance for Bears G here. So it was 62 black for the hook there on that penalty. Two minutes. Too many people on the ice. Uh, not that again. Oh yeah. She's still not off. Uh, it's okay if you drop it, she's on her way off. So. Chance here. Good Ooh. save by Key on the short-handed chance. No, it's 1 6 now. There's G struggling to get this puck away. Arm goes up. So, is it going to be. Oh, it's a double minor. It's going to be another hooking penalty. Number three. Big chance for the. There's G now. To strike back in Bear Classico. Be five on three here. The, the Bears G might want to hurry up and line up so oh. they can get the most out of this five on three chance. Clock is ticking. Five on three opportunity off the wall. Chance now. Chance here. <coughs> we will be in front. Play, so they'll kill the first one, I think. Yep. Minute 20 left on the second. Mountfield comes out. Time ticks away here on the chance for the for the G's shot. Saved Save. by Key. And again, Mother's another short hand. Oh, and a little, Ooh. A little knock away from uh, Key there. Unhappy with the uh, with the challenge from Mountfield around the net. Two minutes for uh, Bears G to save this one. G's really need to sort of line up quicker. Stop, stop farting about as much. I think they've got six on. 
Um, they do. They, they do. Oh dear. Oh dear. Well, that could spell doom. Is that too many players penalty is called? Minute 15 left. So the Bears G are going to have to do it shorthanded if they're going to do it at all. I think this game might have been built higher than it should have been. Anyway, here's Matenka. Oh. Knocks it round. Got Here's numbers. Whitehill. Bears, you've got actually killing this five on three because they've got one player way, way high, hoping for the hot pass. Got to go. And this might be it. What a pass. Woofing in, but he's got Mountfield on him. Shot count nine one at the moment, but can they keep Ooh. in? Westerland keeps it in. Two into the boards. Oh, and that should be it, I think. Chance the other way now for Harewood Sues. Ball checked away. And that's it. Final shot count was 9-1 to in favour of the F team. Full-blooded contest, that one. Yeah. I think uh, if the E's do play the S, it might be a little bit of a better game than that one. That was a wee bit one-sided on the shot count. Just waiting for the signal from our assistant at the end there. You got the gear. Game summary, 9-2, 9-1 shots. So now we've got the Mavs F against the uh, against the Imperial B. Imperial B. Still people going off the ice. These people seem to have got the memo not to go right across the ice in their trainers now. Allen, this is the net. Fast start by Imperial. They've started like this every game, uh, to be fair, but. Can't afford to have a slow start in a 15 minute game. No, no. It's not like you can build up the pressure as easily. Chance. Oh, they fluffed their lines in front of the goal. Puck goes out, but they're going to have to uh, leave the zone. Chance to reset. They're still offside. Now they can drive in. Seath. Down the left wing. Takes a shot. Oh, it's a big save. Big save. It's the first shot and goal uh, of the game so far. Good save with the glove. Yeah. Nice face-off win for <laughs> the Master, but they put themselves under pressure. Oh my! The Mavs are somewhat suicidal uh, the way they play from their own zone. Um, oh. oh, and a bit of coming together there. Stephen Kent knocking knocking someone over. Childs. It's a cross. Good pass. Dobby. Can he get the shot away? Sure, what that was. Here's Kent. Chance. Good save, Dando. 
absolute carnage in front of that. Binks is not paying attention where the puck's coming out, but manages to do enough to put them off. Two Mavs that goes through there. Mavs just can't get out. No, the same problem they had earlier on. Oh. Another great save by Dando. Fantastic. It's relentless. It's a shooting gallery at the moment for the for the, the Devils B. The Devils V, unfortunately, had to face the Vikings B this year and got uh, shellacking uh, a couple of times, I think, would be fair to say. Some effective defence from the floor there. Yeah. Ken. Big Another save. good save by Dando. Mav still struggling to get it out. Might have a chance here, though. Oh, nice puck check. Mav's also struggling to change. Five shots to nil so far. Much needed breather for the Mavericks defence there. Yeah. I think it was the right thing to do even just to get a change. Yeah, fresh players on. Puck dumped down nice. Good chase here. Nice is on. Nice is on. To be fair, the Maverick, if the Mavericks put kept skating there, I think they would have won that race. They, they slowed down because they saw the two Nottingham players in front of them. The referee might might have wanted to consider waving that as well because the Imperial player changed their skating line to stop them getting back. With the cam. Good save. Good save. Six shots to nil now. We've seen some pretty good goaltending today. Maybe the first game Dan did want to forget, but that, that yes. was early morning one with, with a hot Sheffield team. But to be fair, maybe now a bit of anticipation that they're going to get lots of shots. Here comes another one. Ooh. Well, that just goes Flight just back. wide. Victor Cam tries to put it in front. That's getting and it's cleared. Get it clear. That's cleared on, on goal. Wallace will stop that. That's the first shot and goal for Imperial. Comes back the other way. Jones, everyone misses it. And this is a chance now Big for chance. Imperial. A lot of D going to sleep today. I felt. Chance for Mavs to get out here and just settle things down. Keep that in. Hazel knock it away. Gab. Oh, it's gag, sorry. Footwork. Good call by the official. Less than 10 to go. Shot count 6 1 in favour of Imperial. Seath has got it. Two in front of the net. Bit casual by Seath. I'm not entirely sure who, what he was trying to do with that pass there. This is the man who famously uh, skied it on a 3 0 so, uh, earlier today, or infamously from his point of view. Here's Seath. Oh, chance here. oh, oh, short side goal from Seath. 1 0 the score. You have to say they deserve it. Mavs defence finally breached. 14 unassisted there is the uh, official score. 7-1 in shots now. Here's Shalalan. 
Simon is back. Chance. Another save. It's all right, the whistle's blown. You can <laughs> kick it in your own net if you want. It's fine. Nice hands. Chance. Well, a good save. Now the score. Thirty-four from eighty-four on the score there. Shots ten to one now in favour of Imperial. I think it's got to take something special from Nottingham if we uh, don't have any chance of even scoring in this game. Wallace has not been tested in goals for the the, the Devils. In there. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Just launches a stick out of the zone. You keeps it in. Oh. Oh my. Oh dear. Oh mercy. I might not want to do that again. <laughs> and it's icing, so no one will not be able to change. Awesome. Uh, not them looking rather lethargic um, already to today. It's a long old tournament. They've got at least one more game left today. Oh, oh nice finish by Kent there. Number 34 finish. unassisted on that one. Um, Stephen Kent. 34 unassisted. 3-0 now the score. I realise I've been putting them on the wrong side. I should fix it. Uh, shot count 11 to 1 in favour of the Imperial Devils. Oh, chance in front. Victor Cam. Can the Mavs. Break away. No. Oh, Friedman. Victor Cam picks up now, tries to pass it across. Whoa. I thought that was that gonna be a coming, horrible. I thought that was gonna be a coming together there. Puck in front. To we trans front that's back Victor Cam shoots, shoots wide Ooh. tries to in front oh and two oh. Down. Friedman oh trying to quite control his body there Chang. That's went all the way through. Oh, don't clip. Oh, good block. block. Chance in front, that just misses wide. Oh, and that's out. There's a chance here for Nottingham if they want it. They've got to want it this time. Oh, oh, good defensive back check by Zhang. He's done Make, a great game. Yeah. Done really well to recover. 
Birmingham, no? Birmingham, oh. Can't quite get that through. Hayes misses it. He's got his stick. Hayes, Hayes is needing a different hand to stick. He, he's done this nearly all morning, where he's played left-handed, even though he's got a right-handed curve. See? <laughs> there he goes again. <laughs> Unusual tactic. Shots now 12 to 1 in favour of in favor of Imperial. And we've got a penalty on somebody. I'm not sure who. It's like 63. Penalty on 63 for Nottingham. Two minutes. Two minutes for cross checking. So even more defending to do for the final two minutes. Yep. That's clear, that'll help you. That'll help you. That counts as a shot, because that was going in if he wasn't there. 12 2 in shots now. Not away by Nottingham. Fucking cross. Oh. 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 Good speed. Oh. Wide. Oh, he's down. Duff it. Duff it knocks it across. Shalalin. Duff it. Chance of Nottingham to reset. Just out. Dobby. Steps in. Dobby beats one, Could beats two. Away. Oh, almost got sat down. Good oh. save. Queuing up for the rebound. Oh, oh, and it's three shots there to get that one home. Oh. Oh. 66-34-7. Nottingham really putting the, uh, sorry, Imperial putting uh, Nottingham out of the misery there. Yeah, that was a power play. It was the first of the weekend. And the the shot count should now be 15-2. Just Kent. Time for one more. Oh, oh, there's a chance now. It's Binks. It's Binks. Use the oh, oh sir. It's got to be. Dolby's going in the box. Cynical. Nottingham, 16 seconds to try and uh, grab a consolation. That's offside. Yep. I think Nottingham are going to win. Tripping. Kent shoots. Nando will get an extra save right at the end there. 57. It's uh, Imperial they got the penalty. Strong performance from Imperial there. Yeah. Yep. Really showing why they're one of the favourites. Sixteen to two an end.
So now we go. Oh, yeah, we got Newcastle B against Leeds C. Two more games before the next ice cut. We'll see uh, Imperial B against uh, Sheffield G after this one. What will be Imperial's last game of of this uh, of today? Um, and the G's uh, last game of today. 66 people still watching, or now watching. What is it with people coming on without their equipment on properly? Here we go, go. puck drop. And we're off. Doig knocks it behind. Chance for a race from Murphy here. It's getting hard down the right. It's Leeds team very short bench, only nine skaters in their team. Made a tactical switch, they've now moved Sabrina Ellis to D. Ali Drury playing up front. Oh, offside eh, for eh, Newcastle there. Just did enough to disrupt the uh, forward. Yeah, Good the flow. <laughs> Good D. Castle, put the puck in, not quite. Oops, Smirek. They're into the zone. Short, oh, short side goal on the first shot for Leeds. Early goal. Can't afford to hang around. 30 from 26 there for Leeds. Great start for the Griffins. One shot, not go one goal is not a bad start. If uh, Newcastle got different go faster stripes from your team's helmets, they've only got one on this guy's helmet here. Plus, what, what's the deal? You guys have got two red stripes. This is a kind of oh yeah off off pink sort of stripe. This guy's got good on. Oh, well kept in. Oh, Ooh. Edwards needs to react. Dangerous. Oh, it does well. Shot. Oh, big save by the Butcher. Not to say Rory the Butcher's name a lot this weekend so far. He's had a fairly quiet weekend in terms of, uh, in terms of shots. There's a sniper in the stand there as one of the Newcastle players falls miles behind the play. Picked up, knocked out. Yeah, this will pick it up. Ooh. Good, good four check there. Unfortunately, no one following up. Chance Tried if to she gets there first. Here's Doig. Oh. Doig is a two on one. Ooh, good good defensive play. Had to be sure there though, because he missed that, then it was 2 0. Oh. Here's Sangari. Knocks it across. Puck goes out. Step in. It's one way, then the next. Sangari. Goes wide. Chance in front. Yeah, he's doing all right. Yeah. Newcastle now leading the shot count 2-1. to one. Been a fairly even game. Leeds have made their shot uh, counter. Smirk has now got winning the race. Oh, good stick left there in defence. 
Nellis knocks the puck away. So James Ryan across from her. Oh, tries to clear it herself. It didn't quite work, but luckily for her, Newcastle couldn't handle it. Oh. Back in the zone. Rimmed round. Good turn. Can't see her. turns and tries to full handcuff the goalie there. That would have been nice. Ooh. And that's Long a checking up. penalty. Sorry, two seconds. Seven on the sheet. Yeah. Tangari keeps it in. Well kept in. <laughs> Power play chance. Shots now two all. Two on each team. It's a race. Miss all of them miss it. Evades everyone. Oh now Ryan will have a oh. oh It's like Ryan's legs went faster than his brain could carry him there. Nice hands. Oh oh, oh another one. It's a 3D the 3D blue line. Ryan, play broken up, but just out, back it goes, Spirit can't win it, another good battle this game, yeah, you think the next goal would be crucial, oh yeah I think so, I think if Leeds grab it, Number 25 for uh, Newcastle's uh, really had a good game though. Some sick flow as well. Luca. Oh, Chance Murphy on the breakaway. Sliding with in, the... in vain. Oh, that's oh. a goal from 33. What a finish. It's great composure. Defenders hacking at her all the way in. Kept her cool. Leads with a bit of a safety buffer now with uh, seven to go. Yeah, I also just realised I put the penalty in the wrong side. Uh, the last time, but it's fine, it's fine. Um, leads with a power play goal. <laughs> Newcastle need a, a goal soon. They are going to get back into this one. Absolutely. Shot count's only 3 2. Oh, he fell offside this time. That's unlucky. Yeah. Three, three shots on uh, Newcastle, just uh, two on Leeds so far. Not been a lot of shots, but pretty much a stalemate so far, to be fair. Apart from the scoreline, yep. every time. Leeds have a chance, they seem to bury it. So. Number 33 for Newcastle might need to work on sliding forward um, instead of kind of sliding <laughs> on his bum. Like he's, you know, in, in a water park. Oh, bodies a, everywhere. A sliding challenge by Ryan there. And here we go, Leeds coming the other way now. Pucks in. Luca needs to come out, yep. he needs to come out. Oh, he's got it, he's got it this time. Well, he's going for a change, he thinks everyone's yelling for him to change. 
Yeah. He probably was on quite well a while now. anyway, so it probably doesn't make any difference. Oh, that was almost the right pass. Yep, that's offside. Yeah, good call by the official. I would say chance for Leeds to have a breather, but there's not that many of them. So no, no, weirdly a short bench for the, the Griffin C. They're normally quite, quite full benched. Um. Picked up now, dumped round. Kept in by Leeds. Oh, chance there. Goes a big in. Here's Ryan. Good speed. James Ryan. Bennett. Oh, there's a chance now. Need this. That's a great pass. Oh, good save by the butcher. Shot count now three all. It's amazing how little shots have actually been in this game. The, you know, goalie's not really been tested so far. Leeds but just <laughs> superbly clinical. Yeah. Just coming up for four minutes to go. Chance they've got that all women's line on almost. Oh, they've got James Ryan, but all women's forward line. Oh no, Smerick's on. I didn't. I didn't notice. He must have sneaked on when I wasn't looking. Oh! oh and she won that one back. Thirty from forty-two. Okay. It was thirty from forty-two. Um. Score three 0 Only four shots on Newcastle so far. Seventy-five percent. Yeah, seventy-five percent shooting rate here. I'm not sure JG will be too too pleased no. with her stats in this game. That'll at least pad them a little bit. Oh, she's let. Oh, 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 oh. oh she didn't wait for the whistle there. Um, shot count currently five three. Five on Newcastle. Three on. Three on uh, Leeds. And uh, JG. Probably giving their coach a bit of a scare there from the from the bench. And the rest of the team. Back to Ryan. Ryan, he'll shoot it. Oh, oh Newcastle's number 25. <laughs> He's doing everything he can. <laughs> everything he can to try and tem turn the tide here. Murphy. See a shepherd in front. Chance for the wildcats here if they can break. Oh, can't get it out. Roll. Inside to Rutt. Oh, oh, lost. Puck's been nabbed. No sure. Puts it in. Put in front. Steps inside. Toby Russell to Roll. Matthew Rowe. I'm presuming that's a silent W, because otherwise his, so. his name wouldn't make any sense. From Sabrina Ellis. Good back check. That's a great back check. There's nothing wrong with that either. A good poke check, just solid play along the boards. Not the best of changes from the Wildcats. Oh, now the Rowe's got a chance. Puts it on. Butcher just pokes that one away. That will go oh, to Marcus four, four save. Oh, and that's West, everyone, and Drury's again, uh, after it. Drury really powering up that ice. Oh, it stopped in the middle, whacked away. Ellis, Here we can't go. keep it, here you go, here's another chance for Newcastle. Luca this time, Luca shoots, oh. big save by the Butcher. And Smothers. Five shots each. Well, and we're down to the final minute. Face 
face off here. Oh, Leeds trying the old six tactic. Um, obviously watched earlier on um, and saw what Imperial did on their PK. Thought we'll give that a go. Um, but play back. Shot. Ronnie the Butcher stick a wee bit out his hand a bit quickly there. Murphy. Can lead Murphy. for some glitter on the performance here. Oh no, is the answer to that. Here's Drury. Drury tries to fire it. Ryan, nice hands. Ryan shoots. Oh, J Jip oh. saves it. Six shots now in Newcastle. Drury in front to Doig. Oh, it's taken away by Burton. Doig. Oh, good. Oh, Defensive play, Luca. They've only got five seconds left. Will he get that shot off? A shot. Oh, oh. now count as I say six shots each at the end there. <laughs> I'm not entirely sure, sure what happened to the butcher, <laughs> but he went down <laughs> and he managed to flail about enough to stop the puck. Slightly premature. Six shots on eight. Correct. Three 0 perhaps a bit harsh on the Wildcats there, yeah, but. Uh, Nevertheless, a, a good win for Leeds. So it's now Imperial B against Sheffield G. So Imperial B only have their goaltender on the ice at the moment. Love his pads. Yeah. Um, the uh, the Bears have their full team out. You have uh, Stephen Kent in the in the in the bench for Imperial. Oh, we've got another one. There's another person. Well, this is surely. I think I think the Imperial are flirting with a too many men a, too, a delay game penalty here. Um, Gonna have to hurry up. Well, this is uh, weird by Imperial. Um, I don't know. Uh, uh, Stephen Kent should probably know that shirts v skins is illegal in the BIJ. Um, Too many. Probably, oh. I would say they're quite lucky there, the, the, the Imperial Devils. One man's been left behind. Well, he'll just have to wait till stop and play. See, I never get this right. You're doing a tape a number on. Pick one or seven or something. Twelve. I mean, honestly. Here's you. Oh, good break up there. Oh, oh. <laughs> I wonder how many attempts that number two took. Ah, I don't know. Depends how much fibre he had this morning. <laughs> Sorry, I made a potty joke. It's not very good. Hughes <laughs> <laughs> got the puck in the corner. Well played. Back to Jurden. Cross ice. Shot. Good save by Key. First shot on goal against Sheffield. Another fast start by Imperial. Imagine coming out the door after being late and not even having the courtesy to shut it. They teach anything. They don't teach manners down in London, do they? I guess when you're getting on that tube, you can't really have any manners, oh, no. you never get on it. It's a nice place to visit, but I could never live there. Definitely a place where you need to get your shoulders out. Yeah. And the elbows. 
bit of speed being built up by Imperial here. Nice defensive work. Shalalin. Skates in. Shot the shoots it wide. Someone will tell me that name phonetically later on. Because um, I am pretty sure I'm butchering it. Chance. Steps in. Shot. Oh, nice block there by Westerland. One of these ones with the... She's got one of the weird, you know, 0-2 jerseys. Oh, yeah. I guess somebody thought they were cool. Um, back to Doyle. I love this Davies character. He's just all about <laughs> offense. There you go. There's a chance for Davies. The man. Oh, he's, he's pelting it down there as well. He's beat the icing call at least. Oh. oh. <laughs> Shalalin knocks it out. Sheffield a bit short. Oh, it's, it's a breakaway chance now. Oh, oh, and he scores. That's a great finish. That was a good finish. It's five from 90. Imperial just broke away. Too hot to handle. Into the zone again. Oh, rebound. Oh, three in the crease there. Three in the crease. It's four shots to nil as well. There's you. You steps in. You beats one. Will be putting the body on the line. Just about does enough. Oh, Kent. Oh, Kent just dumped someone down. Sheffield can't get it clear. Oh, there was some ruckus in the crowd there. I think there was uh, maybe some afters after the play. Will be. Got a chance here. Chance for Owen. Owen. Oh, and good save good by save. Wallace for his first save. Almost wrong footed him there, though. Made him a classic stand up style. You don't see that mount nowadays. Made do himself you? big. You. Nice. Oh, unlucky. Sheffield on the chase again. Jang fires it round. Ooh. That's it. That's They've it. only got two men in the, in the zone. Yep. Changes a bit. A bit lackadaisical here for the G's. Picked up. Oh, can't be stopped. It works. Nice back check there by Westerbury. Good save by Key. Giandrin tipped it across. Save by Key. Oh, it's in! It's in! 11 from 12 from 40. 11, 12, 40. Sneaks under the tendy. He won't want to watch that one back. Got it. I'm trying to save them work when I do actually get it. So Imperial will have a second. Uh, I think Key would want that back. Often didn't. Composed. Jandrin. Oh, they do this weird thing in Imperial where they put first names on the jerseys. Ugh. That's helpful. Yeah, I'd call him Giandrin. That's his first name. His name is Barandun. It's actually easier to pronounce. 
Oh, good save by Key Smothers. Shot seven to one at the moment. Seven on Sheffield, one on Imperial. Two zip the scoreline, and I've put the uh, score on the wrong side, so I'll fix that. So there you can see. Well, that's it. That's it, why? Knocked out. Picked up by Ezzy, number 90, who I've been calling Dobby all morning because his white jersey called, uh, says Dobby on the back of it. Duff it. Keeps it in. Back to Ezzy. Shalalan. Puts it behind the net. Fuck it out. Doyle. Sorry, Ezzy. Ezzy beats one. Ezzy. Oh, oh, will be. Will be, will be going for that one. He flew. He'll be spending two minutes in the box. So, Imperial with the extra man. I don't think you want to give Imperial many more kind of chances. So no. A lot of teams seem to be doing that. Yeah, tripping. Sheffield playing sensible. Sort of. Gonna have to defend this one, though. Shot! Oh, good save by Key. Good blocker. Back right to Ezzy. He's patient. Shot count 8-1 at the moment. Here he'll go again. Ken. Really do pin their opponents in. It's quite a it's very aggressive full checking. Which actually to be fair you should be doing in a PK, a, a power play, if you've not got the puck. A chance in front! Oh! Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Kept in by Westerland. One of them, oh. Davies! Oh! oh. Oh, tripping for the oh goalie! Oh my god! Russia blood to the head there. Oh. It's all going on. Kent takes down his own man. Correct, yeah. Sheffield actually got the player back a little bit earlier there, but never mind. So a chance for Sheffield now to get back into it. You think they need to do it soon? They certainly do. It's under five to go. Shots 8-2 in favour. Here's, oh, here's yes. Barrenden. Barrenden nice to you. You picks it up, four and four. No, sorry, short-handed chance. He comes Ooh. in front. Oh! Lost track of that one. Shot's 9-2 now. Time ticking away for the, the, the Gs. Just one minute 20 left in that power play. Chance for you. Imperial still looking dangerous, even short-handed. Yeah, they're pinning them in the zone again. Bad and done. Oh. Makes extra move. Oh. Sheffield playing the high man. The thing is, you're going to play that high man. You've got to be sure you're going to win the puck. Here's Wilby. Wilby needs to there we rip go. that out. There we go. Oh, that's that's actually maybe perfect geometry. Here's Wolverton. Goal is coming again. Oh. oh, can't get it on target. Binks will be there. Okie day. Oh, and it comes out. Yeah. 
do. Nice play. Oh, it's nice. Nice hands again by you. Shoots it herself. Bought by Wilby. Hit away by Wilby. Kept in. They'll come again. Essie, here's Woffenden. Goalie's Woffenden. coming again. Oh, pucks away this time. Does well. That'll count as a shot as well. So 93 in shots. Ezzy, good save. Save. Perio looking to kill this one off once and for all. And that pucks away. Chance for will be. Tried a cross, but that didn't didn't work from there. You gotta get yourself in the box for the cross. Here's uh, Shalalan. He's looked dangerous all game. There's a lot of players look dangerous in this game, but not necessarily in terms of scoring. Um, living two in shots now. <laughs> Duff it. Duff it's got it now. Oh, he tries the short side one to fool the goalie. That missed the net altogether, though. Good hacking and whacking there by Sheffield. Minute to go. Woffen then again. That standard position. He's got to do something with all these chances. Surely. Tries to oh. show hand. Oh, and there's almost a rebound. Actually, if he'd taken his time and went back, and I think he'd have scored there. But now coming the other way, our Imperial chance. Kent picks it up. End to end. But fired across. Woffenden just gives up. He's uh, it's like, nah. I, I, Asking uh, each other for it. Yeah, I'm, I can't be bothered. Uh, oh! Oh, Woffenden! He could be bothered To be then. fair, do you know why that didn't go in? It was karma for him not bothering to go and get that loose puck. Here's Keith, Steve Kent. Oh. Steve Kent. Oh, the d are tired. Oh. Sat one down. Couldn't well, find the finish. 12-5 in shots now. Good save from Key. Kent picks it up. Is there time for one more? Oh, oh he does is. get it. He gets it. Kent. Stephen Kent, I think that'll be unassisted. Okay, 34 from 66, I was wrong. So that's Stephen Kent from Victor Cam. Imperial really putting a stamp on the tournament. Imperial showing why they were one of the, the highly rated teams in this tournament. And that's it. We're going to have a nice cut now, so we we'll take a brief break. Yeah. Um, take a brief break, and I thank Dom for his time. Thanks for um, having me. And uh, we'll be after, we'll be um, back with you after this ice cut.
So we're back everyone, um, I'm going to try and get the score bug up. The score bug has worked, we've got Newcastle B in their navy against Nottingham F um, for the next game. So what have we got here? Steve Kent with a career longer than most freshers have been alive, that's very true. Looks like he's not washed his jersey since most freshers have been born as well. Um, and we've got Herd. There is a wild Hansy in the stream. Uh, that that sounds I don't know. That doesn't sound right to me. That you know, you're making me do one of these stupid Mika like trend videos now with that nonsense where I have no idea what I'm talking about. So, um, next up as I say, Nottingham will be in the white. They're lovely white shot jerseys. Um, against uh, Newcastle's absolutely disgusting navy jerseys that don't match. Um, and we've got two more games left in Group 1. Um, so Newcastle B, Nottingham Mavericks F, and then Sheffield Bears F against Leeds Griffin C. Um, and I'm not sure if we've got a table. Have we got a table, Alex? Yeah, to tell us what the, what the standings are thus far in this group. I, I think it would just be on bij.org.uk. If you're wondering... Oh, look, we've got, actually we've even brought the table here. So, so far I've been brought a cup of tea, I've uh, been brought bananas and apples, people looking after my health and giving me some vitamins. Um, so, uh, Imperial Devils way ahead. Um, they have a draw with Bears F, though, on, in their, under the belts. Um, and then we've got the Griffins uh, there in Group 1. Uh, they have one game left uh, with three wins, no losses. So that'll be an interesting one when they play Bears F. Um, to see who can take that second spot and get in the driver's seat for the cup competition, or as we've now called it, the Palladium competition. Um, and because uh, Palladium is the most precious metal in the world now because of car batteries. Did you know that, Nick? Um, also, my ring. Palladium. Were well, you giving that to the winner of the tournament? Am um, I hell? <laughs> so, um, yeah, so we've got, um, yeah, Devil's B. Um, right at the bottom, propping up the table. This is Mav's last chance today to maybe get get off the mark in terms of points. Um, and they will play the Newcastle Wildcats B, who come in with uh, one win, two losses. Um, probably need a win to stay in with a chance of being in the top tournament tomorrow. Um, but I'm sure they'll be pretty happy with their performances so far. Maybe a little bit disappointed um, with the shot percentage against them in the last game. Um, I do love... I do love the lack of effort from both teams to put the nets out, though. I try to. Yeah, it's not, it's not necessarily their job, but you just think, like, courtesy would take over um, and all that sort of thing. Uh, so it's Newcastle Wildcats B versus not the Mavericks F, FC. Now, if any of you have got a boo-boo or anything, please make sure that you uh, report that to S.A. Um, Etasalo, a.k.a. at B-U-I-H-A Dev, um, on the thing. Um... And, uh, and and make sure you tell her about your boo boo, because then she'll uh, she'll take a stat of it. She'll do not nothing to help you, um, but she'll at least have some kind of stats that she can uh, at next AGM try and justify her position. Um, so, <laughs> <laughs> so that was that was completely brutal, to Essie there. Um, so I'm going to do a little check in with Alex. Alex. Um, you want to you want to put the headset on here. So, uh, Alex, um, how are you hanging in there after last night? Uh, oh my God, my mic is so loud. I'm so sorry, guys. No, that's just how it sounds. Okay. Uh, yeah, I know. So, for those that don't know, I was bunked up, cozy with Rambo, um, who snores like a chainsaw. So I am running on a generous estimate of about two hours of sleep, but yeah. still loving it. I, I cannot possibly offer you the sound of Rambo snoring. You'd, you'd have to experience it in full. My, my wife once recorded me snoring, and then she used this decibel app to see how many decibels it was, and apparently it was like the same amount of decibels is um, heavy traffic. I, I fully believe it. I mean, what's the high score do you reckon you've ever hit? I, I think it was like 100 decibels or something, which is pretty high. <laughs> and to be fair, she'd have known, known my wife, she'd have put it right, right next to my nose. Uh, which would have been generating the most of the sound. I think at that stage you're getting into a permanent hearing damage territory. Yeah, yeah. 
So yeah, it, um, he's, he's done well being here for as long as he has. Um, puck across. Luca. Luca picks it up in the corner. I've not seen any of the uh, the Oxbridge lot this weekend, of course, everyone. Oh, chance! Oh, not not this early on. We got some we got some appearances uh, in the afternoons games here. I think Vikings B and Huskies, I'm sure. Uh, different sides of the draw, I believe. Yeah, I think so. Um, All to orchestrate a varsity rematch, yeah. I'm sure. <laughs> oh, what a backhand from Luca, number 17, with the goal. I think it was from 25 or 21. I'm not sure. 21 celebrating hard, so it looks like 21's picked up the assist there. 17, 17 from, from 21. 21. Yeah, I there think it, it was 20. I thought it was maybe 21. You're right. The celebration was very good there. Mm. Yeah, the, the Vikings um, famously, um, Vikings B famously, the only team in BIG history to ever complain about being ranked too low in something. So good for them. <laughs> this is not an player skates into the net and pulls it off himself. Um, it's, a, it's a family show here. Um, it's two, two nil in shots, by the way. I'm um, just uh, try to keep everything on. On board. So I've lost the live stream chat. I'm not sure if there's any chat coming in. If not, get it coming in. We need we need something to keep Rambo entertained. Yeah, we've got uh, what's this? Hey Rambo from Ice X Adam. What happened to Mama's Ivo's bacon? Um, well, she still sent it to me, but uh, I, there's still plenty of bacon here. But I'm trying to, you know, like not not eat too much of it this weekend because overindulge it these weekends and then end up paying for it all summer. Um, and then my beach board turns into a Greenpeace crisis. So uh, yeah, <laughs> try to take it easy. Plenty, plenty of vitamins and stuff. Did you know that black coffee helps cure grout as well, people? There you go. There's a piece of information for you. You're, you're full of these magical facts today, Rambo. Yeah, I am. I am. I feel like I've jumped in at a really opportune, inopportune game because I, I just don't know any of the players at all. Well, we can get the rosters up if Nix is still He's still got Barry. This, this iPad's huge. It's chugging well. along. It's chugging along well. Yeah, yeah. I was just trying to think, what's uh, what's the state of the table? Which, which of these two guys is... So... Currently Newcastle, if they want a chance to get anywhere near the top tournament, really need to win this game and hope for some luck. Mm. Um, Nottingham are... Oh, oh great toe this. save. And again, off yeah. the rebound. Yeah, so three, three shots so far. This is this is what we found happened a lot with Nottingham, is they kind of give up a goal early in the, in, in the shots. See, Newcastle are hitting all the right feeds. They're just not finding the finishes yet. This this guy's my favourite uh, Newcastle player today. Number 25. Butt run. Or butt run, sorry. James. Oh, that reminds me, actually, just looking at 25 there. Uh, we had a request, Rambo, to officialise the hockey hair, the BYHA Hockey Hair of the Weekend Award. I think that should happen. I'm not sure officialise is a word. But... Um, you're from Oxford, so I'll take your word for it. Um, well, there you go. Oh, here's a chance That's for Campbell. That's a big crash. Campbell, 2 no. Campbell, oh, a big save from Dando. I think that just flicked off the glove there, but nicely turned away. Oh, oh nice play. Of the Good save again by Dando. The toes on Dando. I mean, seriously, that's uh, that's an off-colour joke. We can't. It's a family broadcast, everyone. A little bit of <laughs> afters as well. I like that. I like that. That's fine. Get my a bit of fire paint. in the belly. Yeah. You get my blue paint. Um, so uh, short count currently six nil. Um, on in, in favour of Newcastle. So yeah, Newcastle currently sitting with just two points. They need they need to win here, and then they basically need Bears F and Griffins to draw, and then hope for a whole lot of magic. In fact, I'm actually they might be out altogether. I'm not entirely sure. That draws kind of mess things up. Oh, oh, good toe save again, and another one. Look at this. Are we getting a call in? I no, think that's, that's stuck in the legs. That's underneath um, her somewhere. It's not in the net. 
She's, there she goes. There there she is, go. Under the left leg. Very well held. So basically what you're saying, Rambo, is not, we're not seeing enough point production from a lot of teams. We're getting too many draws and that's... Well, we've only had one draw, two draws. But it's, um, it's more just the draws kind of caused... It, mean, it means Newcastle are kind of out of the top tier competition. Unless some miracles happen somewhere else in the competition. Yep. Oh, oh, right that's off the a, dome. This is why this level should be um, all cages. Like I, I, I know that we're in a visor, looks cool and everything, mm. but like, like when one doesn't react to protect one's face, that's when you realise it. Oh, Luca, big save again. Two saves. Shot count now eleven nil. <laughs> I think most of them have come from Luca as well. This is yeah. this is a duel now. Shot. Oh, that, that, that just went wide. I don't know. Though. There's something exciting about seeing a visor in T3 because you know you're either going to see chaos or magic. Yeah, I mean it's it's that sort of. Um... Oh, good save again. Twelve nil the shot count. And Russell. Fires it, 13 0 the shot count. Uh, this is just freaking all nil. performance at this stage. Well, Dando's progressively got better all day. Um, she's, she's I, reckon, I reckon that's the effect of the early start. You know, you haven't got any warm ups, you're up pretty early for the, uh, the morning tournament. But now you've got a couple of games under your belt, you're in the rhythm. And you're slowly starting to heat up. Yeah. I think that's all fair comment, actually. I think you're, you're absolutely... Here's Butrin. He's definitely got a, a shot at the all-player hockey team here. I mean, that, I was just... That, that's what reminded me. I was just thinking, you know, we've seen, we've seen a couple of good flows in the stands already. We're waiting to see, do they, do they hold up to their promise on the ice? Yeah. You get a couple of people flying down the wings. Oh, that was a bad call there from their official. Newcastle played that back in, so Nottingham were onside. Um, so Newcastle got away with a mistake there. To be fair, I'm not sure what Nottingham could have done with it because I've not seen them shooting this game yet. So it's currently 14 nil in shots. I mean, even just thinking beyond that, haven't they actually managed to gain the zone all that much? No, not today. Oh, Jones has lost it. Chance now. Oh, and he hits, he fires that right. Good angles from the goal. I'd maybe like to see her be a little bit more out in her, by the top of the paint. Yeah, a little bit of depth. Uh, yeah. But, but um, uh, yeah, as you say, like playing, even playing on the baseline, still making a lot of the right saves and finding finding those angles to shut down. Um, yeah, I think you're right, Aaron, bro, that just stepping out an extra foot or two makes that job a lot easier. You want to play on the, as the goalie coach used to say, you want to play on the beach and not swim in the sea with the blue ice and the, the right beach in is the supposed, to, supposed to be the, um, the, the white, I guess. But. but, I mean, I think generally speaking, you know, looking at a lot of the goalies today, most of them have been pretty, pretty deep into their own net. They're not staying too far out of the top. So maybe that's just a mark of kind of the skill level or perhaps some of the experience of some of these tendies. Um, but not as many of them coming out aggressively to cut down the angles. Sometimes when you're a new goaltender, it becomes a mark of, like, idiot A-teamers constantly deking you at training. Mm. Um, and, then, and then you don't... You go too deep. And then when you play, it like, another great save. 15-0 uh, on shots now. And then yeah, when you when you get to when you get to you playing at your level, people start shooting, and then you're too deep. Um, and it's all about learning the movement, I guess. But it's just the trade-offs, isn't it? It's making sure you're not going to get. Oh, and how that went wide, I don't know. I don't know if that even connected. I think it might have just gone off a player in front. Here's the follow-up. Good oh, save. Centre mass. Double save. Oh, this Nottingham goalie is really. I mean, this really is larceny putting on a, per, uh, a performance in this game, 17 nil in shots so Dando, far. Dando is having a, a real stormer. I mean, you know, Rambo, you've been bringing up the shots every so often, but it's not a pretty story for Nottingham. And still, they're only, it's a one goal game. And again, Dando just seals it up straight away. 
you got to say that Daniel's getting the most of, the most of a weekend, you know. Getting, she is. Getting, getting the money's worth. Getting the money's worth. Absolutely. You know, it's like me when I play golf. I take 110 shots. Uh, you know, I get more money value out of it than someone who goes two under par, don't I? So, oh, chance. Oh, the save. Oh, oh no. Gutting. That is such a heartbreaking goal. That is a heartbreaking goal from Dando. It was a great blocker save, just went up, slightly lost track of the puck. And it's just bounced in off the back there. I mean, a real, a real tough stop. Once it's gone that far up as a goalie, if you're already down in the butterfly and it's just arcing over your back, there's not a whole lot you can do short of like a miracle reflex save. So It's hard to find it in there as yeah, well. You've got no real frame of reference at that point. But so again, just solid blocker. Like I'm, I'm very much liking what I'm seeing here in in, in the net. 19 nil on the shots at the moment. Um, you have to say two 0 probably flatters the Mavs at the moment. And if it's not for the goalie, I mean, uh, Dando's putting up some serious stats. If I was, if I was that goalie, thinking, okay, well, I'm getting absolutely volleyed here, but I'm making most of these stops. My percentage is going through the roof. And maybe, maybe consider. Yeah, the, you're definitely offside this time. Um, maybe, the, I mean, the Mavs maybe just want to try and get something out of today that can, they can take in tomorrow when they play their knockouts in, the, in the, what will likely be the lower tier of knockouts now. Um, in fact, it will definitely be the lower tier with Newcastle knocking them out right now. I mean, all, all that being said, like Newcastle have, have had a lot of shots, but most of them maybe not so much high danger shots. I don't know what your take on that is, but it seems like we're seeing a lot of them low along the ice, pretty much into the pads, or a couple have risen up to the blocker, but not not so many of them challenging the high corners or really finding the far post. No, no the, the, um, the, the backhand goal, the first one, was, was the best shot so far. Mm. Um, and that, that obviously found the back of the net. Um, but yeah, you're right, I don't think there's a lot of high, high danger runs. I mean, I'm just thinking some of the other shots we've seen in, in some of the earlier games, there's been some beautiful ones uh, off the post, off the back bar and out. Tried to, tried to one timer, now it's a chance. Good save again by Dando. Oh, and they're 21 0 on shots now. You, you got to feel for Dando a little bit. I mean, obviously, obviously the team in front are trying to help out, but I think she's getting a little bit left out to dry there. Uh, she's gone down, made the first save, but. Newcastle just doing really well to send that trailing person in, find the pickup, and make the easy tap in on the on on the really empty net at that stage. Oh, Ooh, and there's a penalty away. coming. Is that interference? Looks like it. Interference. Late in the day. Number fifty-five interference. Just figuring out which box they're meant to be in, but no, they found the right one. So, first time in the power play. All the way down. And that's a stat pad of that one, 22 nil in shots. <laughs> Oh dear, there's no one back there for New Nottingham. I mean, even, even short-handed Newcastle were causing a ruckus in the Ozone. Someone spins and just takes a bit of a tumble, but winding down, final 45 seconds. I think it's been, uh, it's all coming up Newcastle this game, Rambo. It is, it is. And I don't think Newcastle will be too worried about finishing this game short-handed, because they can also do that. They can just ice the puck. Um, I mean, the score line now, 3-0. Nottingham haven't looked at all like they're going to they're gonna get a shot on target. I mean, let alone a shot off target. I don't think we've seen anything. No, really. no, not at all. But, I mean, what can you say? Newcastle have just played a good game, kind of squeezed them out. Not much more to, to really be said or done, I think. So 3-0 then, Newcastle taking the win with 20, was that 22 shots, Rambo? 22 shots. I mean, the last one, fair enough, was a bit of a pad starter, but yeah. a, stat, a stat padder, rather. Um, 
We'll go to the next game once I'm once my, I'm given the command. Thank you. So what, that looked like a, a Leeds and a Sheffield to me. Yep, yep. Sheffield F now versus Leeds. And whoever wins this goes into the driving seat for um, the that upper tier, really. Um, Griffin C have three wins out of three today. A win here would see them have four out of three. Um, F, Bears F drew with Devils B. Right. Someone throw a shoe. I think uh, we've just had a shoe on the ice for the Mavs. Whoa. Oh, oh, sorry. Not a shoe on the ice. We had uh, uh, one of the coaches walking across. I'm sure we'll uh, we'll sick Essie on them in a minute. Essie, when she's mad, is bad. Like, you know, it's terrifying. So Leeds looking to go kind of comfortably top of the group then. Which, Essentially, yeah. And then this is the... Uh, the Sheffield F team took the win against the, the G team earlier on, didn't they? I can't remember some of their other They matches, certainly though. did, and they, they, they absolutely pulverised uh, Nottingham in the first game of the, mm. the weekend. So these are kind of two of the stronger contenders then from uh, this, this left side bracket. Or the left side group stage, I should say. Yeah. Battle along the wall there. Ellis goes down my, my Tinka. Goes short side on uh, Rory the Butcher. Um, I didn't start the clock there. That's uh, all right. Nice. We'll, just, we'll just run it. It's Drury. Drury knocks it back to Ellis. Sabrina Ellis across ice. That's a great pass to Murphy. I mean, that's that's some vision. I think, you know, that shows, right? Rambo leads are, leads are taking some comfortable wins. They're finding some of these stretch passes the other teams aren't even really looking to make. Yeah, Sabrina Ellis has certainly had a good start to the tournament. Good save by Rory the Butcher. Yeah, Leeds, um, interestingly, just pointed out there from the, 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 voice, in the, the voice in the sky, um, Beth uh, Jacobs, um, that Leeds have more bench coaches and well-wishers than they actually do players um, on the bench. I mean, something to be said for a strong, uh, strong supporting culture. Uh, there is, but, you know. A few more subs wouldn't hurt. But look at this now with speed. That's a little Ryan. bit too... You've got to go north-south uh, when you're in your own zone a lot more than you go east-west. So that's when you get in trouble like, like um, Ryan did there. This is some good hustle, though, from the captain, leading the troops very much from the front. Oh, just oh, fans on that no. pass, though. That's dangerous. Rory the Butcher now made two saves in this game. Fairly easy to turn that one aside. Not too, uh, not too much trouble this early on. There's literally four Sheffield players offside. Not, not anymore, but they were. And now we're going to have an icing. Oh, wave because the goalie came away. out, yeah. Oh, Lawson Glassby come out. Oh, it's just wobbling on the edges there. Some wreck you're just about got in, got on to the end of that there. I think from, what, from what we've seen uh, from Lawson already in some of the games, very active, likes to play the park. I think, you know, trying to keep warm in some of these ones where he hasn't had that much action, especially good, that, good that Bears G. Yeah. yeah. Uh, he was just kind of dropping around, doing some butterfly slides to keep keep active. And he came and played the puck quite a lot. Yeah, Probably. very much wants to be part of the game. It's a very properly KG start to this. Nice hands by Wild. Wild again. Oh, Offside, let down by 25-0 in there. Mm. Just a little bit ahead of the rush. I'm not sure the ref got that correct. I could um, see it. I, I reckon I could, I could understand that call. Yeah. Maybe it was a little bit borderline, but from from what it looked to me in terms of uh, after the whistle, it looked like Owen was significantly ahead of uh, 14 wild there with the puck. So there's 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 reasonable doubt. I mean, we're seeing a very different game though. Like both teams are having at least some kind of 
action in the neutral zone, some action in the ozone. We're not really seeing the same as that uh, that Newcastle Mavs game that we just saw where the Mavs were pinned in for the better part of the 15 minutes. Yeah, yeah, that's true. So Puck a little bit more balance going on, if you want to call it that. Absolutely. I don't know if we've seen Leeds take a shot, though, yet. They've, they've got some possession time, but they haven't really got some danger chances. They've just chances. got just one, one shot. Two one is shots counted. There's not been a lot of shots, mm. um, but that's I think that's a credit to they're kind of cancelling each other out right now. And now my Tinker puck hacked over to the clock. He scored earlier on. Looks for the feedback. Sign Gary slot, picks up well, Murphy. There it goes. <coughs> that one's just blasted away a little bit into space. Yeah, sorry for that sneeze, folks. I didn't quite get the sneeze button in time. I played off the wall. My tanker. My tanker steps in. Beats one. Knocked away. Jones. Blocked. Drury's after it. It's knocked away. Here's Hayward Sues. To the clock. The clock steps in. Shoots. Oh, that was wide. i got to say, very active defence here from a lot of the Leeds players. Like, they're, they're checking up hard on, on this uh, defensive uh, pressure. Like, lots of pucks stripped away. I think we're getting... What are we getting? I'm not entirely sure. We've got a penalty in somebody, I think. It's just who, who is it? Oh, oh it's uh, 20. 20 Leeds getting sorry. tagged up. We'll figure out what it is in just a second here. Two minutes hooking oh, on Ailey Doig. Um, I personally didn't catch that one, but clearly the ref's got a better view of it than me. I've got, I've got one of the roof I, supports I right that, in my field of view, Rambo. I think it actually might be a, a case of mistaken identity. I thought, I thought it was Ali Drury that should have went for the penalty there, but um, swept all the way back out there by Sheffield. That looks like it's pretty it's an clear icing. They icing. don't want to do that on the power play. Yeah, it really kills your momentum, especially in a running clock game. Well, yeah, I, I was just going to say that totally destroys any kind of man advantage you've got because the timer is not obviously stopping. So you're just you're just whiling away your own five on four. Yeah, your leads here should you should line up slower, um, really play for as much time as possible. Yeah, but I, I guess I guess at this level the players just want to play, right? They, mm. They've not got all that in their head. Oh, well, that goes wide there. A lot more movement from Rory the Butcher than in previous years. Um, he, is, he is staying down though, quite quite a long time. I think he's yeah, well, he, he, yeah, well, that's economizing all, the movement. That's been a, that's been a treat, mm. but um, he seems to be staying up before the shot now. So that's a new thing. Ooh, oh, just, that's got to be a penalty shoot. No, no, they say. I, 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 I mean, Captain thought, Ryan there, grafting hard for that. I thought that was a penalty. I have to see, Merrick. Oh, and that's saved by Glasby. I don't think Glasby knew where that went. I think it's just tucked up in his chest there. And that's just a, behind him, saw, thought it trickled through. Yeah, that's just the first shot of the game as well. Two shots on each goalie. Somebody talking about half cage on there. I've seen them before. It seems to defeat the purpose for me, having a half cage. I mean, I just like the idea of, of following up that hockey head team with the equipment team. Someone said it in the chat, but we've said, I've already seen some fantastic glove and stick combos we've had some neon I think there was some pink and white earlier yeah the pink and white uh, from Smith UEA from UEA and then we've got uh, Metro's has Nicole, got some neon Nicole, dream yeah Nicole Richardson always uh, always uh, likes to be seen I reckon as soon as we get to the afternoon as well we're going to see some uh, some funky setups I know one of the one of the Oxford guys has, has got a full red outfit red pants gloves and helmet the red baron <laughs> So I'm, I'm sure we can, along with the hockey hair, the hockey oh, hair Son Gary just about got himself a delay game penalty there. Oh, just, just dropped before the glass. Just, just dropped into the glass. Looked like it was going over. St. Gary now stops. Oh, 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 oh. A wee bit too casual. Manteca to Clout. Oh, Saved start. by the Butcher. Nicely held. There are only three on Leeds now, two on Sheffield. 
even when we've seen, uh, I mean, maybe this is just a theme of this this weekend here, Rambo, but even when we've seen some of the danger chances, so much of them, so many of them rather, are going centre mass straight away. I think uh, people are just keen to rip the puck on net and not really too concerned about the placement, but it means a lot of the goalies are making a lot, a lot of easier saves that could be a lot more difficult. Yeah, I mean, that, Joe Sackick said in his career he didn't really aim. Oh, that's a good save by Butcher, uh, or the redirect there. Um, he, he said that he, he concentrated on getting quick shots away mm. um, that could handcuff goalies and stuff. But yeah, you got to have a shot like Joe Sackett first and foremost. I was going to so, say, maybe maybe yeah, you need yeah. a little bit more little bit more oomph on it. Yeah. 4-2 the shot count now in favour of uh, Bears F. Here's Mountfield. Oh, and that's offside. I think by a fair margin as well. Yeah, that, was number 18. that was definitely offside that time. Um, no question. Face off now. Ryan. Oh, oh. just fanned on it again. That's the second time he's he's just fanned on the outlet pass. But again, hustling really quite hard to get it back. Mountfield. Oh, oh yes, <laughs> Ryan oh. taken out by the ref there. Oh, floating pick by the referee. Long offside. Sheffield. Just Le Ryan Leeds stopped playing though. Very, very <laughs> relaxed. Very relaxed from number 18 to make the way back on side. Now Murphy has a chance to spring the break. Oh, it looks to go one on wild. one. But the, Shot the, from Semenic. The poke checks, Rambo, are just, you know. Well played in by Ryan there. Yeah, the poke checks have been good, especially from Wild. Wild all weekend's been pretty mm. locked in and, uh, you know, tapped in on D. I think both teams actually having some pretty good defensive stick work here because, you know, a lot of them, if you're, if you're getting the sticks in the lanes and disrupting the flow of that uh, stick handling, most of the players here aren't really going to be able to recover too much if you're just messing up their rhythm. Yeah. So uh, some, some good pressure applied when it needs to be, I think, from both sides. It's still score draw. We've gone through, what, 10 minutes now, just yeah. about. 3-3, three, three, four, four, three for Leeds, or 3-4, if you will. Uh, oh, chance now for a shot. Oh, oh! And it's gone in. It's now four all. That's number thirty for this, the goal for Leeds. Sumeric. I was uh, I was slightly confused, Rambo. Thirty from thirty-two. Thirty from thirty-two. There. It looked like uh, number twenty-two on Sheffield had taken one hand off the stick and was looking to to try and punch with the with the fist onto the open shoulder of the shooter there. Well, if it had worked, it would have probably been looking for you to wait. Um, that was not um, Charlotte Cramp that delivered the hit. That was, in fact, Jamie Briggs uh, that delivered the hit earlier on on, the, on Ryan. For all now. Bit of a tangle down low as Ryan again seems to be, he seems to be everywhere along the boards for this lead squad. I'm yeah. not sure, has is he, is he come off in the last five minutes? I honestly can tell you, they've only got 3D, so I don't know. Maybe yeah. they're running them long here, these shifts. <coughs> he certainly would. But uh, realistically, you know, that's all you need to do is bank one in early and just play park the bus for the rest of the game. Especially with the butcher back there, who's notoriously difficult to beat. You've got to beat the butcher, you've got to kind of move him. Um, and I've not really seen that out of many of the teams this weekend. So, I mean, even even just thinking about it now, I guess maybe maybe that might be asking a bit much of some of the players. But some of them have definitely got some shots on them. So picking the top corners is not out of the question. Because uh, as you've said, another casual, another casual offside. She's just she's disappointed in herself, or disappointed in the fact that there's an offside rule there. I can't quite tell which. But um, certainly just not interested in getting onside. Very there's, there's no rush. You know why? Yeah. Why would we rush? I mean, your team's 1-0 down, you, you maybe want to get on side so you can generate more offence. But Then again, though, Leeds, Leeds are quite happy passing it around their own zone, and Sheffield have looked pretty hungry uh, again. I don't know if you're seeing this, Rambo, but straight yeah. away offside is number yeah, 18. Yeah. Never got on side. I'm not entirely sure how you've not learned this yet. Glasby's um, having a lie down. He's just waiting for things to blow over. Shot uh, count still for all. This is definitely the most characterful goalie I think I've I've seen all weekend so far. <laughs> is Glasby? It's just he seems to be having a great time with it, and 
the less time spent in front of the net, the better, it seems. On the floor, you know, doing some stretching. Well, that's out, at least. Right, where's number 18? She's, uh, she's been changed. Benched. That was definitely offside there, I think. That was definitely offside there. Um, but they got away with one. Maybe the referees uh, not quite the same level of signal as being offside as uh, they'd have with number 18 so far. So That's out the zone. The chef will play an interesting kind of 4-1 stack here where four go in and one hangs outside the zone. I think they're playing the torpedo system rather than actually... Oh, tried to fool the butcher there. Well, Wilds, Wilds has been delivering some, some good power on these right, shots. Good double save from the butcher. Has he got that one? He has. Yeah, just yeah, that's, he's got that one. So 6-4 of the shot count now. Six on leads, four on Sheffield. And yeah, sometimes you just can't beat the meat. You're really proud of that one, aren't you? <laughs> I, can see, I can see you waiting to chuckle. Well, into the dwindling kind of final minute odd of this game. A slightly over-enthusiastic uh, poke check there from one of the Sheffield players, but oh, leads recover well. And it works better for you if you stay on side, though. That's, that helps. I don't know about you, Rambo, but unless... unless uh, oh, unless, chance for Murphy. Well, yeah, no, chance for Murphy indeed. I was going to say, unless Wild can find another kind of rocket from the blue line, this one is looking pretty... Pretty wrapped up pretty here. Sewn up, yeah. And look at that. The move off the off the half board. Oh, chance. Feed in front. Chance. Still nothing. Ryan, top of the slot. Ooh, no shot. Captain into. can't find it, but he's still hustling back. Just going to kill time. They don't need to do anything more. That's that's the right play. Just get it in somewhere deep. And that'll do us. Final shot count. Five on Sheffield. Six on Leeds. But the real thing that matters is the one zip on the scoreline. I reckon Lawson Glasby will want that one back. He's probably not, not best pleased. That was uh, Sheffield. What? Sheffield F versus, uh, versus Leeds C. It's just a never-ending stream of bears here today. Another one steps up. It is. It's like you're in, uh, in North Canada or something. It's, you know, just it's deep in the wilderness. Yeah. Right, I'm going to make sure that that last game sheet has just gone in. So I shall, I shall love you and leave you for now, Rambo. But I'm sure I'll be, uh, be on to hop on later on in the day when we've, got, when we've got some of the southern teams playing. The ones I know. Could I say hi to Charlotte Webb for you? Um, if she's on the ice, no, uh, is the answer to that. Um, but, but I'll, uh, you know, I'll, I'll, it's a nice sentiment nonetheless. So we've got, um, as I say, we've got uh, Nottingham Mavericks um, E against Sheffield E here. Right, so we're going into the next group, group two now. Bears E against Mavs E. And for those of you at home, well done if you're keeping up to date with what Bears team is what and what Mavs team is what, because there's quite a lot of them here. And even later tonight, you're going to see another Bears team and another Mavs team um, as we go into tier two on check-in tournament. That's dumped wide. Main. Main. Oh. oh, oh, oh. By Branley. Here's Jacobs. J uh, that's not Jacobs. That's Harmon. Harmon knocks it back. Green. You know, the wall. Main. 
Green picks it up. Green fires it in the middle. It's now picked up by the Mavs going the other way now. No shots and goal so far. Tinkler can't get through. Puck knocked away. Picked up by Wright. Wright puts it out of the zone. Harmon. Harmon. Misses the net. Still no shots on goal yet. Good poke check away by Tinkler. Green. Green tries to knock it off the wall. Bramley stops it. Tinkler. Oh, and a toe pick and a half there. Sends Fox to the ice. Puck goes in the corner. Bears battling hard for it. Bit of collision behind. Now the Bears come the other way. Oh, and there's a penalty coming for somebody. Oh, 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 oh. And Wong has got in the box. Two minutes for tripping for number eight. And now the Mavs on the power play. Oh, that's tipped in front. Back, not to cross. Good poke check, Main. Main's coming the other way. He's got no one to beat except the goalie. Goalie makes a save. First shot and goal is on the Mavs. And you got. So it's one. Whistle's blown. Just half the power play left. I'll tell you what, someone has got... Is it you, Alex? Did you have a shower this morning? Somebody smells very fresh up here. Like either Lynx or something. No, it's very old. It's, it's, it's a lovely smell. See, you get like 4D um, here. Here's Fields. Shoots good, good block there by Wilshire. Fields picks up though. Back to the point. Beadman keeps it in. Despite it being a power play, there's not been any real offense generated by the Mavs yet. Pass back out, stopped on the point, shot. Good save. 2 0 shots for Bears so far, but still 0 0 on the scoreboard. Been rather tepid so far. Oh, a bit of a shove by Beedman there. Harmon stops it. Green picks it up. Now Fox in the danger zone tries to put it out front. Goalie wise to that. Flipped out. Wong keeps it in, good job. Right on the blue line there, managed to recover and keep that that attack alive. That's I'm not sure that the danger zone or a hit, but you know, uh, collision nonetheless. Buck shot, good save from the goalie. That's 3-0 in shots, and we've lost a biscuit here. Our well, ref kept one in their pocket.
been doing so far. The uh, Bears killed the only penalty power play opportunity that the uh, the Mavs have had. Shot! Oh, what a finish there! Number 19. It's Main. It came direct off the draw. Nineteen from sixteen. No, nineteen from eighty-six. Sorry, my mistake. That's who it was then. That's my mistake. I misread the number. It is, does. It is eighty-five. <laughs> so, Bears E with four shots to nil, take the lead, and now Mavs maybe feel a bit of urgency is required. Kilo out in front. No one there. Ben, Benton after it, stick lift, Benton almost gets it, Bramwell knocks it out. And Oren, oh, he knocks a puck in and then falls himself. Puck across, picked up by Fox. Fox. Wong. Knocks it across. Beedman. Beedman fires it in. It's broken up. Bramwell. At least it, it's out from that point of view. Beedman fires it back in. Or in. Wilshire keeps it in. Yeah, we, uh, we, we hope to bring back replays at some point. We've had a little bit of a, a, bit of a coding issue and stuff, so um, you just have to bear with us. There's no replays, but you will be able to go back. But then, to be fair, um, I've seen streams for other stuff that have no replays um, and no ability to rewind. So at the very least this, I mean, um, for example, the uh, the Wogs feed, I could not get that to rewind. And um, that's a save by the Nottingham goalie, despite it being a rubbish shot. Oh, and that's a good block in front. And not on the zone. Um, so yeah, um, we will try and get the, the replay back, but at least have the ability to rewind our feed if need be. Um, shot count now five zip uh, in favour of Sheffield. And the scorer of that goal now picks it up. Main knocks it off the wall. Not back off the wall the other way. And icing is the call. Less than seven to go in this one. Mavs yet to generate a shot. Five shots so far in Nottingham. One nil to the Bears. Butterfield knocks it in, tries to get it to Beatman. A chance to go the other way for Oren. Good defensive stop. Bramley puts it in, and they're clear now. So, oh, and that's fired down nice. That could be icing. Oh, a wave. I'm not entirely sure that was the right call, but I guess it's the, the roll of the puck sometimes can come in. It comes into the decision of the the linesman. Puck round behind. Green, good defensive collapse here, but they need to maybe try and get something down the other end of the ice. And Fox, he hits his own man in front of that hit Wong. Still 5-0 in shots. Bramley's sliding in there. Shot from Fox. That flips up and over. It goes into the danger zones. Fox will collect it himself. Beats one. Tinkler couldn't quite get a hold of it. Now Oren. Oren and Tinkler try to work together to get that puck and get it out of the zone. Oh, and the puck comes back to the point. And he's still there now. And that puck's dumped down the ice. Goalie moved for it, so there'll not be no ice in. In the restricted zone, but of course that's not called at this level, so... Beedman. Beedman picks it up, kicks it up to his stick. 
Fires across. Almost read by Baia. Fox. Oh, good defensive stop there. Benton puts it in the corner. Nice play. They get it out of the zone. Down the wall. Come, here comes Harmon. Harmon beats one. Harmon beats two. Harmon all alone in front. Oh, ruined it for himself. And the score will remain 1 0. Oh, sorry, I believe it is 1 0 to the Bears. My bad. Yeah. No. No, there was no shot on that. Good save. 6-0 on shots so far. Bears goalie's still not faced any any rubber in this game. Felbert can't get hold of it. Nice play by Main. Main's got Harmon on the point. Gonna keep that in. It's just out from the, the Mavs, but the Mavs look really sluggish. They need to Maybe get a change of change of line here. So the clock ticks down. No, two and zero here. Oh, and they butchered it. Oh, that was awful. Um, that was actually worse than the three and zero earlier on, because um, there was no back check whatsoever there from the Mavs. Field shoots it in, blocked. Back round behind. Puck fire back in the zone. And he goes to right. Knocks it out. Knocks it out of the zone. Comes to Benton, who misses. Wiltshire goes after it. The wall. This, some of these Mavs players seem to have been on for an eternity and not got off to, to you know, maybe generate some spe speed, fresh legs. Bramwell shoots Goddard, for example. I'm, I think he's been on for two or three minutes now. Wilshire shoots it. Good save, first save from the, the Bears goalie. Wong. Correct, yeah, 6 1. Um, oh, and Fox will win that race and beat the icing call. Fox wins it. Tries to go one way, then the other. Nice play by Wilshire to win the puck back. He's got Kilo out in front. Kilo's got it. He's on his own, he's got to beat this last person. Maybe back to the points on. Oh, he's fired it and given Benton a chance the other way. And Oren with a great, great back check. Then Benton fires it right on. Now Wiltshire's picked it up. Off the glass. Is it going to go out for Oren? Green's got it. Oren kicks it forward. But Green gets it again. Less than a minute to play. Green. Green goes round the last man. Second last man. Sorry, my bad. I didn't see that guy way back there. Oh, and it's saved. Shot front. Oh, and that comes right across. Here's Fields. Oh, and that's kicked in front. Kilo. Knocks it down nice. And you've got to think that's all over now. They had to really keep possession and rush it rather than try to dump and chase here. Sheffield will do just enough. Wiltshire takes a swing and a miss. That game finishes 7-1 in shots. 
in favour of the Sheffield Bears, Ian, 1-0, one one that's right, yep, uh, and we've got 1-0 on the scoreboard for the Bears, E. So we now got in the last game before the Ice Cup, we've got Manchester C against UEAB. Both teams doing ever so well earlier on. Bethany back. The Max really do one game and then quit on us. Oh, okay. It's because like, you're, you're the talent here. Mm. All right, so Metro Stars. Do they still call them the Metro Stars? I think they should. I don't think they ever officially changed it to the Metros. I mean, as a name, Metro Stars kind of sucks. But um, <laughs> it's the name they gave themselves. So we've got the Metros in, in the Navy um, playing against the uh, UEA Avalanche in the white. Quite an important game here. Teams one and one from this morning. This is a battle of two. Fairly decent goaltenders over the course of this weekend, and Rob Young and uh, Oliver Amies. Face off, won by UEA. Smith, he's definitely make the whole kit team with those pink gloves. Oh, I never got that warning from Max. You see, <laughs> thirty-five seconds the first game start had went into before I. Uh, turn the clock on. So um, I've discovered that the Avs B are now nicknamed the Abs, which is pretty cool. Except um, he was a useless singer from Five, but uh, so I'm not sure you want to associate yourself with that. Maybe you're taking it back. You're reclaiming Abs. Um, here comes Wilson Dixon, the uh, the old country singer. Nice hands. in front how has he still got it no one's challenging him oh nice hands from Stone chance good save from Amy's first shot on goal on the avalanche Stone in for the face off Lunch switching positions and all sorts in front of the before the draws taken. I'm at the point. Hodgkinson knocks it in. Kala chases Longworth. Longworth scored both of the Avalanche's goals earlier. Oh, it down goes. I'm not entirely sure who that was. That was Green. Hodgkinson okay. broken up by Longworth. Real battle going. Now we've got Longworth. Longworth going the other way. Longworth. It's going one on one with double over. Longworth knocks it in the middle. Oh, a touch there towards the goal. Could have troubled Young. Couldn't get it on the end of it. And the puck just pinballing around at the moment. Longworth tries to get it out, but Gurwapa's there. Comes out to Amy, is that'll count as a shot and goal, but I mean good block. Now Longworth coming the other way. Just knocks it up. Put in the middle. 
Picked up by Gurwapa. Gurwapa steps in, beats one, takes a shot. It's a good save by Amy's. It's in front, no shot on that one. Amy's just gets his sticking away. Double over, tries to keep it in. It comes out. Fletcher couldn't hold a, hold his own. Now Fletcher's got in the way of his of Pimperton. And we have a too many players penalty on, I think it's on the Avs. Certainly over to the Avs bench. Too many players penalty there on the Avs. Good block there by Smith. Kept in. Gurwapa. Can't, he gets past one. And then I think that just slowly comes out the zone there. Marsden puts it in, which gives time to Chu. Chu's got it still. Oh, Chu does well there not to, to lose that, but. Gurwapa now tries to take it. Now Smith. Smith. Knocks it past one. Smith still got it. Smith steps inside. Shoots it. Off target from Smith. Foskett. Foskett still got it. It's broken up now. And they've come the other way. Grob. Grob still got it. Amy's knocks that away. Marsden knocks it back in again. They're still an offside player. <laughs> Shouts of ice it, but I'm not sure any of them have got the handle on it yet to actually ice it. Double obber. Gets it in. Back to Smith. Smith knocks it round. Picked up. Oh, kept in by Double Ober, but it's out now by Chu. Double Ober. Here it goes. Elms. Elms. Foskett now picks it up. Foskett puts it out. Double Ober will pick up. That is um, the Avs back to full strength. Nice kill there for them. Not many scoring opportunities during that time for the, the Metros. Oh, Green took a tumble there. Now Longworth. Longworth goes round double over. He's got one with him, but he's going to take it himself. Oh, he scores! Longworth. And that's the first shot of the, the game. 18 unassisted there. One shot, one goal for the Avs. That's maybe all they need. Amy's has saved, turned away all three he's saved uh, he's, uh, faced so far. Grob. Rob of the Friedman goes in there to break that up. Rob. Friedman. Friedman. Friedman comes around the back. Back to point. In. Webb picks it up. Oh, Webb goes down. Grob. Back to Smith. Wilson Dixon tries to put it in. Smith 
it's picked up now. Wilson Dixon can't stop the puck coming out. Well, that could be another too many players penalty. The ref are a little bit lenient on that one. And now Friedman shoots, that goes wide. Young still not got a save because of that first shot, just sneaking by him. He'd been cold for most of the start of the game. Here's Stone. Oh, a fall there. Pimperton. Sorry, uh, Pimperton. Knocks it in. Races across against Double Ober. It's gone out. Oaks is staggering, and Lauren. Um, I forgot her last name, unfortunately, because she's got a nickname on the back of her jersey. Here's Longworth. Longworth, he's got a double, double overs. Trying to deal with him. Stone comes back in the back check and stops it. Pass out the zone. Maybe a quick pass there would have saw someone take the space. Pimperton, back it goes. Goes in. That'll count as a shot on Amy's. Shot count four on UEA. Only one so far on Metros. Hodkinson picks it up. Hodkinson. Good defensive play by Longworth. Showing that he can play both ways. Pop behind to Hodkinson. Hodkinson steps out. He's got good flow. Oh, and that hits the post. And now Hodkinson. Tries to flip it in. He's got another chance at it, but good defensive double team sorts out. And now Longworth makes the pass back inside, gets a 1 2 from number 24. Shot. Oh, and that just goes wide. That was a lovely little interplay there. Oh, and turned the wrong way. Green's knocked it away. Back it comes, double obber. Hodkinson will pick it up. He's got, he's got Gurwapa in the middle. Drakes a pass. Amy's reads it beautifully. Oh, and then Hodkinson comes in and wipes out. I think that's that Foskett. Back to Gurwapa. Gurwapa in front. Oh, and a chance again. Swing. Shot. Good save. Good save again. Oh, it's been kicked in by Smith, I think. I'm sure it was kicked in by Smith in his own goal. I'm not sure who the rest are going to score that to, but it took eight shots to get there. 18 from seven is the official score on it. Score now, one all. Eight shots to one. Here's Gurwapa. Gurwapa steps in. Hoping to take the lead now. Good save by Amy's. Manchester, you can see that how much that has uh, elevated their play. Just getting that goal. Maybe getting the confidence that they can do this. So nine on UEA and one on one on Metro still. <laughs> Back to the point. Metro Stars looking for a chance. That was maybe not the right play, but Grob makes the most of it. Marsden can't quite get a hold of it. Ashworth can't get out for the UEA. Green finally they cleared its own. Grob. Oh, it's a chance now for Webb. Webb, if he can get a hold of it. Oh, nice defensive back check from Grob. He then catches an edge and the UEA player can't pick up the puck. Now Green's going to get it. Grob picks it up. Grob knocks it back into the corner. In the corner against Chu. Grob now picks it up. Looking for some... So what a pass to, but a good defensive play by Green. Then Friedman, Friedman, make sure he comes out. Friedman v. Grob. Grob's the wrong way around, and Friedman now. 
break away chance. Oh, a great save from Rob Young. Chance in front. Oh, and Webb can't get a hold of it. Chester could save Amy's. Two, two minutes left. Double over. Picks up. Poked forward by Pimperton. Double over going the other way. Nice move. Gets down the middle. Still there. Still a chance for double over. Great save by Amy's. 10 1 in shots now. Sorry, 10 2 in shots. Here's Longworth though. Longworth. Oh, he maybe should have. The defence had bitten on that pass. I think he had the, the lane to the net if he had went with it. Now Manchester coming the other way. Longworth keeps it in the zone. One hand on it. Doing really well. Interestingly, really well with one hand. Chance for Pimperton. Oh, she loses it and then falls. Tight game. McCalla. Longworth keeps it in. Longworth. Longworth. Again, he's got two with him. If he could just get the, the handle on it to put it forward. But now Stone will come the other way. And Stone passes it off. Back to Stone. Stone takes a shot. S saved in a sort from Amy's. Foskett. Foskett kick picks up the puck. Past it, Hodkinson, Hodkinson. Shoots good save by Amy's this time. Not long left now. Can one of these teams take the win? Rob. I think that's probably it now that because Manchester need to come onside. And that's all. Yeah, that's what I have, yep. Final shot count two to twelve, but all that matters is one all on the scoreboard there. And they have a nice cut. Um, before we go on to the next game, which is the Birmingham Lions. Um, D team against the uh, North America Kings C. So, um, yeah, go and get yourselves a cuppa or a beer or whatever. It's, uh, I mean, it's five o'clock somewhere. Um, and uh, come back in about 10, 10, 15 minutes.
So we're back everyone, uh, Birmingham in the red, Northumbria in the white. Thanks to 75 of you that are tuning in. And it's a face-off win for the um, that was the Kings. I was having a problem with my buttons there. There's a first save for Patrick. Oh, that was so... Oh, my. It was commitment to trying to keep it in the zone, but that looked uh, painful. That's covered up. Face off one back. It's coming out the zone. Back the other way for the Kings. King C. Turn. Looking for a chance. Can't quite get it there. Oh, chance now. Oh, and that's great defensive effort from Birmingham. And going the other way. Doherty. Doherty passes it in front. Chance for Patrick's. Oh, it's a goal! Bormium's number 33. 33 from 14. Him by the Kings. Oh, oh God. Right, okay, just um you just have to leave it just now. Chance now, Birmingham break out the zone. What's that, sorry? Okay, shot, another save. Still one though. Sorry, there's a, a few, uh, a few little bugs, a few little gremlins that we're just trying to resolve. So, um, please bear with me if I'm a little bit quiet for the next minute or so.
just a reminder at the end of this block of games, uh, we will the stream will go dead um, to allow a oh, chance here for Birmingham. Um, we'll go dead to allow the uh, uh, a new stream to start, just so we can stay within the rules of YouTube um, in terms of uh, how long we're allowed to record. So 1-0 the score here. The shot count currently is 5-1. Uh, to one. Birmingham certainly uh, the team looking more dangerous. Chance now for Birmingham. They've got a player in the middle there. If he wants to make the pass. Takes a shot. Oh, that was wide. Chance for Gurr, that goes wide. Kings can't quite get it out, Gurr got it again. Mark stopped, across it goes, chance. Oh, good poke check there, and that's away. And that could be ice in. And it is icing, and the Kings won't get a change there. Yeah. Shot count is 6 1. 6 on Kings, 1 on uh, Birmingham. Okay, yeah. Right, sorry, the, the Gremlins are ironed out a little bit. Um, and I'm not no, I'm not talking about Max uh, Springer if he's not been fed. Um, we are uh, we are back up and operational on this team sheet thing, so we're, we're sorted now. Uh, this is the kind of little challenges you get at these tournaments when you especially run it with such a professionally run live stream. We're so thankful for, for Joel doing this. And here we go. Chance for number 77 for Kings. He beats the goalie. Oh, oh, oh mercy. Is the goalie going to get a tripping penalty for that? Because I, I think he did trip him. But the ref says no. Oh, the Kings there. Number 77, Henry Wheatley. Oh, we'll be devastated with that opportunity. He tried to go over for the old Alexander Ovechkin finish over the head there. Um, and certainly uh, came up short, but that could have been a big chance to get back in this game. And now going the other way. Oh, save for Patrick's. Alexander Dawes, the scorer of the first goal. Kings pinned in their own zone at the moment. Up, up the wide. Comes back, Dominic Lees. He keeps it in the zone. Cross eyes. Oh, a chance to swing and a miss from Gurr. Backhand chance goes right across the face of the goal. And then Gurr again. Matthew Gurr. Pass out in front, puck stopped there by one of the Kings, just knock it to safety, for now at least.
Oh, chance. Gar. Oh, and that goes wide. Sanderson gets beat as Hagen from Birmingham comes the other way. Hagen now. Oh, and that's. Oh, that didn't bounce. That was not a, a Lions bounce. Oh, and he, down in the danger zone goes one. The puck comes out and Hagen. Oh, he keeps that in. Number 41 picks it up now. Chance, Sanderson, is he going to go after it? Comes a little change, half a change for the, the Kings. Oh, and the other way, the, the Birmingham go. Sanderson can't pick it up. Kings are doing everything they can to, get the, to gain the zone. Birmingham doing everything they can to just keep the Kings pinned in their own end. The other way. Joshua Monaco. Monaco stops. Nice little turn move. He's going to get shot off. Oh, good save. Shot come out in front. Birmingham, good defensive play there. Number 69 stops it, but it's back out. And here comes Gurr. Gurr steps in. Shoots, and that goes over the bar. Now they come the other way, Monaco. Battling along the wall. Spin move. Birmingham player just does, does just enough. Oh, and chance for Monaco! Oh, and that's another save from the Birmingham... What is that? Wait a minute. The ref pointed. No, no, he's not pointing to it being a goal. Um, I think he was pointing to the spot, just the angle he was standing at. Shot count now 7 3. Kings starting to find some offensive groove, but they, they need to get one in the net if they're going to get a point from this game. Stole a point almost in the first game. Shot! Chance! Oh! Find the target there. And out comes the other way. It's Dawes. Dawes. Oh, misses the net completely. And it's fired across. Yang can't get it in front. Henry Wheatley loses it. And now the other way. Here's. 14 Chan, Chan shoots, that'll be a save for Patrick's, just under two left, things heating up here, shot count 8 to 3 in favour of the, the Lions. Why, when your whole bench is screaming at you, would you think you should go back on the ice? I guess not back. Oh, that looked like it went off, but he keeps it in. Nice play, Huan. Can't get it. Got a knock off the wall. Puck knocked out. Lees. Lees has got, he's given a chance here. Monaco, Monaco. Oh, it's a goal from Monaco. One potato, two potato, three potato. Oh! 
Henry Wheatley with the assist and a big goal from Monaco on that breakaway chance. 8-4 in the shots in this game. Chance here! Chance here to... Oh! But now they're coming the other way. Oh, and that's offside. Oh, what a, what a finish to this game. A grandstand finish, as they call it. If we had a grandstand, that is. King's keeping out. The star man at the moment. Wheaton. Wheatley, sorry, not Wheaton. Got Will Wheaton on the brain. I've been watching too much Big Bang Theory. And that game finishes one all. Shot count four on the Birmingham D and four on the Kings. Eh, sorry, eight on the Kings. So we're next up, we've got UE Avalanche against Nottingham Mavericks E. As I say, we've got um, three more games left in the uh, tier. Tier 3 non-check-in for today. Um, we'll be back with Tier 3 non-check-in tomorrow at 8 uh, in the morning. Um, so we've got UAE Avalanche, not, not on Mavs, B E, Birmingham Lions D, Manchester C, and Sheffield E and Nottingham Kings C, um, which will take us uh, to the end of Tier 3 for today. And as I say, the stream will get cut, um, and then we will be back with another stream um, for uh, Tier 2 non-check-in. So... Don't think if the screen cuts, oh no, everything's went haywire. Um, it's not, it's all part of the plan. It's to make sure that it stays online so people can go back and watch the games if they want to. Um, so please, uh, yeah, just um, come back to us uh, at that time. So a bit of a tepid start with the whistle early doors for offside. Here's Friedman. Avalanche have got two victories and uh, one loss today so far. Got a good chance of getting into the top tier. Knocked in though, into the path of one of the Nottingham players. It's Willsbury. Oh, Wiltshire, sorry, not Willsbury. What am I talking about? The puck is underneath um, one, of the, one of the Avalanche players there. Chance in front. But poked away by Amy's. But flipped in front. Nice defensive effort to break that up. Longworth. How it goes. Picked up by Amy's. Tinkler, Tinkler, Out in front, Smith, Q 
Good defensive back check there from the Avalanche. Only one shot so far, and that's on the Avalanche. Here's Tinkler. Tinkler. A block by Smith, who was down already. I'm not entirely sure he meant to just dive down and block that, but it seemed to work. Here's Oren. Shoots it through. Well, that count is a save. That goes through. One tied up. Pass forward, oh Pimperton can't quite collect it. Wiltshire now. Wiltshire turns. Wiltshire. It's ahead. Beats one. Oren. Probably stopped the momentum there. Probably not the right move. It's a third save for Amy's. Puck flipped out to the wall. Wiltshire. Wiltshire's shot. Oh, oh dear. Longworth there almost had the goat horns on for that one. One pop flip up the middle of the ice. Larkman. Larkman shoots. Good save by Amy's again. It's four saves he's had thus far. Well kept in by the Mavs. He's come forward. Longworth. In front, Amy's flips it forward. Shot back in. Puck picked up by Tinkler. Tinkler. Saved by Amy's. Longworth. Oh, there's a player down. Foskett's down. Referee's looking. None of them still have the puck, so technically the ref doesn't have to blow. The ref never saw a penalty, but Foskett seems to think there was a penalty, and the puck's coming towards her. She's back up and ready to go at them, and had a little hit, a little hit after the play there. Oh, and a wee slash as well, and another wee slash. Just watching Foskett here and seeing what she's up to next. Step in. Chance. Oh, that goes off the side of the net. Av's yet to, to create a shot. That's not going to do much there. Felber. Felber, back to Kilo, back to Point. Oh, that's right in the middle. Woodlife, or Woodliffe, even. There's a lot of people falling down in this game, and that's offside. Shot count currently 5 1. 5 on Avs, 1 on Mavs. Sorry, 5 0, not 1. They missed the net. My bad. Felber, Felber steps in, Felber shoots, oh that goes wide. Now oh, it comes to Felber, Felber stops it, tries to chip it back in, Being successful. Ashworth can't get hold of it. Now it comes Wiltshire the other way, Wiltshire steps back inside on it. That's good shooting lane, had a good shooting lane, should have shot it straight away. Back to Kilo, oh what a shot by Kilo! Twelve from 48. 48. So that's the shot count up to 6-1 now. Goalie's having a yard seal. None of the players heard that whistle. Oh, 
long wash the other way. Shot, oh Pimperton, that puts that wide. Which isn't a big deal. Friedman, oh, and that's offside. Tinkler. Tinkler picks up the puck. Tinkler steps in. He's got oh, he tried to find someone in the middle, couldn't quite find them. But a who is playing question is UEA versus Nottingham E. Oh! So that's an Avalanche B team against the Nottingham E team. Oh, that's a great save to squeeze the glove there. Shots 2-8. Here's Wilshire to Felbear. Felbear, good pace, good back check from Abs, but they still got a chance. Larkman, oh, that's it. Goddard, good save. Oh, and Longworth taken down. Somebody's blew a tire on the blue line there. That's not the way. Shots 2 9 now. Under four to go. Sure. Shoots a good block by Smith. Shot from Felbear. Oh, no, he didn't shoot it. He, he delayed it. Oh, Felbear! Almost the goal of the tournament there. Felbear tries to chip it back out in the middle for the Bramwell. Good. Smith is just giving up their body all over the ice. Now Friedman. Friedman's got Pimperton in the middle. Shoots himself. Good save. No one there for the rebound. Felber flips it in front. Now Longworth. Longworth. A lot of stick handling with one hand here. He's got it again. I'm not entirely sure if it maybe sticks too short for him or something. But he seems to be doing quite well with his weird tactic. Oh, 
Friedman. Friedman knocks it past one. Wiltshire picks it up though and finds Felbear. Felbear flips it forward. Finds the score of the lone goal so far. Kilo. Kilo stops. Looks for a chance. Fires it wide. One worth going the other way. Oh, and that's a beautiful hip check. If the plane checking that would make the highlight reel. Foskett got a, a bump as well for her troubles. Friedman. Friedman flips it back in. Pucks away, Longworth. Longworth collects and fires it out. Less than two minutes to go. Off the wall. Bramley can't hold it. Here's Fletcher. Smith. Baya coming back round the back of the net. Ah, well, that explains it. Longworth is the 18 goalie for the half, so perhaps used to put one hand on the stick. Here's Tinkler. Tinkler dances round two or three, looks for the perfect shot. Good save by Amy's. 51 seconds left, shot count 3-11 in favour of the Mavs. Someone's asking when the Metro's the next one. I think it's I think it's next, if I'm right. Uh, if I remember right. Tinkler. In front of Oren. Oren can't get it. Bramley though. Bramley shoots. Oh. He had a hole to shoot and he just didn't quite find it. Amy's was there really quick though. 32 seconds left. That puck's in front. Bramley. Bramley to Oren. Oren shoots. That's saved. Four seconds left. Something special needed from the Avs now. Felber. Now Longworth. Longworth has a chance. Gets past one. Oh, it falls to him. Felber with a great back check. And that's probably it now. Unless Oaks can turn and get a really hot breakout pass. No, he can't, and that's that's all she wrote in this one. 1-0 one the final score. 12 three shots indeed. So now we have... We now have Birmingham against Manchester. So Manchester will be in white. That was a 1-0 game. A good game from the, uh, the the Mavs point of view. Keeps them alive in the tournament as, as a whole. So two more games until we reset the stream, folks. Remember, just a reminder, stream will reset after... So Mavs in the white. Um, you've got one one victory so far today. And a 
real chat. I think maybe two. Maybe I've got that wrong. He's still. I think they've still got a chance mathematically to get into the top tournament. Let's have a look if they can get the Wi-Fi working in here. So. Just refreshing the tables on my screen. Hopefully they, they will come up. Um, but yeah, I think Burmy will of course have a win, a victory. Um, and the Mavs won a victory over the Kings. And face off for the second to last game of the day of Tier 3 na non checking Nationals. Comes Ren. Ren. Lauren. Um, stick lift. Oh, Dawes can't get quite a hold of it. Here's Grob. Grob now. Grob steps in. Book checked away. It's out now. Dawes. Dawes. Dawes has beat two, but he's lost the puck himself. Himself tied in knots and that goes wide. Oh, great save by Rob Young there to keep the keep the score nil nil. Birmingham try to hold the zone. They got it again. Here's Dawes again. Dawes shoots it. Save again by Rob Young. Grob. Grob. Power out of the zone. Tries to flip it forward. Wilson Dixon can't quite catch up to it. Birmingham goalie fires it away. Oh, and then down goes one. Here's Dawes again. Wilson Dixon gets it into the zone. Oh, what well, it's called. Clock is now running, folks. Um, nothing bad happened. We did get the two shots on Rob Young. Nothing, nothing happened either way. Flicked out. I thought it was an offside. It was me that was the problem. Hodkinson. Hodkinson. Got Stone in front. Oh, and he can't find him. Poked away. Birmingham. Get it to the point, double over, keeps it in. Goes through everyone, Stone has it now, but Gurr tries to break that play up. Stone. Stone tries a fake, it works. He's got Hodkinson in front. He's got McCalla, oh, it's a great goal! <laughs> 23 from 16. 23 from 16. Drop. Fires it out. Dawes. Now coming the other way. Drop after it. Thanks. Up flipped out. The Wi Fi in here is with fairly hairy folks, so. Uh, can't update you on the tables at the moment. Oh, yep, that's offside. 
That'll bring about a stop. She's going off. Brilliant player sent off. Chin strap not done up. Not sent off for a penalty, just sent off to get, get a change. Here's Gar. Nice defensive work with the sticks. Hit back in by Lees. Double over will go back for it. Swales at the other side. Marsden cuts back towards the goal. Double over takes it herself. Oh, that zone, great zone hold there. Zone held again by Birmingham. Now Manchester get out of the zone. Double over. Swales ahead, tries to find them. Back it comes to Gurr. Gurr. Half sort of stumble, fools double over. Just fires it into Rob Young. Shots currently 1 3. It's come. Oh, we're almost, we're almost Bon Jovi for the day. It's a long, long day. Good stop. Grob. Grob picks it up. Grob goes past one. Grob. Great goal tending there. What a save. He's lunged himself at it. Score remains 1 0 to Manchester. a lot of new sort of helpers up here that are ruined the day they didn't bring shorts um, you can see it just at the, the level of pers perspiration I mean Max is always kind of sweaty but the others are you know others are brand new I mean I mean Alex continues to keep spraying himself with sure or something P pass forward the country band can't find it. Now he's after it. Wilson Dixon here. Tries to fire it in front. Misses. Birmingham keep a hold of it. Here's Dawes. Been one of the stars for Birmingham today. For sure. Rob manages to find the puck. Oh, Grob can't quite get the shot off. Goes in front though, and Lees leaves it. Miscommunication, good save. Shots three all now. And less than nine to play. The 61 people stayed on. I wonder how many diehards we've had on all day. People that have forgot to switch their stream off and went, went away, some went out for the day. <laughs> um, you know, varying people, you know, what are you watching for? You're watching for your pal, your kid, your brother, sister, boyfriend, girlfriend, auntie, uncle, whatever it may be. Thank you for watching. Fired out. Here's Double Obber now. and get it fired down the wall here's Gurr Gurr tries to pass across oh it might work out double over with a great defensive stop there well looks up puck rim drowned Hodkinson knocks it past Hodkinson 
Off to the races, Hodkinson. Puck comes in front and it's covered up by the Birmingham goalie. Halfway through this one, scores to one all. Shot count three all. Well, one nil, sorry, shot count three all. Face off, winter pack. That shot's not much doing. Tries to fire in front, go Rapa! Oh, bobbled on him there and didn't get the shot off. It's a save by the Birmingham goalie. Grob. Wilson. Shoots it. Oh, and that's a good save. 5-3 now in favour of Manchester on shots. There's a Manchester player that's kind of holding themselves rather, like looking like they've hurt themselves. Hurt their... In the sternum. Let's take the camera off them, please. I'll do that since the camera guys are... Oh, now I've made it worse. I'll just put it back there. Um, hello to Matthew Gibb. Working on a jingle that should be ready soon, I hope. Um, it's all the way from Glasgow. Be here next week. It's the Stags B uh, come to look to do some damage. I'm perfectly capable of the same because they've got a really good roster for next weekend. Puck fired up the wall. Oh, that stop, Grob. Grob stops. Takes a couple of shots. So it's stopped by the goalie. Shots now 6 to 3 in favour of Manchester. Manchester. Birmingham kind of camped in their zone. They had early pressure. Now they're, sort of, they're, camped, they're camped in their own zone, which is you know, no place to be when you're 1-0 down. You want to try and get some chances. Less than five to go for Birmingham. Puck knocked out. Double Ober misses it. There's a chance here. Double Ober gets the stick in. Oh, if the pass had been there, I think there was a really good scoring opportunity. But Double Ober clears. No, it's still not out of the zone. It's out now. Passed up the wall. Chance the other way. Gurr. Gurr loses it. He's got it back though. Gurr fires across. Oh, and, and perhaps a wise move from uh, Richardson there. Not, not trying to touch that on the way past, which could have directed it towards goal. It's letting it go to safety, knowing there was no one there. Wilson Dixon can't find Elms. Blobber to number 10 Rain. But we're going to back check. Country band can't get them. Nice defence. Oh, that seems to have kind of worked. Birmingham player just put his hand in the blue line and hope they don't go outside. Uh, Manchester trying to fire it in. Wilson Dixon puts it in. They're offside, they're onside now. And no one's for checking, so there's plenty of room for Birmingham to at least get, get out the zone. Oh, nice play by Gurr. Good stops on the blue line from the Birmingham players, Gurr. Tries to nice stick by Dobelobber. Miller goes behind, fires it round. Makala, the scorer of the lone goal so far. That's good, good forecheck by Gar. Gar steps in, shot. Oh, and got a lot of mustard on that wrister, but didn't get any on the hot dog. So it's still 1 0. Now Double Lobber will fire it out. Makala, it looked like she was tagging up there, didn't need to. Skiing after it. Chance. Manchester 
fighting with everything they've got to get another chance and go, try and put this one to bed. Shot, oh, that's wide. Dixon, oh, oh, how did that not go in? How did that not go in? This team have been coached by Matt Springer, I think, because that was, that was possibly the worst miss I've ever seen at Nationals. It was, oh dear. No, I missed the net. I, I don't know how you don't. Oh, we can save there. That's uh, seven three in shots now. But wow, that didn't even generate a shot from where he was. Country band will not be happy about that. And uh, oh dear, you thought it was pretty much a goal going to happen, and he missed the net. Loads of the net to aim at too. Anyway, enough about that. Here's Dawes coming the other way. Good poke check to keep that, to swap that attack. And Hodkinson, Hodkinson battling hard along the wall. One of the all here team for this weekend. Hodkinson tries to fire it in. Hodkinson got it. A bit of a slash there from Birmingham, but Ref is quite happy with it because it's stick on stick. Stone fires it back into the zone. After it, they go. Now it comes Grob now, Grob. Steps across, trying to find a space to shoot from. Oh, and he just about handcuffs the goal. He needed to get that on target. Stone, back to the... Oh, and too casual from Grob there. Grob's got Richardson on the inside. But he chooses to go the wall route. Here's Dawes. Lees, can't find Chan. Here's Grob. Rob's got Stone on the blue line. He doesn't make the pass and he's left Richardson under a lot of pressure. He just does the right thing and just hits that puck away. A lot of whooping coming from the, from the stands here. Here's Hodkinson. Stone goes in after it. He's got Dawes there. I think this is probably Manchester's game now to lose if they have to, something drastic happens. But There we go. 1-0 the final score. 7-3 the final shot count. Could get a 10 for removing your gloves there though. As much as you think that's fun, just remember kids, not all refs have a sense of humour. I mean, you know, they don't like you to question their authority. So this is the last game before the stream will cut. Sheffield E versus Nottingham C. Northumbria C, sorry. And uh, Matt Springer's come over to talk us through that miss, Max. What What did you see down there? Did you see down there? Let me... I just, I it was it. Well, it, 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 sure, it definitely wasn't, but... But, like, I think it was just chaos around the net, but we take it. That's a good win. I think that leaves us... I don't know where that leaves us in the standings, actually, but... Whether that puts us sort of in the Nationals bracket. Yeah, the, the, the Wi-Fi in here has been a bit ropey, so I'm not yeah. being able to keep up to date with the stats. Um, so, uh, yeah. I think you still get... Was it two wins out of four or three wins out of So we four? Beat, beat Birmingham, beat Northumbria, drew with UEA and lost to Bears E. So you're still in with a shout, I think, at the top, top tournament. Yeah, so wait, we, they've still got to play the Mavs. Oh, it's just the match tomorrow. That's like, that'll be their last game of the group. Yeah, and then the knockout phase. Yeah, that'll be... Yeah, that should be right, actually. So, anyway, to business at hand. Northumbria Kings in the white. Shooting right to left on your screen. And uh, the Bears on in the black. I think Max is going to do a little bit of colour, so I'll maybe throw at him a couple of times during this. So, here we go. This is a probably important game for both teams, depending on standings, what they're fighting for at the tomorrow. Yeah, that would be helpful. Um, 
Oh, Main can't get it in. Now back it goes. Fox. Main. Main. Main shoots. Oh, oh. off the shed. <laughs> Just off the off the the uh, the flap. There's nothing worse than get one in the flap. Here comes Harman. Shot. Big save oh, again by Patrick. Oh, and Beedman. Beedman. Oh, shoots it wide. That had some zip on it, that one. And another save. I really don't like being responsible for the clock. Bonus puck. Oh dear. I hope we're not being watched by any like any of the powers that be. You know, they'll be in trouble. Yeah. Actually no, I'll be actually you'll be in trouble. You left me in charge. <laughs> if you are watching, just you know, make yourself known in the chat. Yeah, I am looking at the chat probably more than the clock, so if you wanna like say the clock hasn't started, because it's not if it's not started on for you, it's not started on there. <laughs> I was a way to stop it this time. What's going on here? It's unbelievable. I'm enjoying this game so much. So much that I want it to last about 40 minutes. Um, so it's 3 0 in shots, 0 0 on the scoreboard, and uh, we should be about three minutes in. But um, apart from that, all is well. 64 people still here. Here's Benton in a battle. Oh, and, that, and down goes the, the uh, Kings player there. Broken up. Oh, and Right in the glove. Yeah, he could have got himself handcuffed a little bit there, but he did well to kind of... It's not one of those ones as a coach that you think, oh, my, my goalie stopped that coming out. I've definitely been one of the goalies of the tournament. If you remind me of his name. Patrick. Patrick, that's it, yeah. Huss power, I think. But I, I could be completely wrong. So let's just call him Patrick. That's what I'm Yeah, we'll stick with Patrick. Yeah. I like that. Main. Tries to shot in front. There's no D there. Oh, and Patrick does well to come out and poke check it. Of course. Patrick there with a the Fisher stick. Other sticks are available, but look at that. Look at the goaltending you're getting out of that stick. All the Nationals books this year, Rambo. And Harlan fires it wide. Do you know what I mean? Four G works better here than the Wi-Fi. Uh, Main keeps it in the zone. A lot of zone presence for uh, the Bears at the moment. Four 0 in shots. Shot from Beedman. Good oh. save again by Patrick. Another good save by Patrick, and another good save by Patrick. Eight shots now he saved, and four of them in the last. 10 seconds. Oh! The YouTube chat, Max Springer's getting cut check next weekend, pass it on. Is that Matty Gabe? Yeah, it is, yeah. Of course. You're not even in our group, Matty, so. Oh, you know, great save, 9 0. On shots, that is, it's not 9 0 on the scoreboard. <laughs> What are those maroon abominations that he's wearing on his legs? Are those the uh, they Hallam must, socks? They must be the Hallam socks. Yeah. They're not Hallam socks, so why is he wearing them? Because they are disgusting. <laughs> oh, he misses wide. And you deserve to miss wide for wearing those socks. So, here's Wong. Fires in front. He looks happy enough there. Who looks happy enough? The one with the horrible socks, Harmon. Yeah. Well, he's got a couple of goals today, and there's another save. 10 nil in shots now. A little bit of afters, after the whistle. So this game here sees the Kings, if the Kings win this, they, they stay in the fight um, to essentially, well, they, they stay in the fight for the middle tier. They can't get into the top tier because of the, the points difference. Not because of the points difference, because the other two teams have five. 
and uh, they're playing each other tomorrow, so at least one of them is going to get a point. And they're either both going to get a point, or one of them's uh, one of them's going to win. So can't catch any of the the teams that are in the fighting for the top tier. All sorts of permutations. Well, here we go. Here's Fox. Good poke check. That's knocked away, and Patrick's low, double save. Oh, he didn't want to hit that one back where it was. 13 saves now. <laughs> 13 saves to nil. Wong tries to fire it. Knocked out. Back in the corner. Nobody really forechecked for that for, for Sheffield there, but the amount of pressure they've had, he, they've been doing well. Here's Wong, he puts it back round behind. Sheffield happy to just keep the puck in the zone and then try and take their chances when they get a decent shooting lead. I definitely got, they've got a player in front of them at all times. They're looking for that, looking for those yeah. rebounds. And there's no one watching that player in front, though, from the Kings. They need to make that adjustment. Blue spot. Oh, straight for the crease. You know, it's one of these where if you've got the net, good things happen. Another, Another save, save by Patrick. Wow. 14 saves now. It's not even six, six. It's just not even six minutes gone. He's made 14 saves. Oh, okay, in fairness, it's maybe seven minutes it's gone. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Bonus times we can tally stats. Shot. Ooh, that was wide there at the post. Main. Do you know, Main is actually very disappointing to me. Uh, for How so? she Sheffield. Because you think, right, we, we talk about the all flow team all the time. If you're called Main, right, like, that's spelled that way. Oh, great save by Patrick. Oh, double save by Patrick. 16 shots to nil now. It's Canadian Paul, by the way. It's Canadian Paul, is that his name? Nick's calling it one shot, one goal, one nothing. And 47 saves. And, and 47, 47 saves. 47 saves. Yeah, anyway, he's called main and he doesn't have any flow, so I'm, I'm disappointed. Another great save from Patrick now. 17 nil in shots. You know what? He might be he might be right for the 47, but I'm not sure about the 1-0. Um, another shot. Oh, nice block. Fired out. Main would be good to be played for the Lions, actually, thinking about it. Yeah, yeah. Ah, the folly of having a fun name um, when you disappoint people. Uh, here's Main. Shoots again, Patrick. Patrick, double save again. <laughs> 21 shots to nil now. This, in a 15-minute game, this might be the most shots we ever see in the history of the BIJ. I mean, it's not even halfway through. Now we've just hit Bon Jovi now. It's uh, unreal. Some Div 1 team's looking to see if he wants to transfer uni um, after this performance, I think. <laughs> Huang can't get it out. And the Bears still holding the zone ever so well. I basically haven't had to move the camera. Yeah, the, the, I mean... I mean, this is like one of these things where we could add a small area game at the other end. Um, another shot for Patrick, 22 now! <laughs> 22-0. Everyone go on your Twitter, Instagram, whatever you crazy kids are watching, listening to these days, LinkedIn. LinkedIn. <laughs> What's this new one that you get? What's it? Uh, oh, I forgot what it's called now. Oh, there's another one. No, no, that's new. The new one that was meant to take over uh, Twitter. What's that called again? Mastodon. Mastodon? Yeah, yeah exactly. Isn't Go that, on Mastodon. Isn't, isn't that a heavy metal band? Uh, yeah, they are a heavy yeah. metal band as well. Great album covers. Yeah. Mastodon, Mastodon yeah. Yeah. Go on your Mastodon, your Facebook, and let's get a hashtag applause for Patrick trending, at least in this small area of Ice Sheffield. Nice play from Harmon. The Kings, this is the whole zone time they've had, and it's been four seconds. They've got the player in front. They can't get it out there though, and the Kings, eh, sorry, Bears double teamed up. And now Harmon the other way. Harmon's going to skate with it. 
Harmon beats the last defender. Shot. Oh, oh, oh he can't oh. hit the net. Oh, dear. Couldn't hit water if he fell out of boat, this lad, today. Pass in front. Last shot. Oh, great save. Oh. What an adjustment. He's got to get there for the rebound. 24 shots. 24 shots. It's, it's exhausting watching him. 25. 25 <laughs> shots from the man. Oh, my word. It's exhausting. It's exhausting watching this guy. Try even your Bebo. I don't know if anyone still has Bebo. I'm looking along if she even knows what Bebo is. Or MySpace. They try bringing Bebo back. Yeah. But. MSN Messenger. MSN Messenger. Send us a nudge. Pop fire in. And Monaco now. Monaco. Monaco. Oh, oh covered up by the Sheffield goal. Yeah, that's not a save though, so still 24 0 on shots. Wait, Monaco is in like the principality of Monaco. No, it's like Mon Echo. Ah. I know, it's disappointing. Though I couldn't really think of any Monte Carlo puns or, um, you know, or uh, F1 racing puns. Oh, there's time for that. Oh, here's Benton. Benton shoots. Another oh, save. Oh, another save, 25 nil. He's just using that one to pad the stats, really. But it's like Nick, if Nick, Nick's saying with the one with the one one shot one goal thing. All the, all these all Patrick's doing is keeping them in the game. Yeah, the, this is the, the, the you know the age old folly. And we had this discussion on the podcast that a goalie can't win you the game, um, but the best they can do is tie. So you need some help here from his yeah. team. Uh, well, he has one chance. Oh, it was twenty six shots. Sorry, my bad. Now it's twenty seven. Somebody online's keeping keeping constant vigilance here. <laughs> They're telling me that I said 25 and it was 25 before I said 25. So there you go. Someone get Patrick an EHL contract. Oh no! What a defensive play from the. Oh, and they almost get a chance here. Kings number 69. Still in the zone. Oh. The Kings, maybe. Oh, they're saying that's out. They're saying that's out. And considering some of the wave offs we see today, that is not that offside as, as far as I'm concerned. 65 is frustrated. Yeah, 27 shots to know. <laughs> <laughs> Unreal scenes. We're, only, we're, we're, we're down to three minutes. The, the Bears have slowed up. I think they're, they've got. A, 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 Without sounding rude or anything, I think their their wrists are starting to weaken um, this afternoon because that was uh, it's been a shooting gallery so far. Fields, field shoots it, good save. Poked in front, he maybe didn't want to poke that one where it was, but he's done all right. 28 now to here nil. Go. Oh, here we go. It's Wheatley. Speed. Wheatley. Oh, good defensive backtrack from Green. It can sometimes be soul destroying having to backtrack after you've had so many shots and not scored. Another team goes the other way. But they did well there. Here's Wong. Wong fires it round behind. That might benefit the Kings. No, Harland does well. Keep in. Oh, but Wheatley. Wheatley now. Oh, Green oh, back checking again. That green is taking away Nick's hopes and dreams here. Put whacked across. Here's Benton. Benton will step in, but Fields offside. goes offside. The Kings are they trying to get a power line out here? And the Bears have went for Harmon and Green on the point. Main Beatman. And Fox up front. Here's Harmon. Harmon steps in. Huang, with absolute disregard to her own body, steps in the way. I'm not sure how that wasn't offside. Thought he was offside. Yes, me too. Here's Monaco. Oh, pushed it a little bit too hard there. All he needed to do was carry forward. 
Hugh Ang, oh, she might have got a trip penalty there if he went down. But almost out. Well done, oh. good hand eye to get that out of there. Hugh Ang on top, put down the ice. And because of the slow ice, he might, he stopped skating as well. So, um, yeah, not calling that ice is fair, um, in my opinion. Puck knocked down the ice and Beadman is after it. Could be the last and, chance. Oh, they're honeypotting the Kings. Oh, no, they've, they've readjusted. Patrick's now 29 saves. 18 seconds left, 29 saves in this a 15, OK, let's call it 16-minute game, given the one-minute free, free, free view we got. Wow. Eva, Eva disagreeing with Burke's theory that goalie can't... Oh! oh! The goalie can't win your game, but I think that it's been proven in this game because Patrick's doing everything. He's on D, tried to take the take the shot away. Oh my goodness. That was sabotage. 29. 29 shots on goal. He's on D just about scored against him at the end. I'm exhausted watching that. I'm not surprised if Patrick goes and has a good lie down now. He is going to be useless later on in the in the pubs and clubs, ladies and gentlemen. Uh I would advise to approach with caution. He might be crabby. Anyway, um, that was a great one to watch. Really, 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 not, really enjoyed watching him, his performance in goal. Yeah, 29 shots. <laughs> oh, jeez. Um, so we're going to cut the stream. Um, I'll check with Joe if he's doing it now. Um, but anyway, we will sign off um, just now, myself and Max and uh, anyone else that's doing it. Right, okay, so let's, uh, uh, we'll, we'll be cutting the stream and we'll be back shortly. Okay, cheers, folks.